I want to see if uh, how this works. So anybody in there, feel free to comment. I am going to get rid of the fucking app. The problem with this is that I uh, I have to do this every single time now until this gets resolved. Which also means I'm I'm going to be seeing my own uh, ads, even though it's me on on my account. All right. We're gonna we're gonna attempt it this way. Let's see here. Um, the main thing is I'm able to see the chat. If I leave it up, it seems to be fine. Uh, let me just try turning it sideways. No, that doesn't help. It's a very small chat window. That's the problem. So we're gonna we're gonna attempt it. Um. Let me just make sure that I think I made sure Streamlabs is, was in there. Let me snooze these fucking ads because they're annoying. I need them, but they're annoying. All right. Yeah, I don't know what happened. We had no, uh, no, no, like nobody answered at all. I, I saw there was like, you know, the Reddit posts, the stuff that I posted yesterday. Um, here, let me go back into the game here. All right, I'll pull the console up just so I can sit here and chat for a little bit. Um, yeah, it's 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 annoying. Um, there's nothing I can do, sadly. There's no workaround. There's no there's no anything else. Um, the uh, the i the app on iOS for somehow for some reason got busted. I don't know if it was because of an update. I don't have updates on. Uh, I didn't certainly update because if something's working for me, there's no fucking point to updating it. I don't care what features you decide you want to pack in there. If it ain't broke, don't fix it. That's the way I look at it. But something happened on their end, and the problem is uh, not being able to see. So, a simple remedy for this would be to... Uh, get that second monitor. The problem is I don't have the room for it and I don't have the money for it. Now I don't need something the same size as my main. I would just need something large enough and it has to be a vertical mount. It has to, you know, swap over to uh, to stand up uh, vertically. Uh, for the little space that I do have here, and I'd have to put it like side by side, but the problem is I, I legit do not have room. There there is no room whatsoever. Um Okay, so I can see that I could see that on my screen here. Alright, that's perfect. So when you guys chat, now it's even less viewing uh like screen coverage than what I normally have. So if I miss things, apologies. I'm not even going to be able to give shout outs to anybody right now because it, uh, every time I try to type in there, it says send a message. It's attempting to send me to the fucking app. It, it auto opens the app on me. Um, don't know how to get rid of it. I, I just don't. It says, and every, every option here has an open the app thing. I mean, iOS is just... Apple products are fucking garbage. I can't stand them in the first place. Uh, but at the same time... Uh, it was it was a needed decision on my part to basically save me a hundred bucks a month. Give or take. So... Let's, uh, let's get into this. We have Quinn here. Quinn's got some different clothes on. Barrett should be on the ship. Um, we are, I was doing the ground pounder quest, which was actually pretty fun. Um, let me kind of show you where we're at here. 
with skills. We're level 11, I think. So lasers is maxed out. I was even able to put one into heavy weapon certification. Okay, that was great. Um, I put one into medicine. This is surveying, which is what we had from uh, the Xenobiologist, we have this one by default. I, I put one in here because we're going to try to get to spacesuit design and eventually chemistry. Okay. And there may be some other fun things I do. Uh, we have targeting control systems. I have one rank in piloting, one rank in boost pack training. Uh, destroy five ships. Destroy five ships while on tar Like, so this is great. Um, I guess I need four more of these. So this, these two, piloting and TCS will go hand in hand. Um, obviously this is what it is, just kill enemies with the heavy, and I have a secondary heavy weapon. Uh, we have the one in fitness, and I have two in wellness, because I need the HP till we're able to start throwing a few extra things on the suit. Uh, we're going to need the HP, but the next one's going to go into Heavy Cert 2, because I have the uh, the 20 kills. Um, this is the other, and I, I found this out via testing, Particle Beams does not work with the Cutter, sadly. However, Crippling does, um, and I believe Armor Penetration might. Uh, if I'm ignoring Armor... It just says attacks, it doesn't say type. So there we go. Uh, and he's, he's level 11, we're about to level up. Uh, I return to, what's his name? Bianchi, Antonio Bianchi down in the well. Cause we, we, took, the, we took those boots to, uh, to the den. And instead of placing them in the crate, I, I sold them to Connor or whatever his name is. He was standing right there and I have nothing in sneak. So, it, uh, oh, you know what? Fucking hell, it doesn't work. Because I'm still looking at a picture of me standing... Here, let me see here. Alright, now I gotta go through the stuff again. Alright. You guys, if you're in if you're in chat, feel free to chat just so I can see. I wanna see if this goes. Captain Quinn, greetings. I had to sit through my own ads. How ridiculous is that? Man, and they got tw they have tw they have TwitchCon this weekend, so I doubt it's gonna get fixed. All right, let me see here. What do I want for weapons? Hey, Monica. I I'm sitting through an ad on my on my phone. Let me see if let me see if plugging this in works. Uh, what happens is I click on the live broadcast on the desktop app on my phone, right? So I, I just go I go to Twitch TV on my phone, and everything on this fucking thing is... You're sitting through your... Uh, hold on. Let me see if I can even see the rest of it. Yeah. Okay. So it seems to be working. Uh, I've got Heller's Cutter. You guys probably didn't see that, but you can also see the energy is now up to 6. It starts at 3. Okay, we luckily, I bought this, I forget what store it is, but it's anti-personnel and lacerate, so it's got the bleed effect, and 10 extra, or 10% 10 extra damage to humans, which is great, and I have a ton of rounds for it. Ironically, it's the same color as Heller's cut, well, sort of, so when I have them out, and he holds them the same way. I don't know why I have the Cutlass in here, but we also still have the Equinox, so they're all... And they use the same ammo, which is great. So if I need something for, like, range, I can use this. I'll, I'll normally be using these two. Um, as far as gear goes, I found this. 
15% less damage from humans. It's got decent stats. It's got all four categories in protection. The recon, the veterans, again, all four in here. Decent stats. Uh, the suit, bolstering ground crew. All four stats, pretty decent. Grants up to 100 physical. So, it's yellow and orange. And, oh, I guess it's orange. A little bit of gold up here. This doesn't really match. And then the pack uh, is just a deep seeker because while it's basic, it just has decent stats. Then 5, 5, and 20 against corrosive. I kind of wish it was more thermal and radiation, but it is what it is. And it's uh, it, weigh, it doesn't weigh that much. So yeah, there you go. Now I don't know how well this browser is going to work. I may have to... Uh, yeah, it looks slow on my end. It's not as crisp as the app was. Ship's good. Welcome, welcome. Let's go. But the main thing is that I can see you guys chat. I can't do anything else. I can't... Uh, I don't have any control over like giving shout outs or anything like that, so for now that's just how it is. I'll likely I'll likely pick up the second monitor. It's because I don't trust them to fix fix any problems. Especially it's it's an app, it's free. It's like what and not everybody does what I do. So got a doctor appointment so I have to leave. Uh, oh, yeah, no, that's, that's perfectly fine. Do what you gotta do. I appreciate it. Thank you. Um, yeah, we have to go to the research camp. Oops, let's land. The other thing is I can't... Uh, I can't... The, the, the desktop, because I'm not in, uh, I'm not in, uh, creator mode. Alright, I'm not in creator mode, so I can't see, like, who's in here, I can't see how many, I can't see anything else, I could just see you guys, uh, typing, that's it. So I'm just gonna have to make do with it, for right now, it kinda fucking sucks, but, it is what it is, right? Uh, there. So yeah, it's gonna go over there. Yeah, that's not leading me the right way. It's leading me to uranium and water. This planet has terrible atmosphere. Hurting sunflower filter. There, you see? Oh, that's beautiful. There's the level. Darth Biscuit. That planet looks like Tucson. Uh, Streamlabs, Darth. There's an, there's an issue with the... Uh, the Twitch app for iOS users. I don't know if you, uh... You saw here. Let me uh, let me pull up the console. Let me see if I can. I'll, I'll put the link in so you guys can read it. I think I still have Discord open. Give me a second here. Uh, 
Oh, I can't search when I'm in streamer mode. That's fine. Let me go back. I know where it's at. Not too far. There's there was two of them, and I'll I'll link both of them. All right. So yeah, there's the first one. Oh, I don't uh, I don't have an an open Discord. I have a private Discord. I, I haven't opened it to the public. Uh I've had it for almost four years now, it's always been like that, so it's never gonna be it's never gonna be open publicly. I ran a large server before and it was a nightmare. Just too many people, too many people not following rules. Then getting pissed when you kick them or ban them. So I got sick of it. And I'm like, alright, I'm gonna keep the same fifty people around. Because they've been they've been with me for four plus years. Uh at least on here. And we're we're all in other server like you can find me in Gamer Poet server. Um there's others. But anyway, those those are the two issues. If you open them up and you look at the like say the first one there. That's that first image where it says you cannot cheer in your own channel. That's an image right from the Twitch app. So where it says wow, and you see the little um, send icon next to the uh, bits and the emotes icon to the right on the very bottom in the uh, original posters thing, that's grayed out. You can't actually send messages. You also can't see chat. That's the main thing, which means I have no I have no control over anything. And the problem with using this, yeah, it's an absolute nightmare. And I'm I'm looking on the, uh, I tr trust me, I tried everything, I tried everything. It's it does not work, it does not work, at all. Let me make a save here first, real quick, because there's more of these fuckers. All right, let's go heavy weaponry too. So what does that require? 50 kills? This should be a no-brainer. Let's see, does that boost my cutter up any? Yeah, I went up to seven. And then the arc welder up to 27. This is the other one that, I'm, that we're using, but we're saving this for humans because this is just better. I don't want, I don't want to waste my ammo on creatures I can get away from. The nice thing is, is that they they burn. It's level five. Where is he going? Oh, we didn't take Barrett with us. Yeah, it just melts their health. Yeah, I really hope they get it solved by, uh, you know, <laughs> today would be great. Yesterday would have been great. I 
I also have to, uh, without the app, I also have to make sure that this stays open. So, pain in the nuts. I should just pony up and get the second monitor at this point. Anyway, so like I said, this is a temporary band-aid. Every time I have to refresh the screen, I gotta watch my own ads again. So I get how annoying it can be. Yeah, come to these places. Look at all the healing you can get. Oh, wonderful. Model A. Damage all systems. See that he just melts away. There's more. Now, if I take them on one at a time, I should be okay. Yeah, they're all up above me. She's inside. Are you on uh sixteen seven point two of Twitch? Uh, I could tell you in a second, Monica. Let me check here. Let me close that. Where is my, why is my Twitch app not right at the top here where it's supposed to be now? Ah, here it is, hold on. Does not say, I know I have to go somewhere to see it. Hold on. When you go into settings, where do you where do you go to? I did this yesterday, but it was it was a nightmare to find. Like it was under general I think it was like iPhone storage. Twitch. <clears throat> yeah, sixteen point seven point two. 
So if that's the if that's the newest one, trust me, Trotsky, this wasn't by choice. I mean, it was, but I I severely dislike Apple products for this reason. I, I've I've been an Android user my entire life. I had one of the original iPhones and I couldn't stand it. And I think like within that first year when I was able to go back, I did. Yeah, 16 here. So it updated yesterday. Yeah, yeah, no fix. The funny thing is, is when I watch on my browser on the phone, uh, here, let me do this. Let me see here. Monica, since you have one of these, say I want to just keep my, uh, I don't want my phone, because it wants to shut my phone off on me while I'm watching a live video. It's the weirdest thing. It's not like I'm using the YouTube app where it stays open or, or even the Twitch app where it would constantly stay open. I have no problem. Uh, where do I go to get the... To get it to, you know, not power down on me after like three minutes or whatever. That you don't know. Okay. I've done this before. It's just... Once I make my, once I set things, like once I put my settings to the way I like them, I don't change them. And when something swaps upon me, I can't stand that. And Apple does a really good job of doing that. Like I still have the original message for finish setting up your phone for Apple Pay. I don't fucking use Apple Pay. I'm not using my phone to pay for something. I'm going to use cash and that's usually it or my card or cards. That's it. I don't use Apple Pay. In Germany, you had an iPhone S. I think back in 2011. You got back to the States and bought a... Get yeah. I've always been big on the Samsung stuff. And even LG to a point. Let me just see if I can find this. Screen time, probably that. No, that's not it. That's something different. Let's try general. Uh, da, 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 da. Nope. Control center. You know, if I wasn't looking for this, I'd be able to find it. I think it's auto lock. It says three minutes and that's about when it starts shutting down. Okay. We'll le we'll leave that up. So now I just need to refresh this. 
You know, it would have been just easier if I went down to Best Buy and uh, picked up the monitor, hooked it up. All right. Somebody, somebody chat, please. Just type, like, anything. I have to go through my own ads because I'm not... When you're on the desktop version, if you're not in creator mode with these stupid iPhones, you can't... Uh, you can't, you can't, it forces you into the app. That's the problem. If literally, all right, chat. Thank you, Monica. I could see it. Can't see my game. Can't see anything else. <laughs> Corza, anything. All right. I could see you guys. And hopefully it doesn't shut the phone off on me now. Freebooter. See how quick they drop? Oh, you're level 10. You're a little tougher. Not by much. Oh, who do we have here? Yeah, who's out here? I'm out here. Kicking your ass, sea bass. Yeah, I forgot to take Barrett with me. So I wonder why my PC has been running hot where I found the fans on top were... Oh! Yeah, that'll do it. Last time I replaced my fans and did a system cleaning. I installed it backwards. Yeah, that'll do it. I did that too once, Trotsky. I was, I was doing the same thing. It was... It was only one fan. At the time, it was on my older case, so I only had room for the... Like, if you're looking at your rig with the nice glass screen, the upper left uh, on the left-hand side. That one uh, I swapped because Corsairs look uh, pretty much the same when you're looking at them from the inside. At least the newer ones, the uh, 140 mil fans. Those are the ones I have. Um with that little uh, logo, they have them on both sides. And I used to do wiring all the time. I can't stand it anymore. So, but with the new case, yeah, we've got what? We got six six fans on the right for intake. I've got one, two, three, four fans on the top for exhaust up. And then I've got another four fans, or I'm sorry, three fans on that left side now for upper exhaust. And then the three fans on the GPU, which I guess they count, so. Just turn them around to reduce this. Oh, yeah. I'm not sure what graphics card you have. I got to say, like, I, I know I posted that message um, in Discord. We just put those nice sanctions back on China again, so. But GPU prices are going to go through the, through the roof. And I got that from somebody in Lexi server who is up on all the uh, latest PC everything. Like you could sit there and talk to them about literally anything, and they 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 know about it. Or they're they're knowledgeable on the subject of I should say. And not in a not in a braggadocious egotistical way either. They're actually a pretty cool per, uh, person from what I know. So yeah, if you guys are looking to uh, update your GPUs, you might want to do it. Uh, formal slack suit? Is that like a major slack suit? See what I did there? Get it? Get it? It's funny. Laugh, minions. Not up upgrading because everyone I hear complaining about FPS loss in Starfield all running to no, not me. I've, I got a 40 series. I got a 40 Ti. I'm happy with mine, Trotsky. And I got mine for uh, 
550 bucks, Asus ROG. Because I got a deal on it at the time. I don't know what they're going for now. <laughs> Laughs in Minion. Yeah, it was it was a steal because it was... Uh, Monica, good luck with what you've got today. I don't want to say more than that, but... I'll be thinking about you. Hopefully this will be working. I'll be able to to do it like this. I'm able to see the chat. Hopefully it doesn't shut the phone off on me. Yeah, we should be good. But yeah, um, I've had no issues with my 40, 4070 Ti at all. Uh, I'm streaming. Uh, I was playing a 1500 mod setup on Skyrim while streaming it. And same with Starfield, and I don't think my GPU temp goes much over 46 to 48 Celsius. My 3060, the 12 gig that I had in my old system, while streaming would be at 68 or 70 while streaming. Of course, it was in a smaller case, but the heat sinks on the 40 series are amazing. They are beasts. I don't believe uh, AMD, and I'm using, I'm using, uh, well, I used an AIO cooler for my old one, too. Um, I just got a new one. The, whatever the newest model that Corsair has, the uh, 150. So it's like a step up from my old one. But it was only like, I don't know, 120 bucks. Give or take. So, worth it. Ah, here we go. Med packs. Mm. Oh, the shitters are here. Sometimes there's money in the bathroom. I don't know. People leave their crud sticks all over the place. This is not the place we need to be, by the way. I'm just coming here for the extra loot. We were doing uh, we're doing this quest here. Let me see here. Ground pounder. So I'm not at the research camp. I'm on a different place. The research camp is actually uh, over there. Where that little icon is <laughs> where it says research camp. I just knew that there were spacers in here. Did I get these? I might have missed these. Ah, another med pack. Look at that. All right, let's get the hell out of here. Back outside. Yeah, we're supposed to be over there. <laughs> we got here. Nope. Ah, we'll take it. Okay. My GPU temp was temp one was running seventy. Temp two is now. Oh wow. Oh, that's right. Yeah, you have two of them in there, don't you? Now they're fifty and seventy a full load. I ran Starfield a few hours to test, and temps didn't move any higher than that. So it should, oh yeah, yeah. Anything under seventy, if you're streaming it, you you're fine. Or it should be fine. 70 is kind of my, was like my threshold limit uh, for my old one. 
The only other time I ever had like severe load is when I was running Dindulad. Uh, specifically Dindulad with Occlusion. Um, and it just, it, it was a major, major stressor for, uh, for any system, really. But now with this, uh, with this GPU and CPU, uh, setup, um, yeah, my CPU doesn't see really much more than 50 Celsius with the cooler. The GPU is, like I said, sometimes it'll, it'll hit the low 60s, but that's the highest I've seen this GPU, this 4070 Ti. The nice thing about it too is the the TDP, like the draw power, is not as uh, is not as much as uh, we all expected it to be. Now the 4090 draws a shit ton. But I don't have a 4090. Nor do I uh, think I want one. <laughs> Very happy with this. Yeah, as long as you can get your temps down, you should you should be fine. Almost scanned. Oh yeah, we, here we go. Creatures. These hurting sunflower, whatever they are. Dippy doos. Hey, he's dead. Come back here, you. Yeah, they're fast, that's the problem. Look at his health just melting away. Where's your buddy? There's another one of you. Hey, Vixie. Welcome in. We're almost done with this scan. He's the one I killed. There was another one. Yeah, we got we got Heller's Cutter up to... What's it doing now? Seven with the burn. Oh, and I should probably tell you, uh, I got some of the magazines. I, I did this off because they're kind of all over the place. The Mining Monthly. Uh, we have issues 3, 6, 7, and 9. So that's 2, 4, 6. That's another 8% damage to uh, tool group weapons. There's a total of 10 of these. For a total of uh, 20%. And then there's another... Well, there's a few... Well, there's... So the Cyber Runner Cypher... I think there's 5 of them, but 3 of them increase your lasers so good they goes 5 10 15 percent so you would stack that 15 percent on top of the 20 and then other magazines that i'm looking to get like peak performance that's just for your carry weight there's a few other ones i think there's one for heavy weaponry but i'm not 100 percent sure trotsky enjoy your lurk buddy <laughs> on, on this one here it says something action trotsky has faded into the shadows probably take their pants off and action <laughs> Oh man, I got such a, a ghetto setup going on here. But as long as I can see you guys, that's what matters.
I, I love I love the arc welder by the way. It's got decent range. And then it uses the same ammo as the Equinox. But I gotta I gotta remind myself the, the cutter is the main. This is what we're going for. I, I can't I can't, you know, go revert into to something else. Hey, no, we got the spacers. Hello, spacers. Oh, wind. Welcome in. I would give you a shout out, but I can't. I physically can't. I can literally only see the chat. Uh, so I guess until I get that other monitor, which I may do later tonight or I may do tomorrow. Because they have not, they, they did an update for the, for the Twitch app and it did not fix the issue at all. I tried it. And if I try to even talk in chat here, I'm, I'm using the desktop side of my phone. Uh, it tries to auto revert me to the uh, to the app, which closes this out. Yeah, feel free to shout yourself out. And five thousand biddies, holy crap! Yeah, I'm just gonna I'm gonna pony up and just get the the monitor. I'm gonna have to. It's gonna be something small. It'll be like a twenty inch monitor or something like that. I don't know. I don't know, what do you guys use? For those of you that have, like, a secondary monitor just for stuff like that, what size do you use? I don't feel like I need something large, and I don't have the space here for another 27-inch. Because um, that's my main. My main is a 27-inch. Uh, I just need enough to... See... See the fire damage going off? Alright, there. Let's, uh... Let's get drugged up. Let's get some amp. What do we have in here? Let's get some squall going. 20% damage and 20% move. No, we got something. Do we have whiteout? Yeah, whiteout's even better. Makes us even faster. It's on. Oh, it's on! You're dead. Die. Yeah, damn it. Damn it. Damn it. Damn it. You don't know where I'm coming from. Oh, spacer. I'm fucking wrecked. What do you got? Nice. What do you got? Yeah, we'll take that. What about you bastards? Yeah, there's two of you. Hey, hey, ooh. No. We need the advanced. Calibrated stuff does not do me any good. Ah. Hey, we get 100% scan. What do you know? Ah, the space trucker, huh? Nobody likes the space trucker. So yeah, we have we have a modified arc welder here. This is our secondary weapon here. Lacerate. This is fantastic. Anti-personnel, so more damage against humans, which is everybody. Oh, energy's now up to 34 with the... Oh, great, it was just a 27. Perfect. Heller's cutter is now up to 8. 
with disassembler. And it's got a lacerate. Rateably applies the bleed. So on top of the fire, they're going to be bleeding with this one. And it's got the better range. And then, of course, we kept a basic Equinox for the long range, which is now doing 21. Actually, I think it, something's affecting this. I think by drugs. Oh, well, yeah, we, we're still in that mode. Uh... F5. Uh, my monitors are both 24, but I was given the second. Ah. I guess. Welcome in, buddy. We'll be safe now. Get back to the lieutenant. Tell Taurus thank you. Thank you. Who are you? Yeah, your free star militia. Radioed you coming, but I didn't know if we could hold out. Not all of us made it. Now there were spacers outside. You're a regular hero. Uh, so what happened here? Spacers dropped in some of their goons not too long ago. I managed Pet to get goons. most of us to the shelter. Nope, I did not, Haggis. I approached the shelter. We managed to repulse I'm them. watching on the desktop. In our favor. Then you showed up. Thank God. Which sucks because I have to look at my own ads. You know I have no control over it. I can literally just see the chat, which is all I really needed. But that's... Hold on a second. Okay. Yeah, that's that's literally all I can do is... I just need to be able to see you guys chat and know that you're able to see the screen. That's it. For now. I'm, I'm going to go... I'm going to buy a uh, small second monitor. But it's got to have vertical uh, capability. Otherwise, I, I won't have the room for it. In fact, even with the vertical capabilities, I probably won't have the room for it. Which means now I'm looking at a desk, like a like a proper desk to hold everything. Which means I'll be moving my setup, but that's a whole other whatever. Uh, yeah, you should thank your lieutenant. He made sure you weren't left to die. Torres did that. Torres did He's do that. Yes. Green. But all right. Mahoney said for us to go to grounds. There's a cave nearby we're going to hole up in until this is all over. You need me to kill Don't more worry, spacers? I'll keep the civvies safe from here. The civvies. I love that. Yeah, you guys are civvies. Why? Why would the spacers... Because they're bad people. Just like horses. Uh... Spacers are terrible. Yes, they are. Ooh. Terrible. There were too damn many of them. You saved us. I did. And I get a med pack out of it. And then an, uh, Orsinium Dagger. Osmium Dagger. Whatever it's called. Thing weighs next to nothing and it's worth like 2400 It's fantastic. What's up, Karn? Why does her voice sound AI generated? Uh, her voice is probably AI generated. I have no idea. <laughs> Talk to Lieutenant Torres. Let's go to the frontier. Oh yeah, yeah we're we're cucumbered. But uh, yeah, this is working out pretty nice for me so far. So if I do if I do a Good job changing between the uh, the cutter and the arc welder. We're 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 pretty good. Karn, I know this is the one you wanted to see, buddy. This is why I'm I'm doing this build. Let me let me kind of show you wh where we're at here. We're level 12, right? So I took the uh, xenobiologist, right? We have all four ranks of lasers, so I could set things on fire. This procs off every single enemy with the cutter. And the arc welder. And those are the two that we're using. Yep. Uh, it does not proc off every time using any other laser weapon. Because the cutter is consistent damage. The arc welder is consistent. Now, the arc welder, to be fair, is sort of a crappy weapon. Um... But we're not using anything ballistics, right? 
I have an eco a basic Equinox for longer range because it's got a range of 50 meters or whatever distance we use, right? Um, I now have two in Heavy Weapon Cert because they are heavy weapons. And I was mistaken. The Cutter is not a particle beam. It does not be affected by this. I think people were trying... And I was looking to see last night to see... Uh, and what I put... The first perk in here for 10%, I saw my number on the cutter go up by 1. When I tried it with this, it did not go up. So I don't know if it's that because the cutter has such a low damage. Like, it starts at 3 and we're at 8. Right? However, there's an ability, and I want to say it's... I don't know which one it is. Somebody was saying that... Um, Karn, you may know. Uh, it's one that extends like the cutter's battery so if I charge it it lasts as if like I'm using it normal with mouse one and if I use mouse one it'll just go forever I can't remember which one it is I don't even know if it's in this tree maybe it's in science or tech or something like that I don't know Yeah, this is for ships. I don't know what it would be in. Maybe it's in the physical tree here. Weightlifting would work too. The resistance to stagger. But we're not using that. I am using wellness though. We have two in wellness, one in fitness. We're almost there. Um... Pain tolerance is another one. Physical damage. I'm, I'm trying to see. Decontamination is not it. This is unarmed. We're going to try to get to Reju. I'm going to... We're going to take four in here. Three in here. Uh, I may take some pain tolerance if I can. I may take... Well, oh, you don't really need these, I guess. Um, this would be fairly useful. But then again, I have medicine. I'd love to be able to get to re well. Oh, we could. We don't really need that. Maybe I go two in gymnastics, three or four here. Maybe I will put one or two in weightlifting, and then we'll skip all these, and we'll go right to rejuvenation. Because being able to not use my like keep my med packs for combat and then have this heal otherwise is fantastic. By that point, we'll have medicine four. Um, I'll have spacesuit uh, four, spacesuit three, and special projects one, and this is just for my suits. Everything else is going to be thrown into tech. We've got, you can see, we got one. We're still one. We haven't, we haven't fought any other ships yet. So, but I'm going to go shield systems. We'll probably go energy weapon systems, uh, engine systems, and then starship design, and then boost assault training. There's a few other things in here I'd like to do. But yeah, it extends the uh, the life, or I should say the battery. Well, you can't see it here. You could actually see the... So if you take these to a, uh, a workbench, you could actually see the true number. It, it'd be like 7.3 or 7.2. On here, it just it's rounded down to whatever it is. Like, if it was at 7.5 or 6, it'd probably be rounded up. Although, for some weird reason, and I don't know why this is, uh, and I've seen this in games, if it's like 7.5, they round down. Maybe it's a Bethesda thing, and they forgot that if it's a 5 or greater, you round up. They forgot basic math, and they're just fucking idiots. But 5 or greater, you round up. You don't round down. It's not how it works. Because before I saw this at 8, and now we're at 7, so it's probably bouncing somewhere in the middle there.
But it, yeah, it's it it melts things now. It's 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 pretty it's pretty great. Did we get this? I think we got this. Yeah, we did. <laughs> Milk. There are these little spider creatures that crawl in the ground. They sort of remind me of like how the terramorphs sort of do it, but not too difficult. Canis. That's probably the cave they're going to. What's that? That's another cave. Run! What's up, Fosco? All right. Barrett. Excuse me. Hello there. You just hanging out or what? What are you doing here? You got my attention. You ready to head back out? Am I ready to hop into a ship and explore the galaxy with you? More like, are you ready? <laughs> Let's go. Okay. Yeah, I'm uh I'm just gonna sleep for an hour here just to keep that well rested bonus up. Finally you're up. Yeah. Let's go. After that hour. <laughs> yeah, that thing weighs a lot. For a tiny little dagger at 2.7? I mean, good physical, but damn. We're, we're going to sell it. So I've got a bolstering calibrated grab. This is actually pretty good. Stats are decent. It's got all four at 15, and we got bolstering. So the lower my health, I gain a hundred plus a hundred resistance to energy and physical. So and they're the two main that I face anyway. Uh, for the pack, just a basic deep seeker pack. Although this would be nice. Okay, we're we're wearing this now. Um, oh, did I, did I send it into the storage? Hold on, yes I did. Uh, no. O2, boosted oxygen capacity and 20 carry capacity, and it's a basic boost. So I'll take a, a little hit to the old physical. It's Deimos one. Doesn't really go with the theme. Deep Seeker was a little more, you know, sleek, even though it was gray-ish. But hey. Then we get airborne. Okay. I'm okay with that. So let's throw the Deep Seeker in here. Let's throw the Deep Seeker helmet, because there's nothing on it. And I've got a uh, veterans, so 15 less damage from humans. Pretty decent stats, all in the like mid-ish 40s. But again, all four here, right? Uh, I've been wearing this, but we picked up uh, where was it? This for carry capacity. The thing is, this has pretty good resistances, good thermal and good corrosive. Um. It's thermal and airborne. We could just use the hazmat suit, but uh, I like the fact that this is like 15, 15. I wish the electro or the energy was up a little bit, but um, this is just if I really need the extra five carry capacity. That's why I keep that on me. Um, let's get all them resources in there. That's what's holding me up. Cool. We're at 60 of 160. Got exactly 100 carry weight. Beautiful. That gets a hard save.
should probably close Discord, shouldn't I? I also can't see how many people are in here because for some reason the desktop app doesn't, or the desktop site doesn't tell me. And if I click on anything, it's either going to unmute it or it's going to send me right to the fucking app, so. Now, I have to be honest. Orbital insertion done. Time to dance among the stars. Oh, we didn't even need to do that. Let's go. Oh. Yeah, let's just go back to Taurus. <laughs> okay. Um, when I'm in combat, I actually like to have my scanner on. Helps me see enemies. Uh, faces some of the same see everything else. I, I actually like I'm this. Ever fascinated by the convergence of those solutions. Could have sworn we've been through here. These must be the remains of the spacers. No, these are ones we got. So there's uh, Captain Myung. Let's head in Torres. Mahoney said the research camp is all clear. I, I don't know where we'd be without you. Most likely decomposing in some unmarked grave. She's not wrong. Good on you both for making that mission of mercy a priority. Our job is to protect the civvies and never leave a soldier behind. Noble goal. There ain't much room for honor in this damn business. So we have to hold on to what we can. Captain, you should bring up your plan. I, I believe it's a good one. The spacers have an attack. Ah, oh, look at them two working together. Down beyond the ridge. We cannot let them keep reinforcing, otherwise they'll overwhelm us. So we need to take out their ships. Don't mind me, guys, just grabbing a refill of my coffee. I would normally take my phone with me. But, uh... Yeah, it's not working that way. <laughs> It'll be easier when I get the other monitor. Then we won't have this issue. Give me one sec here, I gotta throw a little bit of creamer in here. And we should be good to go. I think this is my lap last cup for the day. It's uh two thirty. Even though it's decaf, I I try not to have it all night. Unless I'm really frustrated and I don't want to sleep. This is that, getting old. Yeah. I'm gonna make you stand there all awkward like Okay. Now I'm back. Uh, you people are really keeping me busy. Yep. Ain't that the truth? Yep. But I'll take any one of the heroes here over a dozen of them. I concur with the captain. We can't hold out if we don't cut off the manpower. The spacers have two fighter groups. If you take those out, the enemies will be stranded. So, launch that fancy ship of yours and get to work. Get to work. I always like this quest. Uh, so, I've gone up to see Vlad at the eye. Um, I have not spoken to Sam yet. Um, and, but we're, we've got the quest to go locate Andresia. I decided that I was going to be doing this one first because this is a fairly l lengthy quest. It's not very difficult. You get a bunch of loot. Uh... You could gain some really nice levels and work on your skills. That's exactly what I needed. <gasps> Ooh, excuse me. These damn spaces. Well, lucky for you and Myung. Didn't think I didn't realize that. Hey, Captain. Take those spacer ships out. 
Every hour they're left alone, the situation ah, gets bleaker. As so here we go. All right, Barrett. I'm all ears. All righty. So Vasco is part of the ship. Barrett is also part of the ship. Perfect. So let's look at this. Defeats. Oh, I remember these. These guys were tough. All right. I remember. This is two groups of them. How can I be of service, Captain? Uh. Does the second monitor mean you won't have room for a camera? Yeah, I probably will never have room for a camera. Until I get the other desk. Until I have to buy a desk, I have to actually either sell or just donate. Uh, there's a, there's like a chest of drawers in my room that I, w I... I only use like three of the drawers, and there's 15 of them. They were supposed to be for... Well, they were supposed to be for like clothes, like like underwear, socks, uh, under like undershirts, like the like the white tank top, like wife beater shirts or whatever, because I wear them under like t-shirts and stuff like that, uh, and I sleep in them. Uh, and then of course I got like dress socks, which I never go anywhere fancy anyway, like weddings, funerals, that's about it. Um, but it didn't take up as much room as I thought it was going to be, so I don't really need the whole thing. Uh, it was it was actually sort of given to me uh, from an estate, so I didn't pay anything for it. It was brand new, but it's just taking up room is what it's doing. So. Yep. And yeah. I would have a no pants drawer, but I don't have any pants to put it put in the no no pants drawer. Orbit locked. <laughs> you just look. All right, let's see Altair One's orbit. Let's see where these bastards are. This isn't going to be good. They're immediately going to...
grab jump. Done. All right, let's get. We got that down. Ooh, there's another one. Spacer raccoon. Let's pick up the parts. F5. Who needs drawers when you don't wear drawers? Exactly. You are not wrong. Hopefully we got some space... Pr ah, fucking uranium. There's a third one too though, wasn't there? And I know I, know I didn't pick up... Alright. Let's make a nice hard save there. Alright, so... Travel to Altair 5. Let's see if I can pull this off. Never cross streams. Stars are treating me... Uh, well, I don't want to jinx it. Get away. Come on, I have enough space parts. Or ship parts. Motherfucker. No. See, I, the hard part is cycling between target lock. Let's try this again. Maybe I need to take their weapons out first. I know everybody says take their engines out. That's the way to do it. See, that's why. That's why. That's... Nope. I got the first ones the first time. Perfect response, right? There's no asteroid I can hide, hide behind or what? Nah, not really. Look at that. Look at that. The first round was simple. Oh, are you kidding me? I didn't. We're dead. Because he decided he wanted to get up. Good job putting it on E. Bethesda, good job. How fucked are we? So, so are mine. We got the first group of them. I'd love to be able to invest in something else. To, to show you, we've got targeting. I got one in piloting. 
but that's it for right now. So I'd love to be able to get some into shield systems because that would be a nice boost. And even this would be pretty nice. And uh, yeah, pretty much anything. <laughs> we'll try. We got. We got to do it again. We got to take them out. I mean, there's three of them. Oh, come on. Motherfucker. <sighs> I'm not going to survive this again. They just... They lock on so quick. And of course, there's somebody behind me. So is mine. Man. Kidding me. Had him that time. <laughs> Try again. We're gonna go after that this guy here on the right. Let's just keep blasting him here. I know that, Barrett. I'd, I'd like to think it was, but... You're behind me, aren't you, you dick? Yeah, he's, he's the one hit me hard. Actually, they're both hitting me pretty fucking hard. That just got our shields. Okay, you can do this though. I'm out of space parts. I'm stuck. <sighs> Take 37. Back out of there, you dummy.
Yeah, I need to repair my freaking ship. Uh, F5. Thank God. Alright, they're about the same distance. Do you have any space parts? Ship parts? Yes, you do. What about you? Yeah, space combat is uh definitely rough. Do we level? We did not level. We're close. How are my skills? Okay, so we got targeting control is five. Destroy five ships so we can get to rank two. This is okay. What would you guys choose? I can go piloting two, I can go targeting two. Uh but I gotta spend a point in here, or I could go boost pack. To, it's probably going to be piloting. I don't know. Target lock ships fire at you 25% slower. This could also be useful. I don't really need the boost pack yet. Not a major thing. Needs to tune down, tune it down a bit. I agree, Karn. I agree. All right. Where are we heading now? Uh, there's more of them. I have no more ship parts. We had, we had 11 ship parts. I have none now. And I lucked out getting the ones that I have. So. New Game Plus makes it even worse. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, I haven't done any ship combat on New Game Plus. Ready when you are. Are these all spacers? Nitty bitty spacer. through the frickin' fence. Let's get that amp going. Let's get... Oh, we got trauma packs. Hell yeah. And uh, Squall is going to be your best friend with this. Squall or Whiteout. For the extra damage and movement speed for two minutes. Oops, my bad.
get wrecked. Chunks! Oh, you're down. Sorry about that. Spacer. Any more of these little bitches, Barrett? Hmm. Glad to know us Marines aren't the only ones crashing this party. Oh, are they running? Fuck no. It's got good range, by the way. It's probably one of my favorite weapons. You wanna go? Let's go. Get wrecked. Uh, are you bringing more? Hey, get back here. Hey. <laughs> All right. You only put the cutter to that guy's coal mine. <laughs> I love it, Karn. <laughs> Somebody quote that. Keep that. That's a Karnism. I like it. Like shooting chasm bass in a barrel. <laughs> nice. Wow, this is combat. I yeah, right? Coming back? I don't think so. Let's talk to Lieutenant Torres. This planet's beautiful. What's this, Altair? Let's look to see where the deadies are. They coming back? I'm not going out of my way for them. Hmm. Yeah, these things are a pain in the butt. We have a level, too. I'll have to see what we can put this into. Uh, how far are we in? Oh, 31 of 50. That's not bad. We get 30% and then we get that. Uh, we could probably go wellness 3. We could... We could do targeting 
We could do targeting too. Right, we only need one more to get to shield systems. Or I could do piloting too. Here's here's the other question, right? So I, right now I've been using the uh, the frontier, but on this character, would you guys like to see me use a class B or C ship? Like I'm eventually gonna get all of these, and I know like when you get to New Game Plus, you lose everything, aside from your skills. So we'd be able to start off with the class C ship, assuming I have money. Right? That's how that works. It's a cutting remark. <laughs> Yes, yes it is. Uh, there we go. That's a tough decision. So let's see, let's read this. Time to lock onto enemy ships is reduced. Target lock ships fire at you slow, 25% slower. Lock on 30%. You have a 10% increased chance of critically hitting a target lock ship. I like that. We're not going to really need payloads, although this eventually could come in handy. Uh, I don't see myself ever using this with the way the uh, ship system upgrades work. Um, the other thing is I could go medicine to because we, we're eventually going to need space suits. Oh, astrodynamics. Shit, I didn't think about this. Yeah, we're going to need astrodynamics for this too. I don't know if this is necessarily important though. Fuck, I'll hold on to the point for now until I you guys can throw, you guys can feel free to make, uh, suggestions as to where I put this perk. We've lost so many people. So many people. That's the price of command, Torres. Every decision leads to blood. You can drive yourself crazy with counterfactuals. Focus on the good you did. We did, here. I could always put it in wellness just to get my health up high. Uh, but I am honestly feel like medicine, too, would be better. Medicine for this character is very important. Uh, to be able to heal. Medicine and wellness, let me just say, they're probably equally as important. Uh... Into that guy's coal mine. Boom! Callback. <laughs> yeah, you know what they call a guy's coal mine, Karn, don't you? <laughs> wait, wait. You, you, you did get that, right? I don't have to explain anything? Young? Chill out. Uh... Uh, I say everyone here is alive because of, yeah, you guys all cooperated. Huh. Well, just don't go saying that too loudly. Yeah, swallow your we'll pride there, woman. Because of you, both of you. I almost want to write back to the freestyle and ask them to give you a medal. Now, wouldn't that be the damnedest thing? I could put it on right next to my meritorious star. You'd save me a court martial if you just give me your thanks. <laughs> Might be you want your medal though. Not mine. Yeah, it doesn't much matter to me. I know exactly how you feel. I'm... I'm not sure if I would have done all this if the roles were reversed, Yo. But I will never forget you. You're young, and you've got a future ahead of you. A bit of advice. I've been passed up for promotion more times than I can count because I've always stuck by my principles. There's a million ways the bastards in command will ask you to compromise. Little ways big ways don't it may hurt your career but I look back with pride at my service especially today
You see? I sincerely hope I never see you across the lines on the battlefield, Captain. If you do, Lieutenant, I will do my duty. Not if I do my duty first. <laughs> see, there we go. Soldiers, it's time to get out of the Free Star's hair. Bam! 5,000. We get a peacekeeper. We get some ammo. Let's check this bad boy out. Something I know I'm not going to use, right? Extended mag. Not bad. Actually, peacekeeper's named, right? This is... What is this? Carney you know what this is, right? I forget which one it is. It's one of the ballistic rifles. Uh, makes for a pretty good uh, sniper. Uh, but we'll probably be selling it. Could use the money. I love I love that we found one of these. We gotta make that better. Oh, that's right. Yeah, you're using the laser. Uh, AA99. That's right. I was using this on the other character. You're right. The 99. And there's a guaranteed one in, uh... I forget whose shop. Right in New... Al wow, I have the hiccups. Holy crap. Right in New Atlantis. You know where I could put the perk? We're gonna need it. In medicine. So that way I can get the spacesuit design. We got one, we got two. There. Now we got 20% and heals 20% faster. What's the challenge on this? 50? Yeah. Hey, look, ads. I'm getting one too. Yay. Need to pop off, have fun with the re Yeah, enjoy, Haggis. Appreciate you being here. Okay. We need to find Andresia. I think we had something else that was... Yeah. Alright, we're gonna need ship parts. And I'm gonna need to get my ship repaired. You know what I should do? Let's start the Vanguard stuff because... Um, I want access to their weapons. What's up, uh, Vasco? You did. Shotgun. <laughs> I never heard him say that. <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> All right. Uh, let's go here. What do we got? I'm gonna keep the deep seeker suit. Ah, mother. That's all we have in there. Okay. Let's go back to New Atlantis. Hilarious when he says that. Yeah, the cars don't even exist in the game. <laughs> Shotgun! You know what the messed up part is? Barrett is part of the crew as well. He's following me, but he's also part of the crew of my ship. So I have him and Vasco as the crew right now. And you would, you would think... And orbit stabilizing. Perfect. Alright. Let's go to Alpha Centauri. Dang 
it's at this level where you'd like to put perks in like three different things because you need all three different things, right? But you can't, you can only do one at a time. That's the problem. So. Good. We're done. Let's go to the spaceport first. Ah, oh, I'm on the wrong side of the wrong side of the planet. Right there, New Atlantis. I don't know if I gave Barrett anything else. I think I didn't. I think I took all the stuff off him. I have something for you. Oh yeah? Hi. Sorry. I was lost in the memory for a moment there. How can I help? You said you had something for me? I do actually. Here you go. You're so polite about it. Alien stir fry. Thank you. Alright boys. You're gonna need your uh you should inspect your ship for heat leeches every couple landings. No, I'm gonna cause plenty of havoc if left unchecked. I'm gonna pay you to do that. Okay, sure. We'll take care of any holes, broken seals, that kind of thing. Okay. Let's... I was gonna keep this one, but... Yeah, because that is a big boost in physical. We're going to get another Deep Seeker, though. Uh, can't even afford the Peacekeeper. Okay. Fair enough. And I like that, because that's got fastened in it. Of course, there's the... Uh, That's actually pretty good. As far as numbers, ablative, shock troop. Okay. Anything else to yeah, he gave me the alien stir fry. <laughs> Do you pick anything else up? Chunks beef. Forgot to use that before the thing, the extra 1% for uh, 15 minutes XP gain. Okay. We are what cucumber. If we leave a few things here and make a second trip. Chunks, chunks, chunks. All right. Man, I I kind of want to do this because but at the same time I think we're going to do this. We gotta go back to the, uh... You'll be scanned as you enter the city. Please keep... It's good to be home, right? Okay. Scan me. Okay. Scan me. See, I can't even put any of my own emotes in there. And I don't know what it's going to look like if I try to take a break either, so... I'm not going to be able to do that. Hi, 
Hey, fitness hit the next rank, which is perfect. Oh yeah. How are you doing? I will emote for you. Delightful relic tangled up with hope, grit, and science. Mm -hmm. All those things. Let's see, do we have everything? Huh, still don't have the cheese, do we? We really don't need anything else. I mean, can't do anything with a spacesuit, and weapons are sort of insignificant on this character, so. Let's stick them in there. Alright, Barrett, I'm gonna. Let me see, we gotta get rid of that peacekeeper. We gotta get rid of the. What else? What are the new items? Yeah, we gotta sell this stuff off. Whoa, we gotta go buy ship parts. Uh, let's go do that. safe as your equipment out there. Welcome to Outland. We deal in only the finest, most reliable gear for whatever adventures may await you. All of our products come highly recommended by individuals who have devoted their lives to distant travel. Interesting. And while I've never needed them myself, I stand by everything we offer. Interesting. So you just fly out there buck naked. I'm impressed. Hmm, no, and no flying for me. Not, not my style. <laughs> uh, you've really never been to space? Goodness, no, I just couldn't. You're out there millions of miles away from anything, and if something goes wrong, I can't stomach the thought. I prefer solid ground under my uh, The residential tight. district has a couple of I food vendors that might sell cheese. Ah, coffee within nice. Each. Can't get those in space either. I will have to, uh, I'll have to see you. Let's see what yes, you have. By all means, have a look. How much money does he have? About six thousand. All right. So let's see here. The peacekeeper. See so, ya. Yeah. It's nice to be able to get rid of all that, except for this. We need that ammo. Uh, I almost want to keep this. But it's a skip pack, and we're going to be using a balanced or a, uh, a power pack on this character. Although skip would work, um, but we're going to find something better later, so at a waste over six. Same thing with the deep sea helmet. I love the look of this thing, but the st stat numbers just starting are abysmal. Um...
We're keeping that for the carry weight. We're keeping that. I don't need a formal slack suit. Oh, that's his hair on the side of it. it looked weird. Um. He's got a basic arc welder, which we do not need. He's got the, uh, hold on. Yeah, we need that. No ship parts. We will take those. Just that shock troop pack that has really good stats, but not the place to. Uh, okay. Be careful out there. I wish there were ways to get the look you want on the armor without. Sa I know, right? Let's go over to the UC uh, center here. Yeah, we definitely need more ammo because this arc welder goes through ammo like crazy. Something oh yeah, and always reload your weapons before you go in and start buying stuff. You never, you'll never realize how many times I've done that, and I, I had like nothing in the chamber because I. I'm swapped to a different weapon and then I forgot to reload so at 90% or higher I'm sure we have anything you might need welcome to UC distribution something I can do for you yes I'd like to see what you have I hope we have what you need I hope you do too six ship parts whole lot of that we have for weapons there I almost wanted to use this. I saw somebody with a video with this the other day. With one of the uh like the micro guns or whatever they're called, smart guns. Um they look fun. But man, do you go through ammo like the ammo for this is so common though. But you need something like uh see where it says shattering, but you also want like Laceration or something else on it. Damn, she's got some good stuff here. Ah, uh, the physical's abysmal on that. Look at that, 58. I mean, mine's only 61, but. There, the shock troop. <laughs> I told you, look at that. Eighty, eighty-four, eighty-eight. And the shock troop actually looks pretty solid. Look at that. We may be getting that. We may be ponying up ninety-four hundred for the for the for the resistances. I don't mind if I'm taking a fifteen point airborne hit I'm getting it in thermal now we don't have bolstering but at the same time man that's a tough call the Sidonia spacesuit it's amazing um 
the mining facility in Sidonia, like they sit there and tell you all you see is red, and then of course your spacesuit is white and green. It's crazy. Had to use it. Had to use the primary. Well, I got the money. What's the calibrated at? I don't know. Do we go with the shock troop stuff? You guys can see it right there with the red and the... Like the graphite metallic. Mm. It is heavier though too. That's the problem. Alright, let's hold off on it. Let's hold off on it for right now. Because we have that. Ah, shit. Hold on. What do you have for sale? Oh, well, certainly. Yeah, yeah. Did we check her aid? I think we did. Yeah, we took them. And yeah, we took her ammo. Okay. Now, have anything else to sell her? Alright, we're over a thousand on that, so we're good. Because they both use the same ammo, which is fantastic. Uh, armor weight doesn't apply while wearing it, I don't think. Well, it's not the weight. I'm not worried about the weight. Um, I'm. Oh, let's get to hers. Uh, there's a reason for that. So mine, I've got the ground crew spacesuit, which is nice for the bolstering effect. I'm not worried about the mass, the weight, but we've got all four resistances here. And these are solid numbers for the level I'm at. These are better. This is what she's got for, for this suit right here. This is the one that we're looking at. But I'm losing airborne, but I'm gaining thermal, but I'm gaining a little bit. So the weight doesn't matter. You could ignore that for me. We're not playing a stealth character, so this doesn't really factor in. These numbers do. Absolutely. These are your resistance numbers. Right? We're obviously going up, uh, what, 19 in the physical, which is great. Just a little bit in energy. And Electromag's not as needed for me, but this, this is a big number. Like, I kind of wished uh, Electromag and Physical were swapped on here. Then I definitely wouldn't be getting it. But I think we're going to be getting a suit fairly soon anyway. So we'll skip out on that. I just need I need the ship parts is what I need. We need, need else. definitely need more than six. Uh, who else will we check? Jemison Mercantile? Maybe? I need at least ten if I can. And that's in the spaceport. Ship part, yeah, that's the other thing too. The ship parts are, what, each one is 10? And I know the, uh, the Frontier holds 450. Um, If it belongs on your ship, then I'm sure we have it for sale. If you don't see what you want, feel free to ask. Oh, please, take a look. Yeah, see, she's got a shock troop too. So these are like the basic ones.
Yeah, my, my deep recon is actually pretty solid. With numbers in the 40s right across. Farming elf? I don't think I've seen that one yet. <laughs> That's awesome. Okay. I think we're good. Yeah. Appreciate the business. Uh, let's drop a save here. Alright, we're off to do some UC stuff. While well, looking to the left. So our ship is fixed. Well. I suppose some kind of speech is in order. Dracilius, dropping the prime on me. Much appreciated. Welcome in, welcome in. I only buy my ship parts at Aquila so I can easily move them to cargo and not have to run back. Ah. I don't even think we've been to, I think we've been to Aquila once. Maybe. Let's get that hour of sleep, right, Barrett? Sleep well? Yep. Let's hope. Yep, let's hope. So let's drop all these ship parts. Yeah, we got ten of them. Should be good enough, right? Alright, we all know it's coming up. Or at least I think we do. <laughs> let's take off. All right, we're gonna keep. We'll keep Barra with this. Hey, Lummox, welcome in. Uh, I'm probably gonna do that later today or tomorrow morning. We're at Apogee, surrounded by stars and the vastness of space. Because I'm I'm watching on my. I'm I'm still watching on my phone, but I'm using the desktop site. Which absolutely sucks. I have no control, I have no command, and I, I... I... Even though I'm on my own channel, I have to see the ads. But the main thing is I can see the chat. That was, that was the problem. That was the big problem. So... So we'll see. What's up, Duff? Don't come in. So yeah, we'll be we'll be buying the second monitor, and I may be getting a desk to go along with it. Uh, I, there's other some other stuff I gotta pick up too. So. I think we yeah we've. No, oh, I guess we haven't been to Telsetti. Gourmet Production Center. Interesting. Yo, your RAM came in? Nice. I suggest a monitor mount. Well, it depends on what size I get. First, it's going to depend on if I get the desk. Because I can make it work with my setup here. It's just that mounts don't fit. Like, I can't put a... Uh, and I tried this. It's because of the type of table. It's like a folding table, right? But it's got my rig. It's got my my main monitor. My keyboard. My mouse pad. Uh, and even though I have it, like, tidied up and everything, like, that's about all that fits here. Now, if I put a, a, a monitor next to my main vertical... It'll be fine. I can't fit another 
but I can't fit a mount because of the type of top I have. So you know how you have like the uh, the arms for the microphone, and you can you know you pull them down close. I can't put that on here because it'll slide off. That that's what happened with my blue Yeti. I have a a mount for that, and when I tried using that, it it slid off the side, and I don't have room for it. So I don't know if it's like a prop. Uh, a prop to put it vertical, then yeah, that might work. But it all depends if I'm getting a. Tenacity of life on any planet is truly astounding. What do you mean, 56 inch what? Hold on, let me go back and check. But consider the oh, I have a, uh, I have a 27 inch as my main. I don't need anything larger than that because I'm right up close to it. 56. If I had 56, like. If I'm looking at my t my TV is an 80 inch. The one that's the one that I have in my room is an 80 inch. So we figure 50 is a little less than half the size of that. That's way too big for PC. Considering I'm right, I'm like I don't know, like two feet, three feet away from my my monitor. I don't have the room for that other uh, as well. Oh, Tau What you doing to me here? Yeah, I spent all that money, uh... Upgrading my hardware. You know, what would work is if Twitch fucking fixed their app. That's what would work. Then I wouldn't need to be buying more shit. Salvager, maybe? Nice. Just happened relatively recently. I think we could finally swap this out. Absolutely. There we go, we got an Orion. Let's put that on one. Equinox, you have been solid. I'm happy I don't have to use you anymore because you're the most inaccurate weapon in the fucking game. Always pick up the beer. It doesn't weigh anything and it, you can sell it. Uh, let me see here. I have a 30 inches my main and a 27 inches my second. 80 inches around. <laughs> 80 inch in his bedroom. Yep. Well, yeah. I mean, I'm laying there. I, I want a nice big fat fucking screen in my face. Well, it's not my face. It's towards the end of my bed and then I've got a little bit of walk room and then I got a, another chest of, you know, what do I have in that? Old gaming stuff. Uh, part of my part of my gaming collection is in there. So like, um, all my rarities, things I have, like, like still sealed brand new copies of Chrono Trigger for the Super Nintendo. I've got like three copies that are sealed brand new in the box, like they're in there, stuff like that. Things that are worth a lot of money. Sealed copy of uh, Suikoden 2. Right? I had the copy that I play on, which was, I also bought that. But then I bought a sealed copy as well. Stuff like that. So. Yeah, the desk would probably be the, uh, the way to go. It's just physical room. But, uh, yeah. What do we have here? The New Atlantean One. Okay. And a VHS tape.
I ate a lot of credits, 700? God damn. They're dead! They're all dead! I'd say settler. I don't see a dead body out here. Let's look around. You coming to help me, Barrett? I don't know if we should uh, activate all the things here that take this thing out. I want to see if I could take it out on my own. We did it with a we did it with the fucking sword. Remember? We took him out with a sword. I was right up in his face, just slashing away. And that worked. Ah, I don't get it. Factories in the middle of nowhere are usually connected to the military in my experience. But this is just neat, isn't it? Oh yeah. Just need. Interesting. Sixty inch four K? Nice. I have to figure out what kind of desk I want. I'm probably gonna rearrange because what I'd like to do is move this setup from where I'm at to my room. Now you gotta understand I don't have a very large room. I, it's obviously larger than uh, the space that I'm working in right now. Oh yeah we got those. Okay. But uh, there'd be a few things that I would have to obviously rearrange. Salvager? I like having Barrow with me for this quest, by the way. Probably where she sends you to uh, pick stuff up. Hey, another Orion! Look at that. May as well, right? We got up there a deep core. No. Let's leave the uh, secure access door nice and secure. Yeah. You, you just said that, Barrett. Uh, up there. Oh, we did. We came in this way. Hold on a second. Am I an idiot? Oh, no, maybe not. Can't do expert. That's the research station. That's 
expert too. That's master. Oh fucking hell. We got in here a lead lined calibrated piece of crap. That's exactly what that is. See they put those those epics in there and they make you think they're decent, but they're not. She's she's up there. How do we probably right here, right? I don't know if we have Frankenstein. Bunch of credits, eh? Med pack. Sorry, I'll be with you in a minute, my dear. I'm just, you know. We're doing the whole looting thing. Kind of how this works. You you come second. Okay, Adrian, how are you? So what do we got here? It's too clean to be one of the settlers, or a pirate. See, that's what they're saying. A sit stand desk. I can't use them. Yeah, make my day if you said you were a shock trooper out for a stroll. Uh, actually, the Vanguard sent me. They uh, kind of failed to mention how bad things were here. Vanguard, huh? Mm-hmm. Yeah, I expect they didn't. I'm Hadrian. I'm a... I was a researcher with the UC. I, I came here on a rumor of a... Well, I expect... Oh, you got the link? Results. Uh, Lemmix, you're gonna probably have to send that to the wind. The so she could post a link. The work of Oxisio Machina. A Let me, uh, describe her. gonna the warm up my coffee here. ...ever crossed paths with. And this one, well, it's something of an anomaly. Possibly a worrying one. Oh, just perfect. Sure, why not? <laughs> Paris just like, yep. Yeah, I wanted to keep him with me uh, for this part. I actually brought him up to the eye to see Vlad. Because I wanted to hear his dialogue with him. Uh, and it's, it's pretty fun. Not that I, uh, not that I care for followers. I kind of need them with this character. You're, you're definitely going to want to pick, uh, you're going to want to, uh, pick an extrovert if you decide you want to do this build. I, I didn't, uh, because if you're ever without one for whatever reason, uh, then you're kind of you screwed. Right but if you're able, if you're able to keep one with you the entire time, then yeah, you should be fine. Uh, yeah, I'm just... Refreshing my coffee there, Hadrian. Give me a second here. Tell me about a Terramorph. What's that? Other than a stark reminder that nature isn't our friend? You're not wrong. Among apex predators, they're the pinnacle. Resilient, agile, smart. And their mental prowess only increases with age. Some can even dominate the minds of weaker species, keeping them as pets, livestock, or toys <laughs> they're creatures without fear interesting wait so you're telling me that all the settlers here are dead right I managed to scope out a fair bit of the facility before it found me if there are any survivors of the attack they're long gone wind if you like that you could DM me in discord with that link. And I'll have a look at it when I'm when I'm finished. If you don't mind. What uh, what kind of anomaly are we talking about here? Theramorphs have a unique growth cycle. They're usually only found on worlds that have been long. Yeah, see if I try to click on that, it's gonna shut all my stuff down, so I can't 
Unfortunately, that's why I said to DM me. I can't touch my screen at all, or it'll either open the app and I can't do anything and I have to reset. Because <laughs> it sucks. Oh, the skill magazines? Yeah, I've already been collecting the minor stuff. Starfield skill. Oh, yeah, I have all the locations. I was. I just got a brief glimpse of that. I, I know where they're all at. And this character needs a mining monthly. You got to remember, some of the mining monthly stuff is quest locked. Well, you're also going to want Cyber Runner Cipher, so that's going to be like one of the next things we uh we do. Because I don't have any Cyber Runner ciphers. I've been I've been concentrating because the minor stuff is tool grip weapons only, specific to the cutter. So. Don't rush in, at least. I'll give you that. <laughs> I don't mind. Uh, sounds like you could use my help. I sure could. And because to confirm my suspicions about this creature, I'm gonna need a tissue sample from it. And to get that, I need its corpse. You want it dead? I make it dead. But there is a way we can give ourselves an edge against this thing. I can go out there and poke system. it with a stick. The admin Seemed to work the last time. This building, but it needs its connection reset. And as I found out, that's not a one-person job. But if you can make it to the security outpost and restore the connection, I think I can get things back online. See if the settlers left us any other tools. So, tell me about the security system. The settlers outfitted most of the buildings with turrets at some point. Not sure how many are still operable. Yeah, the turrets will definitely help. At least a few appear to be in fighting shape. There were also some sensors scattered around the facility that I didn't recognize. But those are honestly all just educated guesses until we get the connection reset. Alright. Where can I find the security outpost? It's the building in the middle of the facility. The terminal in there should allow you to grant me access to the system as a whole. Then we can see about getting things back online. Alright, let's, uh, let's get that security system back on. Good. Once I see the connection reset, I'll get things underway on my end. Take care of yourself out there. And make sure you leave enough of that thing for us to get a sample. Yeah, no guarantees. restored. I'll make this quick. Hmm. Plant's turrets took a beating, but I should be able to get you a couple of kill lanes. Just get the thing to chase you down the alleys between the buildings, and you'll lead it right into a crossfire. Hello. Wish I'd found this earlier. Those sensors around the facility? Part of a livestock tracking system. Should let you keep tabs on how close the Terramorph is. Do you hear it peeping? It's not connected to this network. There should be a terminal in the adjoining room. Tune it to Green. There we go. What's that sound? It's active. Shit. Stop. Stop whatever you're doing and get in cover. It's on the move. Look, I wouldn't engage directly if you could avoid it. The kill lanes. 
towards the lights and watch the fireworks. Give it hell, Vanguard. Let's try it without. Oh yeah, I forgot about those. Get fucking wrecked, buddy. That's what I'm talking about. That's right. <laughs> yeah, we don't need no fucking turrets. I don't know what she's talking about. I just need my goddamn cutter. That's all you need. How about that? Love going toe to toe with them. Oh yeah, absolutely. Cutter is kind of anti terramorph They have they have no resistance. Yep. How about that, huh? I don't even need to mess with your computer. Trekker's gone quiet. I suspect it's either. No, it's dead. Or... No, it's dead. Wait. You did it, didn't you? Efforts Killed him quicker than I did with my uh. With the Wakazashi, we we took him out. Well, we we took on we took four of them out. The first four that you fight in the game. So, the three that attack uh the spaceport. But I also had higher health. I think we had all four in wellness at that point. We were a higher level too. This is the lowest level I've taken one out at. But yeah. Did you just see his health like burn? It was like stacking 57, 57, 57 like as many times, like 25 times. And whatever their health is, you know what I mean? It's a fantastic way. Then you could, like, if they come up close to you, just fucking bash them. Just bash them. Uh, uh, yep. All taken care of. <laughs> yeah, taken care of. Yeah, no, no big, big deal. Yeah, it wasn't a big deal. We didn't need your stupid you turrets. You uh, grab me a tissue sample, did you? Of course I did. Uh, I think the nice lady... <laughs> What's that sample? You think the nice lady should pay me for rescuing you? <laughs> uh, can you really learn that much from one little sample? A lot of life gets recorded. Oh, we're on very hard, by the way, guys. For those of you that just... For example, if this terramorph cells who are curious, certain radiation or chemical exposures... Very, very hard in this game is like... On a ship. Uh, Apprentice in Skyrim. Start getting some answers about this thing. So, Except for space combat. Fuck space combat. Life? Uh, yeah, here we go. Here you go. All right. Punch him in their lychee face. They look cool, though. They're one of the... I can't wait for the, uh... Get to the bottom of this. They don't really need a retexture, but they do need a remesh. And, of course, when somebody remeshes them, they're gonna need a retexture. So, sure. I can't wait for the Terramorph replacers. Uh, the good ones, not the stupid throw titties on them. I don't want to see PS Boss doing anything for fucking Terramorphs in this game. Oh, we gotta follow her. I'm so excited. Are you coming? Come on. You alright, my dear? What do you think, Barrett? 
I've been thinking a lot about my early days in Constellation lately. Really? Got me pretty nostalgic, and I started digging in some old things. Just sort of reminiscing. I found <laughs> some of Irvin's last messages to me. Balanced uh, the difficulty to scale harder with New Game Plus. Thank God. Unless you're wind, in which case it's hell. I want 80 boobs on my Terramorph. Long ass nip Oh, the long nipples are great. Aren't they? Especially on a Terramorph. You want penis sized long nipples. That just sounded weird. <laughs> uh, Jesus, Barrett. Hold on. See you later. I gotta come back to that. You had a whole new conversation thingy for me. This equipment? It's not set up to do a proper analysis of our sample. Four asses. But this Terramorph being here, of all <laughs> places, it doesn't make sense. Humanity's spread plenty of creatures in our travels across the stars. Pets, livestock, pests. But Terramorphs? They're different. To our knowledge, no one's ever spread them intentionally. Yet somehow, they follow us. Some say they're demons, others claim they're a witch's curse or a ghost's revenge. But the science is going to lead us to the real reason. I just know it. So when humans settle a world, 70 to 100 years later, terramorphs tend to just appear. No one knows. Instead of roaring, they fart really loudly. Dangerous. Oh boy. See, now you're going to give all those shitty modders ideas. And then they're going to start flooding the Starfield page, and then we're going to have to filter that crap out. It's been colonized 20 years, but then the other option... It's going to become Skyrim 2. ...the deadliest predators in the galaxy, just to wipe out some settlers... And you know the Nexus staff isn't going to put their foot down, because they all wear... They all wear panties over there, so it's not going to matter. Looking at a truly strange murder, or a bunch of betas. Type of terramorph growth, the results of which could be catastrophic. Terramorph outbreaks have been <laughs> They're going to make my dreams come true. <laughs> I don't. I don't want them to water down Starfield with crap mods. I mean, we're going to get it. It's inevitable. It's just I'd like to like mitigate the crap mods. I want the good mods. Because, you know, people just putting up shit stuff deters actual modders from wanting to do it. Because their shit gets lost in translation. Unless you're already a big household name. In which case, it doesn't matter. Uh... How does no one know how Terramorphs get onto human worlds? Aren't they... Yeah, kind of hard. I mean, that thing was pretty massive there. Well, they're not exactly buying tickets and flying coach. The theory is that they're spread by... They can turn dragons into Thomas the Tank. I can have four titty masses far. But how the hell you go on with your bad self, Karn. ...turns into a terramorph <laughs> without anyone noticing is a question no one's ever found. No, I said the Nexus staff are all a bunch of panty wastes and betas because they don't put their foot down against anything. I said they all wear panties over there. Meaning, you know, the jock straps missing. No balls. Kind of the thing I was getting referring to. Right, there we go. No balls over there. They have. I have nothing against panties uh, down in, in general. City once. But yeah, no balls, no pants. Ease, what's up? To be quarantined due to a massive outbreak during the colony war. It's the only known loss of that scale, but it's the reason why any change in our relationship with these creatures needs to be taken very seriously. Interesting. Well, it sounds like we need to do something in ASAP. You're right. We just need more information first. Time was I had access to one of the best repositories of Terramorph research in the galaxy. Well, I didn't know what you were saying. I thought maybe you didn't hear me. A place to start looking. If so I you always do that, Wynn. Don't do that. <laughs> but we also need to get this sample properly analyzed. Get confirmation. It's it's different like solution. when, you know, you're Luckily, I think both I able to hear the other person's to tone. What would you say to delivering this to him for me? 
Yeah, I do it myself, but I need to call in some favors. See if I can't get access. I think to we that have the same color there. eyes. Plus, maybe just pop by a hospital for a little bit. Yeah, you Clearly probably need it. first if you have to. You can even show them this. My gene tag. Okay. Tell them Hadrian Sanan is worried there could be more attacks on the horizon. Well, I mean, you put yourself in the corner, not me. <laughs> I mean, you can do whatever you want. So, wait, why would my commander know who you are? Are you with the UC military as well? I was. Long time ago. Family tradition. But the I red eyes coming from Spain time on Mars? Yep. Into the vanguard. Yep. A couple even owe me favors. Plus, the character started off as like a... One of them. Like a rock miner. So I was going to give him red eyes anyway, but then it's just sort of morphed into like this style that you're seeing now with like the heavy weaponry and stuff. And I'm so happy that the uh, Orion uses the same ammo as the Arc Welder. It just, it, and it's actually fairly cheap, uh, but the Arc Welder is going to be the main one that you see. But the now that I have it, well we have two Orions, I'll, I'll probably keep the one, uh, store, store the other one away. Um, yeah, I'll make sure he agrees. Oh, you don't understand what a weight off my shoulders. I like her. She's she's I probably the only character in this game that I don't have any problem with whatsoever. For this thing. Full work up. He'll know what that means. She's not the best NPC I'm in the game, sure but she's exactly she's probably my favorite. She's she's, she's like this game's version of Serana. On Mars. For me. There's a place called the Sixth Circle If that makes any sense. Sidonia. Bar run by some yeah, the three K. Yeah, it's plentiful. It's versatile. There. Orion for range, Again, welder for close. Yeah, and the welder's like a shit a weapon. Bounty, but you certainly deserve for the most part. I mean, it's to cover the cost of fuel to Mars at least. Well, I shouldn't say that. I've been taken out by a few arc welders too. The range is deceptive. It's it's a lot longer range than you'd think. Um, I know I was I was just sitting there talking during the whole thing. How did she give me extra credits besides the eighteen hundred? Let's look at this. So. We started with the Equinox, with, which is a range of 50, mag of 20. This is this was fantastic when we got this early on. Aiming with this thing fucking sucks. I don't care what you say. If it's a base weapon like this, it sucks. Versus the same thing, ballistics. Ballistics is way more accurate. Okay. Thank God I don't have to use this piece of garbage ever again. We got... I bought this for like 5,600 credits... It's anti-personnel and lacerate. One of the shops had this. I forget where I was. I was traveling around finding the magazines, and I stopped in to sell stuff, and somebody had this. It may have been in um, at best defense. I don't remember. This is perfect for what I'm using it for, because we get the fire burn with lasers four. Now we get lacerate on this, so it's bleed to living targets and anti-personnel for humans it just sucks down their health i don't even I don't like since we're not doing anything with weapon engineering this is perfect i may use this the rest of the game unless i find a legendary that has the same thing and better better numbers um and now of course we have the orion which also has a range of 50 better mag size way more damage 35 17 it's probably going to aim just as crappily uh, but I'm not doing anything with it, so there we go. She is, she is awesome. Her backstory, yeah, she, she's, she's Starfield's version of uh, Serana for me. The damage rating is misunderstood a lot of the times. So it's why, like, uh, the inventory mod shows the DPS. You could do the same thing at the workbench, though, for like the damage. Yeah, well, not damage per second, but like the actual damage, because these things get rounded. We were talking about this. This is probably like 7.4, because I've got a few of the magazines. Um, here's the problem. Check this out, right? So when I was looking at, um, it, it was the link I think Lummox put up for like where they are. So some of these are quest locked. We've only got four. There's ten which would put you at 20% more cutter damage to, or tool grip, which is the cutter is the only tool grip, I believe unless tool grip counts for the arc welder, which of course would be awesome but I think it's for the, just the cutters as you can see right um, 
Then there's the Cyber Runner Cipher, which I think has five without looking at the the site. Yeah, and I always keep the mag the magazines don't weigh anything. I always keep them on me. I don't remember. Somebody was saying like once you pick them up and you sell them, it's okay. But like, why would I sell them when they don't weigh anything? There's no point. Like for what a hundred, which means I'm gonna get what thirty seven. Just keep them on you. They don't weigh anything. I can see like if you're like super OCD and you don't like cluttering up your inventory, but it's a Bethesda game. And they put so much shit in this game to pick up that, uh, yeah. <laughs> uh, okay, so what are we doing here? Hold on. We were doing stuff and things. Oh, yeah, we can't. Yeah, that's, yeah, we got that. We got that. I wish I had more information on Percival. It's been a long time since I've seen him. Since you've but seen him. Was there something you needed? Uh, yeah. Who, who is he? Percival and I worked together for years. Val, really welcome a in. Like me. A scintillating mind. But that was probably me and yeah, I hate clutter. <laughs> what he's doing working for an organization I mean, with other humans. With this game, I, I like pick up the clutter because I sell it. I, I typically like a nice think, neat inventory. I like to have low carry weight. But as long as it's making me money. So. So for now, um, I only need one set of ammo. The 3KV laser. Because it's for my arc welder, now for my Orion. For distance. But the cutter is the main weapon. So I don't need ammo. I could literally sell all but that one type. Which is perfect. Absolutely perfect. And it, it doesn't have carry weight. So pick up all the ammo. Don't miss any of it. It's free money. Uh, how do you know so much about Terramorphs? Was my job to know all can never have too much ammo, exactly. Yeah, you can never have too much ammo. Terramorphs included. Just like Skyrim, you can never have too many bolts or arrows. Just keep collecting them. Courier handed me a slate. Guess someone had picked up a strange signal on a flyby. Thought I might want to check it out. Now here's a question for you guys, because I left this planet right after here the last time. Are there more Terramorphs on this, uh, on Tau Ceti here? Let me make a save. Barrett, I feel bad he's still over here. Here. I don't think we can make it up to the I top. Meet like a lot of folks, but feels like we could have figured out something more humane by now. Oh, these things are back online, so I can't loot them. Okay, that's fine. Well, yeah, if the bolts and arrows have carry weight, that's different. But they don't in the base game. And even with most mods, I think... I, I think Requiem's, like, one of the only mods that actually gives them carry weight. I know there's others, it's just... Wow, he went down really quick. And you can't move them, too. I really wish you could move them like you could flop them around. Are there other Terramorphs here? I've seen several random on other planets. Uh, not sure about this one. Yeah, so the, only, the other planet is um, that I know of is going through the UC quest line uh, for New Lon uh, Londinian. Or for Londinian. And then, of course, when they attack at the spaceport. And uh, this guy just doesn't have anything on him. Of course, he got ripped to shreds. So where was the... 
He went, well, the Terramorph is hiding in the ground, so I mean... I'm hoping there's more. What do we get off you? Come here. Nutrient root. I want to go to this. It says life signs. I'm hoping we find a nest. That'd be that'd be ideal. Oh, there's other creatures. Okay. Herding bone mane. What's that? Grazer. I feel like eradicating species, Barrett. Give me a second. Let's see. 35. Alright, we need 15 more. This is perfect. And then we can get our last one. I, I haven't decided if I'm going to get rank 4. It says just gain 25% physical resistance. Actually, that's not bad. While aiming down sights with the heavy. You don't technically aim, though, with the cutter, but I do with everything else. I don't know. But I definitely need rank 3 ASAP, so we need 15 more of these things. Dippy do. I don't like being burned. Doesn't feel very good, does it? Is that your buddy? We're gonna burn him too. something else. What do we have here? Couple more. Oh, look at them all. What 
Look at them all. We got more? I need a few more. Couple more. Come on. Yeah, they all ran over the cliff. Uh, I hate it when this happens. Damn it, Barrett. There we go, 50. Yay. I got so sidetracked from what I was doing. Where was I going? Probably back to the ship at this point. I accidentally sold my Heller's cutter. Oh, that sucks. I would say if you don't remember where it is, just uh, console yourself in a new one. If you remember, that'd be better, so then you don't have, like, you know, two of them in the game, because it could be bad. Uh, let's store all that. There we go. Alright, what are we doing here? F5 saving and. We have to return to Commander Tuala. Okay. Do I have anything in here? No, just apparel and resources. That's fine. Cool. We've seen some Basilis out in the wild after this quest. They're awesome. Just want to see them in action. I um I haven't decided if I want to go with the Asilis or however you say them. I think that's how you say it. Or if I want to go with the uh, the the pathogen or whatever it is. I went with the Asilis on one of my first. Uh, I think on my, on my, well, on my sniper. 
Because he was level 50-something plus before we even hit the new game. Uh, so... We're only level 13 now, so... Well, close to 14, I would think, after this. Um, we'll have to see. Got a moment? Let's catch up. Hmm? That's right, yeah, you wanted to talk, didn't you? I've been thinking a lot about my early days in Constellation lately. It got me pretty nostalgic, and I started digging in some old things. Just sort of reminiscing. Reminiscing? I found some of Irvin's last messages to me. Oh, it's weird. You can't ask him who Irvin is. He dislikes it. Uh... Were these previously unread messages? No, I apparently read at least a few of these. I just don't remember. It was a difficult time. Huh. Well, I hope it was at least a comfort. It was surreal, honestly. So, most of the messages were everyday things. Lots of... Oh, the, Z the Zeno, uh, you see. ...biodiversity and plant life. But yeah, never put anything on mannequins. If we haven't, if we've learned enough from Skyrim, don't put anything on mannequins. He said they sometimes disappear. There. It's Bethesda. The they haven't gone. sorted this shit out. <laughs> Even with mods. True, but this was different. I recognize this pattern from the war. Or maybe somebody came in and stole it. Was maybe it was a spacer. Well, Vasco helped me decipher it. Turns or maybe it was Vasco. Was from Irvin. Vasco's a thief, after he was all. Begging me to help him. The message was short, but his voice was. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I experienced all the uh, so bugs. <laughs> I see you corrected yourself. They are features. They were purposely put in there. Uh, what was the message? He said they were going to destroy his life if he didn't leave the planet now. Then he asked me to help clear his name. Said they had a case against him. Oh, he sounded so upset. Was he injured? No. He was frustrated and angry. He said they were going to destroy his name. Hmm. Yes. Hearing his voice in so much pain was very difficult. Oh, I wish I had noticed this message when he sent it. So in this message, Irvin said he was being framed. He said they'll do it again. He asked if Constellation could send more help. Framed for what? Not exactly sure, but he mentioned a court case. So I think there's a paper trail. Interesting. Who is they? His former employers at some job he took before he died. I think it was a mining company. Uh-oh. -uh. So you didn't notice the encrypted message before? No. I just thought it was garbled. I just wasn't paying attention. I don't know. Yeah, but it's 20 years old. It is, but I was thinking about it, and well, it's still wrong, right? So I figured, hey, I can do some sort of a remote investigation here, see what I can find out. There's got to be a paper trail, right? Now, I happen to have a trustworthy contact who knows a bit about law and owes me a favor. I'd need to pay in advance in case there are any access fees or bribes. Interesting. What's your contact going to do for us? Uh, he knows how to navigate archived and redacted legal documents, so he'll look for anything to do with Irvin on Gagarin. If I think we were at Gagarin. He might have to pay That's where one of the mining magazines is. Might need to grease some palms, too. Alright, let's... That works. Give him the 2500. Tell them to go ahead with the investigation. You know, hearing Irvin's voice again made me want to help him. Even though I know I can't. Does that make any sense?
Yeah, if he was that upset, then it must still be important. I appreciate that. It's going to be hard to get some sleep tonight after all this. But the fact that I'm doing something about it might be enough to help. Hopefully poking around in old records doesn't catch the attention of Hephaestus. Well, anyway, I'll let you know if my contact finds anything. Okay. So let's see, we gotta go up, uh, yeah, we were going up this way. Commander Tuala. Look who's back. All set with that probationary mission? We can do your debrief and formally welcome you into the Vanguard whenever you're ready. So I'm curious, Commander. Uh, how long have you been with the Vanguard? Me? Six? Seven years now? Was a recon squad commander in a former life. So it wasn't too big a jump bossing around foreign pilots instead. But Vanguard's been a quality assignment. Meet new people, judge them on a series Can't of... Can't catch a mod red-handed like that. Them out there helping people who need it. So listen, I need your permission to deliver a terramorph tissue sample to Mars. A terror? What? How did you walk away with the terramorph tissue sample running comms repairs? What happened to the settlers? Yeah, you're not gonna... Well, here. Uh... The thing that ate the settlers nearly ate me. wasn't really interested in the repairs. No, 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 we're not gonna say that. Uh, yeah, no survivors, sir. All lost to Terramorph, which I killed. You killed a Terramorph on your first mission. Yes. If I could be frank for a moment, holy shit. <laughs> I love that line. Earned yourself some serious hazard pay on this one. But, uh, if none of the settlers made it, who's got you delivering the sample? Uh, there was a researcher investigating the place. Uh, she gave me this gene tag to show you. A researcher? Let me see that. I love when he does that line. This guy's off. Tuala is just awesome, too. Let me check the database. Huh. A lot of this data has been classified. Here we go. Service record. He's like perfectly wow. set up physically for a That's samurai. Hair, beard. Distinction as co -head of a UC Even the uh, Face the Vanguard, Vanguard stuff seems to fit. It's more of a sleek suit, you know That's what I mean? That's name before. If she's former Xeno warfare, though, well, you can at least be sure she knows her aliens. Mm -hmm. Tell me about Xeno warfare. In the run-up to the colony war, the UC started a program with a singular goal. Find the deadliest, most terrifying aliens in the galaxy, and have them fight on the side of the UC. Never saw any of the deployments myself. Yep, uh, he just, he needs that Wakazashi, or... Now when the war came to an end 20 years ago, both sides agreed to have the practice banned. At which point, I presume, this tribunal decided to cut Sinan loose. See? Just like me. And yeah, I didn't even notice it until just now. Also has a badass scar over his left eye. Thank you very much. He's got a wakazashi in his pants. <laughs> Two things, wind. Hey, eh? it's this is a little more subtle than mine is. I like to make mine. Uh, you know, I advertise it right there. He, he seems to be using some skincare products. That's that's what that is. Yeah, it doesn't sound too good. I'm sure she doesn't list it at the top of her resume. But considering her service record and her area of expertise, I'm not seeing a reason to think this request is anything other than genuine. Did your survivor, Hadrian, does she mention why she thinks this sample is so special? Huh. There were some credits in it for me, that's all yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, she's afraid there could be more attacks like the one that wiped out the people of Tau Ceti. She thinks... There could be more of these? Yep. This, uh, 
has been one of the more surprising debriefs. Is that a Wakazashi in your pants? Or are you just happy to see me? Lined up <laughs> supporting <laughs> UC system defense against the Crimson Two fleet. things. Now I guess you have two options on how to proceed. Head to the UC Vigilance and help out SysDef, or deliver that sample. I'll make sure you've got the proper clearances for either path. Consider these your first official orders. And here, so everyone knows you're working with the Vanguard. Welcome to the Navy, Captain. Vanguard's also got some custom ship modifications. There we go. You'll be cleared for access to them next time you're down at the spaceport. Bam. The ship services. Now, if there wasn't anything else, I'd suggest you move out. Shit ton of money. Calibrated UC skip pack. Calibrated Vanguard spacesuit. That's that sounds pretty good. And a regular UC Vanguard space helmet. Okay, let's let's see here. Let's check this out. All right. Yeah, I knew we'd be getting this. That's why I didn't want to spend the money. So yeah, we lose bolstering, but we gain resistances. And yeah, I lose 15 in corrosion, but I gain it in airborne, which is nice. Alright, packs. So this one's going to be hard to give up. Uh... Because we're also going from a basic to a skip pack, but we're losing the oxygen and the fastened. But, again... Well, the numbers... Four, four in physical, eight in energy, six in electromag. I think we keep the pack. Plus, it uh, it, oh, it doesn't really match. It's not hideous, but it doesn't match. I say we keep this for a little bit. We'll go with this for now. Um, yeah, we're back down to... I gotta get Junk Flesh. And then the helmets here. Yeah, see, we didn't get a... Uh, a better one. Fuck. Yeah, that veteran calibrated deep recon space helmet's nice. I was hoping we get a better than standard here. That just looks weird. What's the reason for hotkeying your gear? Habit. Just habit. There's no other reason. Just because I like it and I want to. Also because I do it in Skyrim. So it sort of crossed over. Yeah, there's the big buff right there. see here how many more do we have yeah we got enough for for cert three uh medicine yeah we haven't taken much damage so i mean two there one there while i'm in the middle of doing this i'll likely throw in an astrodynamics just so i can get to spacesuit design because we, we definitely need this okay
Let's look at the quests here. Ask about Percival at the Trade Authority. Okay. Let's go do that. Plus, the uh, Vanguard has one of the nicest looking packs, in my opinion. Solid. I love the colors. Or like blue and orange for some reason just goes together for me. I don't know why. We'll uh, we'll obviously keep Barrett with us. I know you don't need to hotkey this stuff, and usually by the time I start getting the powers, I take them off the hotkeys anyway. So. That is convenient, but riding right after you're eating can give you stomach aches. Let's uh, let's go outfit our ship. How about that, yeah. We get some of that nice UC equipment on there. I'm liking it. I also like this. Hey, what can I do for you? Anything I can help you with? Uh, I may need repairs. Looks to me like you're already in pretty good shape. Sweet. Let's modify it. Okay, no problem. Okay. Ship builder. What are we adding here? Oops, hold on. Uh, we got Mauler 104 for the cannons. No, I'm sorry, hold on. Disruptor 3300. So we've got this. So the fire rate is the same, but the hull damage and the shield goes up. That's a class B, which we can't do. Okay. Um, twelve and twelve. Oh no, it's not. Hold on a second here. Hold on. That actually does more hull and shield. Although this has a better fire rate. Alright. We got a Mauler 104. <sighs> Which I think we were going to get rid of. That's this thing here.
So this is electromagnet. I can't use this anyway. This is B. We may actually keep these. I'd like to be able to get rid of this one. I could have sworn the Vanguard gave you a third one. This is the main. Yeah, the auto cannon's uh, class B. Yeah, we can't do anything with these. We could stick with this. We could add this back on for the second one. I didn't even think about that. The disruptor. This launcher is actually not that bad. Four thousand one point five. We would be launching this a little bit more. So now we, uh, I am assuming I have to, uh, there. All right, everything there is nominal. Cool. So let's see what else we're going to do here. Uh, Maybe a reactor, since I haven't done one yet, I don't think. What do we have? We have a uh, 340T. Helios 100 grav drive. Let's swap that out. Vanguard recon. So what do we have? Forty thousand. Uh, white dwarf engine. White dwarf, twenty ten. See what they have for engines. What they give me? Nothing. Guess our engines are. Yeah, 
Yeah, engines are fine, I guess. Yeah, and they'll be going to class B. Okay, that's fine. Mobility is down. What about for 20S protector for the shield here? That's what we have. Wow. That's pretty damn good. Look at that. Class B though. I can't do anything with it. tank. We got a 200, 200 G helium, so 70 and 5. Huh. That's interesting. Alright, doesn't fit. Oh, they're entirely different. fine. Let's just leave it alone. Right. Spending 50,000. Yeah, we're right at 50,000. Okay. Well, we got a few in there. We got some ship parts. Uh, let me make a save here, guys. I am going to take a bit of a break here. Good to see you guys in. Um, I'll put a BRB message up. Give me about five minutes or so, and I will be right back.
think. Okay, yeah, we're back. Cool. Uh, let me just make sure it uh, seems to be okay on the phone. All right. What were we doing again? We bought our stuff. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, ask about Percival at the Trade Authority, which I guess is not here. Like we've been gone forever. There we go. So, yeah, I mean, like for me, like right now, this works. Uh, the Vanguard stuff I like. You just don't. You don't keep it very long. Is the problem? At least I don't. And if I have another junk flesh on me, just so I can get that up. Of course I don't. All right, we have to go look for one of them. We, we got to go talk to a doctor. We also need some more ammunition. Keep the cutter on me. Beautiful. This never. And I'm gonna wind up repainting the uh, the frontier. I just forgot about it. I wanted to upgrade it a little bit more, but I also don't want to blow all my money on it right now. So little by little. Keep the shields up. Uh, quest. Where are we heading to? Where are we heading to? Sidonia. We like Sidonia. Yeah, definitely a solid looking suit overall. I like it. Like I said, I'm a big fan of the uh, Living in the ground, blue and orange. It's been a classic human maneuver since I was being... may be rough around the edges, but it is utterly monumental for humanity. Yeah, lots of stuff. Just ask. Hey, welcome to the Sidonia Trade Authority. So I'm uh, looking to make a trade. Cool. That's what we do here. Is that what you do here? Oh, he's got a bunch of it. We're taking that. What do I have? We could sell the Equinox, finally. And one Orion, 666. Six, six. We only need one. Of course, I could give it to uh, Barrett, but... Nah. He's fine. Anything else we have here? I may hold on to this. I should have put this on my ship. Same with the pack. Right, the we'll, ooh. Yeah, we're wearing like the worst one. <laughs> Look at that. That, I, man. Even that looks better. 
I really wish I got an upgraded version of the Vanguard helmet. Because that I think we're going to wind up wearing that. We'll get rid of the shock troop. Yeah. All right. Let's see here. Let's go to buy. Where are you put that? Um, Let's see what he's got. I wouldn't expect him to have better. Not here, anyway. Uh, you have any junk flush? He does not. We'll take the squall. And I think there's, yeah, the doctor's is right across the way, right? Come back anytime. All right, Minaki. Bef well, let's go talk to what's his nuts over here. Octai. Invoices can be collected from the. Oh. Not here for a delivery. Never come across oh. a good time to use mines. I sell them too. Yeah, I um, I do not like the mines. There's no range, and if you're holding one, or you're getting rid of one, and an enemy hits you, or, like, it just blows up, it'll kill you. At least with a grenade, you're you're launching it, it's got some arc time. It's almost impossible to kill yourself with a grenade. Now, the chance of, uh, it hitting off something and bouncing back to you, then, then, yeah, that's, that's a you problem. But, the mines, nah. Not at all. They're just, they're, they're garbage. I hope somebody comes along and uh, makes a mod to make them useful, or at least um, placeable. Now, they work better if you're a stealth character, if right? Nothing else but pressing. the problem is they make sound. Like, when you drop them, they make sound. That's that's the problem. So, uh, Captain Quinn, Vanguard, I need Percival Walker's help investigating a troubling discovery. Do you know? Mm-hmm. Well, I do wish I could help you, Captain, but Dr. Walker has been missing for some time. Missing? A shame, too. We had such high hopes for Percival. Somebody remind me, we I have to go back to Apex Electronics in, uh... And ...biological consulting around the city. In the well. Not the sort of work the Trade Authority traditionally does. But we thought it had the potential to become a whole new type of revenue stream for our branch. I invested no small amount of personal capital into the endeavor. But then he decided to run off after a discipline issue. Huh. I presume the miners have him hidden somewhere. Plenty of cracks on this old rock. Plenty but of cracks. At this point, it's probably for the best. Interesting. What, uh, what sort of discipline issues are we talking about here? Dr. Walker decided to start brewing and selling his own pharmaceuticals ah. to our customers below cost. Something his contract expressly forbade. As such, we requested our cut of the profits and began garnishing his salary. Perhaps a little too severely, but well within legal limits. It was around then that he ran off, abandoning his duty and his unpaid accounts. So he owes money too, huh? Why would the miners hide him? They were all devils. Red devils. A UC Marine unit based here on Mars, though they were disbanded shortly after the colony war. I presume a number of them served alongside Dr. Walker. Bonds forged in battle and all that. Okay. Yeah, you don't sound particularly interested in finding him, though. That's correct. We're no longer interested in Dr. Walker's services. All right, well, I am. He did leave his post, however, with a sizable debt to his name. If you were to find him and get him to pay, the Trade Authority would be most grateful for it. And you need fabulous interplanetary explorers to get this guy to pay his bills, huh? <laughs> How much does he owe? <laughs> Why? Feeling charitable? I don't recall the exact figure off the top of my head, but with the interest it's accrued, I believe it's something substantial. 
So if you were able to find him and convince him to clear his accounts, you would have our honest gratitude. Okay, I'll see what I, do, I can do. Just tell me where you, he was last seen. No promises, though. Got it. Parrot. I suggest paying a visit to the Sixth Circle, what I suppose is technically a bar on the lowest level of the city. If anyone knows where Percival is, the miscreants there would. But I would urge caution. They're not a group known for their hospitality. All right, fair enough. Let's go, Barrett. Come on. Your children will be provided with routine programs teaching them art, science, math. <sighs> Let me guess. You're here because you were working a cutter, accidentally nipped your thumb off, and you need me to reattach it again. The. Uh, no. See, thumb still attached. Well, that's a relief. So, what is it then? Some other workplace accident? Crushed toes? Nasty abrasion? Frostbite? <sighs> Sorry. I tend to think the worst, since the overwhelming majority of my patients come here to treat entirely preventable accidents. I know it's my job to help people, and I love doing it, but I do wish they'd be a little more careful down in the mines. I'm Dr. Flynn. What can I do for you today? Uh... So, wow, she can get rid of both. Yeah, if you choose these options, right? Alien DNA will get rid of that. When I spend time in space, I just feel terrible. Out of curiosity, I want to see what she says here. That happens more than you think. There's a certain percentage of people that experience adverse effects in space. Fortunately, there's a procedure you can go through that can correct it. But once you get it, the procedure can't be undone. Yeah. So, if you ever wanted to get rid of... Yeah, 10,000 credits. No fucking thank you. For one of the best things in the game, I'll think Take about it. Take all the time you need. Yeah. It's a big decision. This is where Bethesda should have done a total recall. Yeah, the lower levels of Sidonia? Yep. Alright, well, hold on there. Oh, I swear to Charlie, I need help. Let's have a little look see at ya, shall we? Yeah, a little look see. Not really? a big one. You came to me for that? <laughs> okay. <laughs> look at this guy back here. <laughs> He's staring at her ass, you know he is. Uh cure my addictions. Uh take care of all of it. Oh good. This looks like a nice and easy patch job for once. He's still staring. Looks like we're gonna need the strongest stuff <laughs> to cure you. Hold still. You're good to go. Careful around the affected area. Give it time to heal completely. He hasn't budged. Well, first, I need some medical supplies. Of course. Just try to make it quick in case things get busy. Mm hmm. Nice. Nine of them. Do I have anything else to sell to her? How many med packs do we have now? 22. I'll I'll take it. Let's get rid of some other stuff here. We need squall. We got 15. I think we're good. We're good on packs. We got some junk packs. So, uh, I will try to. Hey, let me in. Spears upstairs. Go drown yourself there. This bar's for devil's vets and their kin. Let's see here. Let's just 
tell him we're Vanguard. So I heard you might know where Percival Walker is. Doc Walker? Well, you're barking up the wrong... Andy, you, why don't you come here and tell me what some Vanguard captain wants with Walker? Yeah, 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 give me a second here. Sometimes you guys leave your credits laying around. You're gonna get me in trouble. Once I was in a glacial cave, surrounded by creepy red eyes, kind of like this. But it turns out they were just glowing bug butts. Topsider wanders into my bar asking after a man like Percival Walker. Raises questions. What do you want with him? Hey, what do we want with him? Oh, we don't want to be scaring everybody. I'm making a delivery for Hadrian Sanan. Uh, I even have proof she sent me. Hadrian? A woman named Hadrian sent you, a member of the Vanguard, to find Percival. Hmm. Now, if that tag's a forgery, it's a damn good one. All right, Captain. If you are who you say, Supra et Ultra. Vanguard motto. What's it mean? Should have gotten that during her oath. Mm hmm. Hmm. I see. And tell me, what grade was it you got on your entrance exam? A, C, D plus? That is right. All right, Captain. Maybe you are who you say you are. But look, even if I decided I was going to help you get in contact with Dr. Walker, Percival made himself scarce for a reason. Oh, yeah? His debt to the trade authority. Yeah, I'm here about that. that debt, well, Percival wouldn't have to hide anymore. Can bet that person would make a friend out of Percival and the rest of us devils. And I'm always inclined to help a friend. How are you now? So you, both you and Percival are red devils. Tell me more about them. Red devils with the meanest marine unit the UC Navy ever had. Couldn't get in if you hadn't done at least one stint as a Martian Dusty. Made us tough, reliable. It's why they chose us as the handlers for the UC Xeno weapons. No other unit could handle that pressure. Percival, though, he wasn't a grunt like all of us. Science officer. Made sure the monsters behaved themselves around the devils didn't with everyone else. It was those <laughs> monsters that did us in. When the colony war ended and the armistice came down, everything associated with Xeno weapons got shelved, red devils included. Now, yeah, now they're just a memory. So you work with them? Me? No. Nah. Infantry officer. But my grunts deployed alongside the things. Never seen anything like it, before or since. Monsters from the darkest corners of the black rampaging across the battlefield. And understand why they banned them. Brutal. Armistice hurt us more than most, but... Wow. Wasn't all bad that came out of that agreement. How would you suggest they go about clearing his name? Well, the most straightforward way to take care of this debt would be to just saunter up to the authority and pay him direct. If you've got credits to throw away. Hmm. Of course, Ruby And I don't like throwing away credits. Keeps all their records and collections files on a central server inside their storeroom. 
If someone was to break in there and adjust Percival's debt to something a little more reasonable, say, a few hundred credits, I'd be happy to cover the cost. I bet Barrett's gonna be pissed off. Sure. We can help you commit a petty crime to secure your professional support. Why the hell not? But, uh, one <laughs> from Hadrian's to another. Sidonia is full of old utility spaces. Wouldn't be surprised if there was one that let out right into the authority storeroom. Say, with an entrance behind the bar at the Broken Spear. Ooh, and you might need these. I'll see what I can do. And I look forward to hearing the good news. Hey, you, maybe the Adrian's friend. Come here. Heard you talking with Lou, so you're going to help Dr. Walker? Uh... I'm gonna try to. Oh, good, good. Oh, Percival's a good guy. Listen, you can do it without having to resort to any... DNA. Aqueous hematite. Mars is full of it. People think it's just garbage. But Percival and I, we've been working on some... Projects in the deep mines. At least when he wasn't slaving away at his trade authority contract. But we stumbled on a way to make it useful and profitable. You give our research over to Octai at the trade authority, it should more than cover Percival's debt. That guy's always looking for an angle. Interesting. Cambridge. I was Percival's assistant. Well, apprentice, really. Couldn't work in the mines anymore, so he gave me a job helping with some of his side projects. Know his experiments inside and out, and I know this one was going to be big. Okay. I presume there's a reason you haven't handed it over already? Well, yeah. We were never able to finish the research. The spacers moved in and ran us out. Started setting up shop. Here comes the butt. <laughs> but if you can clear them out... I can walk you through how to finish the research. <laughs> I love it. But then you can give it over to the trade authority. They'll get folks working in the deep mines again. Jobs come back, I become a modern day folk hero. <laughs> then I don't have to sleep on an inflated spacesuit anymore. We know about the spacers. Uh, yeah, awful lot of work to avoid buying a pillow, but sure, yeah. Great, great. We're gonna go this route. So access to the deep mines can be found outside the city. It's not far. Shouldn't even need to hop back in your ship. We've set up right near the main drill. Taking out the spacer leader should get the message across to the rest of them to buzz off. Once you've managed that, phone up here on the comms panel, and I can walk you through finishing the research. Gotcha. All right. Do I really need to switch? Fucking hell. Should be good enough. Yeah, the UC stuff is actually, I mean, corrosive is the only other thing I can think of. Yeah, we're definitely switching back to this.
Oh, it actually doesn't look too bad. shot, Barrett. What is this? Galvanized. Ooh! Good job, Barrett. <coughs> we got one bastard left, right? <laughs> From the back. Yes. It's amazing. Once, you, once they start getting lit on fire... Man, the damage just stacks. 
Um, same thing, same thing with the arc welder. I mean, if you have the right stuff, you don't even you don't need to focus it. But it is nice to hit them with the focus in the beginning and then let go of mouse two. We should absolutely expect to see more spaces in the mines. No doubt about it. Uh, let's get the amp going. Let's get that. Uh, what do we have? Uh, let's just take one of them. <laughs> Who knows if we need it? Uh, what else are we taking? The uh, squall for the extra damage boost. Right. Hi. Like this. Yeah, I don't think so. Okay, hold on a second. Now we're starting to get into some... Oh, it's crap. We got a resource hauler and mechanized. Look at that. Resources. This will be good for if we're ever out. I don't want to look like the Stay Puft Marshmallow Man. Yeah, the cutter is very underrated. It's the highest DPS weapon in the game. But you gotta work to get it up there. Oh. Hold on a second. Alright, sorry. We're back. Yeah, it, um... Starts at three with the crappy range of three. Now the range you can't fix. But we've boosted up to eight because it's a laser weapon and it's a it's a heavy weapon. So it benefits from foreign lasers. Especially this is the big boy here. You want rank four ASAP. 
this 5% chance to set them on fire, this stacks with every hit. And since it's a constant stream, sort of like the Arc Welder, uh, and it doesn't use ammo, I mean, you just have to reduce the recharge time, plus it benefits from heavy. So you get another 10, 20, uh, 30. Oh, we have a skill point. Hold on a second. Twenty-five percent resistance. Um, let me see if we could use this elsewhere. Boy, this is the tough call here. This is, you know, to make. I can give myself more. Yeah, we need wellness. Because we're still working on Medicine 3, that's fine. But spend one more skill point to unlock Advance. I do need this. Shit. Let's go Astro Dynamics. We needed that anyway. This is part of the build. Okay. Oh, are we, uh... Yeah, see, there. look at that. You get a legendary soup, but you get crap numbers. Like, look at the physical resistance. It's just absolute garbage with this thing. The rest of them are no picnic either, and then... Yeah, you get these, but it's just... Uh... We're going to be getting something better. I still think this is... Solid, although we're going to wear the Vanguard stuff. Um, yeah, the Vanguard pack was fine, but I mean, that's got crap numbers. That's got better. This is why we're wearing this. It doesn't look like absolute garbage. We'll get rid of these two. And I'm going to switch. Yeah, I'm going to switch back to this because this has better physical resistance, and we we kind of need it. What do we have here? Lung damage and solar radiation. Wonderful. And we're over encumbered, but that's fine. There's there's no uh, there's no anything here. down this way. Okay. That plutonium. Looking for more of the dead ones. Ah! What do we got here? Damn expert. This life of mine. I found an old book of astrology apparently I'm a Sagittarius whatever that means and get this my horoscope said that you should not be afraid of the dark cave and the truth that lies within obviously nonsense but it's fitting 
Guess the broken clock is right twice a day. This is the third of these abandoned shafts that I've gone exploring in, and there's tons of good stuff that they just left behind. The advent of laser mining may have been a challenge for these old big machine based mines, but they're just a jackpot for scroungers like yours truly. Big mining conglomerates look at a huge piece of machinery and decide it's not worth it to drag it out. But someone like me, I can spend a month poking around and tearing out old heat exchangers and make a year's salary selling them to scrappers at Stonia. Huh. Okay. Fender fodder, right? Yeah, that's all it is. I can't break into that, though. Oh, well. I think we looted these guys already. Yeah. Hey, who's that? Give a little poke, poke, pokeroo. Yeah, I'm taking you out. Just standing there like an idiot. <laughs> Alright, let's recharge this. Quarters are up ahead. It's going to be packed with spacers. Mark my word. I should do this. Let me re let me swap these. Hold on a second. I'll put the arc welder on one, because that's my main one. And then, uh... We'll put the Orion on two, because it's easier for me to hit one. One, four. Okay. Now I gotta remember that I swapped it. And it stuns them too, which is great. Oh, sorry, Barrett. Sorry, dude. Oh, there's another one left. Seems clear. Well, back to business. Hey Barrett, where where you at? Hey buddy. Oh, pardon me. Let's trade gear. Of course. The reality of exploration is the balancing of supplies.
want to go that way. Let's, uh... Oh, wow, locked. This is the first lock I've seen in ages. Crazy. We haven't had to to bust in. Oh, we'll take that. The alien jerky? I notice I've been taking more food and I shouldn't be. Yeah, this is the place we wanted to check. So what do they got up here? Deep mining helms. That's a bolstering one. That's actually not bad. What's that? You see Davy what? <laughs> there, we did check this. We just didn't check the uh, other side. What do we got down there? Minor hard hat, huh? Oh, expert. Ah, yeah, fuck. Okay. You're a master safe, because of course you are. Alright, uh, we checked there, we checked there. What about over here? This is the bathroom, yes we did, yes we did. Uh, let's check up here. Ooh, can we get into the gym? Hey, hey, Varun scripture. We'll take it. I hate that, like, one thing in a big chest like that. I don't like it. Of course, I love big chests, but not, you know. Not like that. Alright, what do we got? A little bit. Ooh. Fair game. Fair game, yes. There's the gym. Ha! Huh. What a waste. All right, Barrett, let's uh, let's keep on keeping on. Anything over here? Not really. You want to carry some of my weapons? Grenade in the fridge? Was there? Ah. Can I carry that for you? You could, yes. Uh, here. Oh, well, look at that. Just a regular engineering outfit. But if you take the black one, stats are different. You swap the physical and energy and the thermal and the corrosive. Interesting. We're going to wear this one, though, for now.
for the extra re reload speed. Not that we really need it. I, I could pro I could probably get off with. Uh... Oh. Oh, he went down. Yeah, never mind. <laughs> Sorry, that's amusing. Coming to get you. Huh? Hey, we need the hematite, damn it. Really? Bethesda, come on. I love it. They make it so you can't freaking mine this stuff. Look at this. That's that's the big boy. You want to fight that way? Fine, let's go. How do you like it? Oh, look at your health just being sapped. Oh, you don't like it. That's because I kick ass, Barrett. Jeez. So here's the thing, yeah like some of these you just can't mine. So with the cutter build guys, let me go in here, you had that same issue with the mine? Yeah so some places, like I, I first noticed it with um, the initial place on Vectera right? You, Some of the things you have a hard time mining. Uh, some of the... Uh, Celionite, the stuff that's surrounding the uh, artifacts, whatever that's, how do you, however you pronounce that stuff, it begins with a C. Anyway, not all of it you can mine, where it looks like you can mine, you can even hover over it, right? And the name will pop up, but it doesn't matter, it's just, it is what it is. But there's some 
caves where like I got so frustrated because it's like make the hitbox a little bit larger like I hope that's going to be in like one of the official unofficial patches uh, that uh, Algari and uh, Simon and everybody else who's on that team are doing uh, that they actually fixed the hitboxes to make them uh, proper uh, another thing I've noticed too after you mine when you when you you know break rock break the vein right some of those fragments that fall down they're supposed to disappear they just kind of float right above and never really go away until you uh, uh, exit and enter cell but they're supposed to it, it's it's not anything that's game breaking it can look odd because then when you use your scanner you can still see the fragments and it's almost like something you didn't mine do you know what I mean? I'm also stretching and grabbing a drink, so so Wind won't yell at me anymore. She she won't spank me. Although I, I I should probably not do those things because everybody likes a good spanking. <laughs> so it'd be like this, right? Like you're looking, you're looking, like see that thing. So say I broke that, right? The fragments are still there. It's still going to show up on my scanner like that. Like outlined in green. Which is a pain in the ass. So. He's dead. Uh, let's see. Here. We got more of your spacers. Yeah. You gonna do it. You're only level 8. Oh, you're fucked. Look how quickly he goes down. Hi! Get effed. Ooh! Alright. I give you points for that one. That was pretty solid. Was not expecting that, but hey. What were you gonna do again? I'm sorry. I missed you over all of the dying. <laughs> Anti-ballistic calibrated nav space helmet. Rare. Crap, crap, crap. <sighs> What's up, Barrett? No, let's go down there. Yeah. Does I have the hiccups again? I would love to see Trotsky's uh, version of a cutter. I would love to see his retexture. Not of Heller's. Uh, well, I, I guess beggars can't be choosers. Uh, but just the base one. Hel uh, well, actually, I take that back. Um, if you could make Heller's cutter like bluish to kind of match this, or maybe black. Black would be better. Like a charcoal color. That would be awesome. Charcoal and like rust colored. You're yeah, I know, I'm carrying some stuff. What's that? Beast Hunters. Ah, oh, boy. Balance Shock Troop. What are we wearing? Yeah, we're wearing the galvanized. Do we go back to this? Yeah, we're gonna have to. Carrying a lot. You wanna take a moment to shuffle things around? See, they just throw stuff at you. Fucking master locks. Okay. Where are we headed? We're headed over in Yaw. Yeah. 
Contact Cambridge on the. Oh, oh yeah. Hello. Cambridge. Took care of the spacers, huh? Yeah. Good. We kicked their ass. The What's up, Chance? It's like the hitbox is way off, yeah. Jocilius, I a hundred percent agree with you. Um, I typically don't mine a lot unless it's a rare element. Like it's got two, three, four of those little stars. It's about the only time because you can go into any shop and purchase in bulk everything you need and it's dirt cheap and then you just sell them back like crap ammo you don't need and you make your money back as opposed to taking the time out now i do the research when i'm on a plant i do scan things and if i scan something then i take a sample of it back same thing with the plants you see me scanning the plants all the time i'm always taking the nutrients and things like that because those are things i'm going to sell to noel now if you if you didn't notice um let me, let me get out of this first Aries 2330. Gotcha. Okay, so. In your resources, I think I gave these up. The there's Sometimes there's two of them, and the one's in parentheses. Like, there may be another nutrient that doesn't have this parentheses tissue, right? And it weighs a little bit more. These are things that we got off of something natural out in the world. I know Baird's probably got a bunch. I got a ton on my ship. These are the ones that Noel will pay you good money for. And you don't need these for crafting things. You you need the regular ones. Like regular nutrient. Right? That doesn't have this where it says tissue. Um, and she'll actually pay you a lot of money for stuff. See how the value says 5? She'll give you good money for these. Well, not good money. She'll give you better money than what that says. So, Uh... All right, what did he say we needed to do? Ah. Well, we already have some. Uh, all right, Cooper, we did it. Chance, how you doing, buddy? Oh, we'll kill them. Did you notice that one spacer was level 28? But you just so here's the other nice thing about the cutter, and to some lesser extent, the arc welder, but more specifically the cutter. When you hit somebody in the head, it doesn't matter if it's targeted, or I should say, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Focused. Focus is the orange beam. Normal is the red the red beam. Right? If you hit them in the head, they almost always stagger. This goes for any this goes for any enemy. Not just human. This goes for aliens. This goes for terramorphs. This goes for any enemy in the game. You hit them first in the head with this, you stagger them, plus they have the five percent chance to get the burn, then you just let go of it and you keep going. You keep hitting them in the head because it staggers them. You could also s shoot around their body. You get a better chance to stagger as, as far as I've tested, right? So like, uh, let's go, f we'll, we'll test this out on another enemy and I'll kind of show you, let me have five here. Uh, I'll kind of show you what I'm talking about. Is he alive? No, he's dead. Where are we going here? Oh, find the elevator key. probably need you okay uh, let's look at the quest here we need to change personal uh, we're not gonna do that because that's breaking in so we need to return the data to Cambridge and pay off the debt we're done here we are done here uh, okay so there's no more spacers there's no more anything um, I think did we come this way let's see I think we did yeah, because these buttholes are all dead. Oh, but you... Find a use for that stuff. Alright. All 
Okay. Let's, uh, let's GTFO. Okay. I've been I've been wanting to do this build for a while. Also, no matter what weapon you guys choose, anytime you see heat no leeches, way. look at these old machines. Nobody does it like this anymore. Anytime you see any of these, like these, the grubs, those Xeno grubs that are just use your main weapon. If you're in stealth, or you're doing like a sniper, go into stealth first. And just take him out. It, it it's just free experience and and, and skill towards uh towards your uh, next level or next rank, I should say. That's why you see me like switch. Like I'll switch from like the cutter uh, back to the cutter or whatever. So. Let's go back up. Now we got a whole crap load of stuff to sell. We got to go back to uh, New Atlantis. Before we go to Sidonia, I'll tell you why. Well, I'll tell you why later. Anything we forgot? Still can't get in there, huh? Where's the pity? Let's go, Barrett. My, oh my, look at this place. And also keep an eye on those spacers. Yeah, they're dead. Unless they had a ship that landed outside. The, the nice thing I like about the uh, ammo, and I know Karn mentioned it too, it's, it's in abundance, right? This. This is dirt cheap. It is in abundance. It works for the Orion, it works for the Equinox, it works for the Arc Welder. Dirt fucking cheap. Sell all the rest of your stuff. You'll buy, buy this up as much of you, as you can if you're deciding you're going to do this. And then just remember that this is your long range. This is your utility. And this is your main. I will be, I will be fixing uh, some things about the cutter. We're going to make it even better once the... Uh, official tools come out. And I should probably just grab all the things, right? Wow, look at this. Wear yourself out if you carry all this stuff. How did I miss two frag mines in that thing? A new hand oh! The beacon. The other nice thing about it too is it's like the he heavy particle stuff, it's got that nice green casing. Hey, where's Noelle? Uh, she is back on in the lodge. She doesn't come with you. She's not a. Uh, she's not a hands-on uh, member.
And yeah, we could waste a med pack on that because that's 50. The, the, the higher this gets, the better it's going to be overall. That's why I want to max this out at 4. Um, it's also why I want to max out uh, wellness. We're, we're at 2. We only need these. Maybe we'll go into weightlifting too. I don't know. I just I really want to get to rejuvenation. But again, that's you know priorities and things like that. So Gotta use that amp, speed freak. Uh, uh, who's that? How do you pronounce that? Is that Zat Zatmos? Has a pretty sweet mod surrounding the cutter. Uh, Thor, welcome in. If you were lurking, hi. Uh, I don't have any mods in this. So I won't be, uh, until the official tools are out, I won't be doing anything, uh, modding-wise. Meaning I'll be making my own, so. But I, and I try not to check, I try not to check Nexus to see, I, I, I do on occasion, but it's, Yeah, no, no worries at all. Yeah, lurk away. We we love lurkers here. Never never feel obliged to. Uh... Oh, I don't know. I mean, where you see that, he is kind of a big boy. I did make him bulkier. Like I gave him like the most muscular frame, but I also added like the weight slider up a little bit. But that makes him. I don't want him to be like a no neck. <laughs> used to think I was material. He's still on the juice. Alright, let's get Baird in here so I can sell some things. Come here, dude. You're carrying a lot of my stuff. Hey. Need something? Yeah, let's trade. Yeah, so let's make sure we have everything. Be prepared for anything, <laughs> right? Uh, yeah. Let's see, you got, uh... He likes this instigating Grendel. Yeah, we're going to sell these. Naki may not be able to buy all this stuff. Uh, you can hold my... I may have more resources for you. Yeah, here you can take my resources. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Hey, Manaki. I love this guy. Manaki. He's probably my favorite NPC on Sidonia. Him and him and uh, Trevor. And Jack. Let me rephrase. Manaki's my favorite. Jack is right below him. The guy in uh, the broken spear. Sounds like a plan. I can also take stuff off your hands. Charles too, Farmer. That's something you're interested in. Yeah, out of, out of curiosity, Thor, what what does that mod do? I, I am curious. Uh, let me see. Let me go to... I want to make sure he's got the ammo first. I think we bought him out. Yes, we did. Let's check aid. Um, I think we bought him out of aid as well. And we have no need for uh, CQBX on this one. 
What about resources? Let's buy all his resources. Now let's sell him some stuff. Furious Technophiles Pacifier. So yeah. Hey, we're back down to my original four. And I don't even know why. I think it's because I'm part of the UC. So we may use this. Sometimes I do use... I always keep a melee weapon on me. And it's typically at least this. Now, I'll use a shank uh, if I can find a decent one. Like a rare or epic. And then, of course, I'll swap out because it's, it's got abilities on it. This is just plain Jane, whatever. I lucked out with this lacerate arc welder, though. This thing, look at this. Anti-personnel for humans and randomly applies bleed. So they're more damage. They're on fire and they're bleeding. Th this is better than some legendary I'm going to find, I guarantee. But look at the value. It's so low. Like, 655? Are you fucking kidding me? That's amazing. That's so good. <laughs> uh, let's see here. Some are QOL, others are cheats. Cheat mods disable achievements, but then there's yeah, there's mods to re-enable the achievements again. The only mod I use is the inventory mod. Yeah, everybody asks me why I don't use it. Um, I like it. Trust me, I like the I downloaded the inventory mod just to endorse it. I don't use it because I don't mind the inventory system. Now, of course, once I start dipping into this and um, modding it, of course, I'm going to wind up using it, right? But I, I just did it as a courtesy to the author uh, because you can't endorse unless you download. So that's what I did. I do that with a lot of things. Everything I download and use, I always endorse, whether I like it or not. At least if I download it once, that, that author gets an endorsement from me, as it should be, even if you don't like it. Like, it may be the worst mod ever. I still give it to them because, you know, well, not if it's the worst mod ever. I mean, if, if it's something I use and it's good, if it's something that I use and it's okay, I'll probably still endorse it. If it's not good, I won't endorse it. Basically adds rarity tiers to them all the way to legendary. Uh, also adds in certain... Variants of cutters you can find by that have more damage. Oh, wow. Yeah, that would make it... That would be an OP build right there. I mean, you guys see how it's doing on vanilla. I'm not having a problem. You saw me take that Terramorph right to school. Uh... The Deep Recon, huh? Like this, like look at this legendary. I like resource hauler. I like mechanized. Ah, man, we got to get rid of bolstering though. Otherwise, I don't know, man. This is actually pretty good. Look at this. Yeah, my physical goes down. My physical kind of sucks, but the energy and electro mag isn't terrible. Oh well, yeah, it is. Alright, before I think about it. It's too bad the numbers. I would wear this and look like a fool if those resistance numbers were better. If they were like mid 50s. But the physical is way too low and I can't do it. So. Let's see ya. Packs. Uh, we were running the galvanized shock troop. We're also keeping this. We're keeping this. 40, 42, 44. So we're wearing this. We're going to go back to this. Uh, 
Okay. Helmets. Oh, let's check first mine, right? This is what we're wearing. Vanguard's worse, but we're not selling it. Uh, boosted oxygen. This is another bolstering. Numbers aren't good, though. Numbers aren't good. Anti-ballistic. Numbers aren't good. Uh, can't do it. We'll keep these. All right. Since we, we've got a black engineering, the regular engineering can go. Oh, boy, I do not like the flannel. What else do we have here? So we got what, 14 med packs? I wow, I use more than them. Uh, let's see here. Need the squall. Keep forgetting to I yeah, just selling that. I keep forgetting to use it. And the rest of the stuff can go on. Oh, that's right. Ammo. How much does he have? Twelve fifty. Not bad, guys. We're back up to about sixty thousand. Can we get another thousand out of him? We're going to wind up using this one. But I don't really want to get rid of this, and we're not selling that. Damn it. Doubles. Almost, we came close. Thanks, Manaki. Alright, let's go back and we need to see. We need to see Cambridge. Who shut the door on me? Capacity. Mm -hmm. This stuff can make a miner way more efficient. This formula's got to be worth at least as much as whatever Percival owes. Okay, so here's what you do: tell Octai in the trade. And this gives me pick me up proposal that will make miners more efficient, higher yield, synergy. You know, all that business crap. <laughs> I love this guy. To him for clearing Percival's debt. You good at doing pitches and stuff like that? I mean, I can make it work. Sure. Yeah, I can give it a whirl, sure. Oh, this is gonna be great. Oh, and here, a copy of the formula for yourself, in case you ever wanna try maximizing your own industrial output. Mm -hmm. oh, use that if you can. Good luck. <sighs> okay. Let's 
go, Barrett. Was there something else? Uh, actually, I uh, have a business proposal for you. A very lucrative one. Hmm. I'm never one to turn away an opportunity, but I'd be curious what you think you've uncovered in the Martian market that others have missed. Oh, don't you worry about that. A chem. Made from aqueous hematite, I call it pick me up. Aqueous hematite. Aqueous. Iron and wastewater. Yes. Well, I'm not surprised no one has proposed something like this. Yeah, before. wastewater. What do you think? And exactly what does this new drug of yours do? <laughs> Makes your miners more efficient, and I've got the data to back it up. An interesting proposal, if your data pans out. But where's this hematite coming from? The active mines would be too expensive to retool. The deep mines could be an option. Yeah, spaces. not anymore. So I've heard. Yeah, there. I've. I've already cleared them out. Won't cost you a credit to get started. Well, now, that is intriguing. A completely untapped resource pool. Mm -hmm. And the sort of utility every mining firm in Sidonia would be clamoring to get their hands on. We could contract out all the actual lab work. Bring on one of the hungrier mining concerns for materials. The licensing fees alone. And think what it would do for our image with the general populace. This mine reopened thanks to the Martian Trade Authority. Very interesting indeed. Mm -hmm. And what do you want for the rights to this drug? I would like you to clear Percival's debt. Dr. Walker's debt? That's it? Consider it wiped. Well, it seems we have a deal then. And here. A finder's fee from the authority. Nice. A perfectly reasonable amount for a discovery with this sort of potential. Wouldn't want you feeling shortchanged. Ha, I see what you did there. You'd just be taking that slate before you have any second thoughts. It was a pleasure doing business with you, Captain. Uh, let's go tell Lou the good news. Let's go, Barrett. It's not easy living in Sidonia. Mars isn't for everybody. What's up, Lou? Yeah. I took care of Percival's debt to the TA. Did you now? Mm hmm Fine work. It is. My end of the bargain, then, I suppose. Your turn. He's holed up in the old Red Devil's HQ. Interesting. The place was sealed up tight after the UC shuttered our unit. But we snuck him in the back entrance through the deep mines. Right in the back door, also huh? also going to warn you about spaces down there. Yeah. But it sounds like you might have already tossed those drakes. Yeah, the passkey. And I'll let him know there's someone he owes one hell of a thank you on their way down. Fair enough. Another 500 credits. And, uh... Alright, let's go do the thing here. A lot of folks would have stuck their necks out for a stranger like that. I really should have kept that legendary suit. At least I feel like I should have. What do we got here? Oxygen and fastened. 
Yeah, we'll keep that on. We'll be switching to this one though for for normal. do a few things first we're gonna get three those three uh, cyber runner cyber magazines because that's gonna buff my lasers by 15% sup Fosco uh, no, we're good. <laughs> Did someone leave some food out before we left? Whoa! Yo! Trade with me, Barrett. Hmm. Let's rearrange. Give me all them resources. You don't need them. Right. No worries. Alright. Ever get that hour of sleep? You're awake. Yeah. All right, so Ooh, look at this. Let's toss the. Uh, well, you know what we're gonna need. Let's go back here. This is the broken console. All right, so that stays in here. These can stay in here. Let's see what they gave us. Did they give us anything good? All right, we got ten ship parts. Rest of the stuff. Get out of here. Notes, Barrett's personal slates. Take all the resources and This is because I modified the ship. Alright, so this is for main cargo. This is gonna go for specialty things like uh, the snow globes. We're gonna keep her tag on me. Uh, the London snow globe. Alright, so any plushies. That's a sample. Okay. We're good. Now we get a nice save here. Oni, welcome in. Yeah, this isn't... Well... It, it's a build I've been wanting to do. This is the one that I've... Uh, I built it... The very beginning of September. Uh, it's using the cutter as the main weapon. And it's focusing around uh, some tech skills, uh, physical skills, a few science skills, and um, well, I'll show you in a little bit. We're, we're level 13 still, so. I had them built before, and I, I started it back in uh, early September, probably like right after my assassin uh, play, like my initial assassin, like my initial sniper play. I started it. I think I did like a stream or two with it, but but I didn't have it uh, at maturity. Now. All right, so we're gonna go. We're gonna find Percival in a minute, but we want to go right back to uh, New Atlantis real quick. So let's go to Alpha Centauri. Let's make the jump. Well, for a while anyway. So we use the cutter as our main weapon, Heller's cutter. Uh, the arc welder, because it's a heavy weapon. And I picked I picked up an Orion. And the nice thing is that the arc welder and the Orion there use the same. 
Same ammo. So. Okay. We want to go to. Let's see. Let's go to the lodge first. Let me drop off my resources. to underscore the impressive architecture of New Atlantis, right? I've been here hundreds of times. Home sweet home. Or home sweet home. So, uh, we started with the xenobiologist background. Gave us uh, fitness. Uh, it gave us one in lasers, and it gave us one in surveying. So, I spent... Uh, the next couple levels getting this to rank 3 and then from rank 3 to 4 he had 100 kills so we already had to cut her up a little bit uh, in the meantime I've obviously gotten rank 4 and we've got 2 we're actually able to take rank 3 uh, in heavy now I didn't take it yet because I put 1 into boost pack training one into piloting, one into targeting right now. This is going to get filled out later. Uh, we're sticking with the one there. Uh, I put another rank, I put two ranks into medicine because we need to heal. I have one into astrodynamics because this category is going to get... Uh, so, but the next one's going to go into spacesuit design. We need to be able to add things to our gear, right? And it's not gear specific. Um, pick whatever suit you like or a combination of uh, suit helmet and pack you like does not matter with this build okay um, I wanted to concentrate on that and I wanted to concentrate on building uh, my own ship or at least upgrading a ship that I like right so we already have four lasers we've got two in heavy um, the only other thing I think that works with the cutter is possibly uh, armor penetration or crippling. Let me see how this reads. Human enemies have a 30% chance to enter a down state after taking enough damage. Could be useful. Uh, not not a prerequisite. Um, you definitely need all three. You could gain the fourth. Gain a 25% physical resistance while aiming down. Although the cutter doesn't have an aim. I don't think. But if you swap over to, say, the uh, Arc Welder, then that has an aim. So, yeah, you would gain that. Um, if you don't use the Arc Welder, you're fine. Don't worry about it. You need at least three of these. Okay. Other than that, you're pretty much done. Armor Penetration uh, ignores target's armor. Uh, by identifying gaps or weak points in the body armor, an attacker can often gain a tactical advantage. Um, I also think Crippling's. A little bit better to make them go down 30% chance to enter a down state um, what's the other one too it's oh oh it's a power it's the power that makes them drop their weapons that they become sitting ducks now I'm not gonna use that one somebody did a video on that and you have to be close the one that I'm gonna use is the very first one you typically get the uh, was it called like anti-gravity anti-gravity field where they start flying in the air and they can't do anything but then you just poke at them with the cutter just you're up close and personal you don't have to worry about getting hit and it doesn't cost you a lot of power to do it other than that you're going to want to max out wellness so we have three available you're going to want to get all four ranks here uh you'll probably want to get three in fitness Take one in one or two in gymnastics if you can, and then uh, go right to rejuvenation. And uh, you want to be able to regenerate outside of combat. Save those healing packs for in combat. You're going to need them. Trust me, you're going to need them. Other than that, if you have extra ability points, uh, I recommend maxing out medicine. Three in spacesuit design. You don't need this. Uh, and the reason is... 
um, we're not going to be focused on adding things to the weapons because then obviously the arc welder is going to wind up outclassing the cutter, which it sort of does. But the main thing is that um, you you use the cutter as your main. The arc welder backup weapon, fantastic backup weapon. Although it's sort of a crap weapon, but it it works well for what I'm doing uh, because both of those synergize with lasers and they're both heavy weapons, so. You're, you're making them better. Um, astrodynamics, because I, I'm going to be using it. I'm not going to put anything else in surveying. But yeah, definitely medicine, space suit design. And then I, I did take one in special projects. Uh, everything else is going to wind up going into tech. What did you have in weapons? Uh, just lasers and heavy weaponry. Sir, that's it. The reason I took uh, lasers is because the cutter is a laser weapon. It's also a heavy weapon. And I'll, I'll show you. It sets them on fire. See this 5% chance to set them on fire? It's a constant stream from the cutter, right? Even if you're not holding down mouse 2 or focusing it on a controller to make, the, to make it a stronger charge, uh, what happens is once they start taking fire, that's, that fire starts stacking. It's like, um, think of like if you've played Skyrim and you use like the poison rune or any damage over time spell, you hit them like multi think of the ignite spell, base game, it's vanilla, right from the uh, Dragonborn DLC, you have to wear the uh, one of Azadal's rings of Minor Arcana, I think that's called, and it gives you the ignite spell, it's an apprentice spell, it's dirt cheap to cast, but if you constantly throw it at something single or double cast it, it's stacking damage on top of each other and you just watch the health melt away that's what this is like is there a way to reset our points no there's not Pro probably not without mods not in the base game there's not once you learn stuff you cannot respec so plan your build ahead of time unless you uh unless you mod your game but yeah, that's the build so far. Like I say, he's only level 14. We're almost up there. Wearing some UC mix of stuff and Heller's Cutter. Let's see if we can. Uh... Could finally use that cheese, right? Yay! Are we done? <laughs> I think we're done. And we can make some pick me up too. This is another big thing. Hopefully, I have the stuff to make it. I think it needs like membranes. Oh, it's aqueous hematite. That's why I wanted more of that stuff. We're gonna have to go back. This stuff is fantastic. Um, plus 50 carry capacity for 15 minutes. I can only make four of them. And aqua, uh, aqueous hematite is your... Uh, is the problem. You can only get it from Mars. And uh, it's rare. But worth it. That's This is one of the best ones in the game. Pick me up. Okay. Let's store the rest of this stuff. All right, now let's look at what we're going to be doing here. So we could find Percival. Right? Don't worry about this yet. And then we're going to start to get... Oh, we have to go We have to go into the well. See, you guys didn't fucking remind me. We're going to go get the... Uh, Cyber Runner Cypher Magazines. There are three of them that increase your laser damage. Yeah? What do you want?
Here we go again, restarting. Yep. <clears throat> that, uh, that is a thing. Alright, let's switch our packs back out. Oh, you know what? No, I do like the uh, extra oxygen capacity too. Let's keep this one on for now. Yeah, they said it was in the well and they said it was in Apex Electronics. I hope it's not locked behind that door. I have the feeling that it is. Laser weapons permanently do 5% more crit damage, which is great. Okay. So when you're firing it, right? See this? It's a constant stream. Obviously, if you charge it, it's going to go, but you're going to go through your battery much quicker. Now, it does do more damage, sure. That's the first one. Let's see if uh, you ask me? Antonio, I think daylight's we have bigger time. I got all day. I got all day. Got any uh, ammo for me? Yes, you do. You do indeed. What do I have for you, good sir? Nothing. 1,500 rounds. I think we're good for ammo on this stuff for a while. Like I said. Um, oh, yeah. the This stuff. Forgot to get rid of that stuff. Um, some of these we don't need. I kept Teller's log. That we need. That's actually a quest that popped up early for me. Um, let's see here. Uh, we don't need his slate anymore. Yeah, we don't need that. I know we're not getting any money for it, but Watch your back out there. we don't need them. Let's go, Barrett. We're, uh... we're off to find the next one. Now it's not straight damage, it's percent crit damage, but I'd rather have a 15% crit than, uh, than not. So we'll get to our, uh, we'll get to our ship, which is where? That's the lodge. Hey, you 
might want this. I'll take it in a little bit. Uh, I don't know if we're going to be able to get this. This may be quest locked. But we're going to go to Voli. Uh, to Neon. Should be in one of the main towers. And I'm going to have to look up where it is. Orbital pattern lock. Yeah, you know what? I don't want to get this one started because it's this one's a little different. This is a uh, a bankable auto attempt for hacking. All right. Beta Marae 1. Let's see where that is. to make a few jumps. Beta Marae is there. So let's jump to Atlantis. Yeah, let's do it just for fun. <laughs> oh, we get a good scan. Let's go to Lunara. Need a better shield. Our tiny tin can fragile humans has survived being hurtled through space once more. This is Vesta. All right. So let's see here. We want the Neurodyne Botany Lab on Beta Marae 1. Well, we'll have to see. Yeah, typically if they're named things on planets, you can you're guaranteed to find a uh, magazine of some sort. So they're worth exploring. And I don't know if I've been here before.
Maybe we have? Got some XP for it. Some life forms. Uh, okay. I was not expecting these. Good job, Vasco. That's why Vasco is awesome. And we got a few more. Yeah, look at this guy. going somewhere. I don't know where he's going. I think I just F myself. Ow. I don't like it when they throw rocks at me. Yes, look at that. Fascinating how life solves the same needs and comfortable yet entirely different. Yeah, and I can't get back up there, Barrett. Yeah, you say that, but Wow, okay, he had a lot. Oh, yes. I know how this ends. Wow, he's level forty five. Okay. That works. There's more up here. I'm coming, Barrett. <laughs> there we go. There's Vasco.
Ah, oh, dude. You wuss. What level is he? Doesn't matter. <laughs> Yo, look at them all. Alright, he's a little tougher. Adorable. I'm afraid to get down there. Let's have five. Ah, uh, tough they're gonna be. Ah. Oh. Little jerk. Running away. Nightshade. Nope. <laughs> I guess we got a few more. I didn't expect this place to be so populated. What's up, Barrett? Yeah, I know. I hear him, too. Gravity on this place sucks. Yeah, they're all over the place. Look at that. There it goes. Ah, advanced. Expert! Ah, boy. Really should have went into security, huh? Get him? That's apparently no.
Yo. Wind, if you're still here, since I cannot see the uh, alert, can you let me know what's up? structure is common to biological organisms like that. Hold on, let me check. And for some reason, I'm not getting the... Uh... Trotsky, welcome in, dude. Welcome in, Raiders. Win, thank you for the shout out. Let me go back up here. And Monica, how's it going? Stream's going okay. Uh, as good as it can be for <laughs> for the app being stupid. Uh, let me go back into game here. Trotsky, welcome in. Welcome in, guys. Look at that. Just make some melt. Get off my Vasco. store these nutrients and things like that. Joe, welcome in. Welcome, welcome. Appreciate the shoutouts, Wind. I, I would do it myself, but the app is fucked for me. Thank you, Apple. Thank you, iOS, for being a piece of shit. Uh, so I'm using the desktop, which I have absolutely no control over. Uh, but at least I can see chat. So I guess tomorrow I'm going to be going and I'm going to be buying that second monitor and possibly a desk. Uh, what am I doing here? Uh, Frontier. Uh, no, we want these resources uh, stored. Okay. And we're keeping the pack. So yeah, we've got our weapons. You can see Heller's cutters up to seven, which is fantastic. The uh, Welder, of course, is up, and I swapped the Equinox for, ooh, excuse me, an Orion. So we go for, we go for uh, the same range of 50. Fantastic accuracy is way up. Magazine size is also up, and energy damage is up. And these two use the same ammo. Which is absolutely fantastic. Arc Welder, I'm liking this a lot more than I thought I was going to. But Heller's, this is still our main weapon, the cutter. Go for broke. For my, yeah, I, yeah, I wish I could. <laughs> I wish I could. I, I don't even have room for a second, let alone, you know, I, I'm going to have to figure out how to make the second one work. Uh, but we're here for a magazine. Let me uh let me just swap these back over. Hold on, because I keep finding myself doing this. I'll put the welder on two. Put the Orion back on one. I keep hitting two. So my middle finger is there. All right now. pressure tank. I will not say no to a med pack. That looks like it was supposed to be a suit, but they they changed it. Let me see, do we have to go into the plant research facility for this? You're running seven right now with wall mounts? I have no need for all that. 
I don't know what you could use seven monitors for. Uh, I, I have no need for that. Hey, yours probably looks cool. But, uh... Yeah, I mean... I did need one anyway, too, Joe. You're right. You're right. Trotsky, enjoy your lurk. Yeah, I... Now, no need to explain. Try, I get it. I get it. Let me, uh, let me just go back and check to see where this one is. Okay. So, found at Neurodyne Botany Laboratory on Beta Marae 1. On a counter with workstations in an exterior lab at the rear left of the building. So we don't have to go into whatever this is. Let me just refresh this page real quick. Oh, it's night time. No? Is it? Well, there's creatures all over the place here. I think we took most of them out. Let's look for workstations back here. I think we were back here. Yeah, we were. So, obviously, I can't hit him with that, but. We can hit him with that. This is storage. That's a herding vector back herbivore. And I need that for uh Oh, we've got the challenge, never mind. We're at 50. Okay. The question becomes, do we put it in I th I think we put it into our suit and then we come back to heavy 3 later. But they give you good XP, so... Yeah, it's gotta be inside. It's set in the exterior, though, so I don't know what that... Here's some workstations, right? No workstations. You got him, guys? Get him. Well, let's go inside. Yeah, there's just, like, dinosaurs all over the place here. This way. Like we found somebody's nest. Swarming.
So you think, Barrett, huh? Dead scientist. Interesting. Okay, monstrous murder plans. <laughs> Ah, oh, come on, they're not as tough as you thought. Hello. Uh, did you get that particular piece that... Yes, that right there. Excellent. Look at his health just... There you go. Can't get in, huh? Well, that sucks. I would like to get in there. How would one open said door? Probably by getting in this way. <laughs> monstrous murder plants. We like monstrous murder plants. Uh, give me a second here. We just refresh again for some reason. Yeah, now chat's not coming up on here either. Let me just double check. Oh, okay. Dwarf Avenger. There we go. Okay. Appreciate it, buddy. Yeah, I'll be taking them med packs. Oh, we have a blue one? We do now. Uh, attachments. Experiment one. Water composition, humidity, and temperature seem to be minimal factors when considering growth rate. As long as adequate measures are met, fluctuation has little impact. While well, day, day length and availability of light clearly influence reproductive season, the variance we see in specimen mass sampled from our different test sites appear to be determined primarily by the diet of local herbivores. This claim is supported by numerous observations. Though results are still inconclusive, we suspect the impact of their droppings on soil, uh, pH balance, moisture, and overall molecular identity is statistically significant. Time to maturity. Hey. I see what they did there. So yeah, murder plants. Let's open the doors. Because it's always good to, you know, open the doors on a prehistoric 
anything with murderous things that want to murder you. Oh, there we go. Okay. Now. This is the broken one. Killed you. Let's take the toxin. Let's take the uh, paramour, which I don't know if I'm going to use that. Oh, you decided to meet up with me, uh, Barrett. Should be back here, right? Work workstations are in here. No? These are not... Free nutrients. Testing. I don't want to go in that way just yet. Slap one. Expert? Motherfucker. Look at that. Ugh. Oh. So annoyed. Alright, come on. It's back here. Hi. Okay, we got another level. Which means spacesuit design number one. Uh, what traits are you using in the options? Going to try a new way to go on this new game. So for, for me, uh, I took Xenobiologist for my background. Traits are still gonna be. Oh, you mean? Hold on. Let me uh. Let me just take that so I don't do that. Yeah, I'll show you. Uh, I cho I chose uh UC native. Alien DNA, which I almost always choose, and Terra Firma, which I almost always choose, uh, because unless you're fighting on a space station, uh, you get more health and oxygen bouncing around all the planets you're on. Even if you're in the air, that's still terra firma. The only time this doesn't just the only time uh space would apply is if you're literally on a space station, which is like five percent of the game. Alien DNA, I like this one. I always use this. Don't worry about the reduction in food and healing. Medicine for med medicine two well medicine one sort of negates this. And I never have a problem with this anyway. I, I like the boosted health and oxygen from the start. Uh, it definitely helps. I love cake. I love cake. Now I want cake. I have yet to find these workbenches that they said were here. Here, maybe? No. Oh, I don't know what that did.
could have sworn there was another door around here, wasn't there? No, I guess not. Alright. Well, let's go down. Oh, uh, I know. Science, profit, or snacks? I don't know, Barrett. We really don't know. Now I'm just going around in a goddamn circle. Still not gonna open that, huh? Okay. Let's uh, let's try it another way. That's the broken door. Let's uh. Maybe this way. Now we've been through here. Be careful. Critters and their uh, byproducts are in the area. Pie sounds good right about now. Yeah, this was the way in. Alright, so it's got to be in here somewhere. up there. I don't think we came up here. Job, Barrett. Oh, we were up here. 
I think. Maybe? No, I guess not. Oh, let's see. We have this guy. I don't know if we have Star Pal though. I don't think we do. Man, this is this is where all the uh, locks are. Look at this experimental results. I think we've done it. The plants are showing a 200% acceleration in growth. The plants should reach maturity at a rate well beyond anything seen in nature. I expect them to continue growing rapidly. I look forward to the final results. Three hundred plus hours in this game. I still have no idea where you. Yeah, I forget what I'm at now. I'm I'm at like. 460 total hours and I sometimes don't know where the hell I am. Travel to Vulture's Roost. What the hell is Vulture's Roost? Is this one of those mist quests? I don't know. Let's keep it on. Because we're obviously not doing this. We're not finding Percival just yet. Uh, that's actually pretty good. Stat-wise. We have a greenie. Oh, nothing in here. Oh, is that all that was in here? Shit. And obviously, two things I can't bust into. Man. And here I was. I was so hopeful. There's, There's got to be a way to unlock these doors. <laughs> it said the workbenches were outside. Yeah, I thought so too, but I couldn't find it. I mean, we we can obviously look. I thought it said outside too, but here oh look at that I see what's in there let me in what do we got here 
bolstering cis death pack. All right, hold on. Let's let's see packs. I got a pretty good one here. Oxygen carry capacity. Let's see how it compares. Just bolstering. Okay, mine's better. Yeah, I like having the uh, fastened and more oxygen. Damn. All right, we could sell that at least. The oh, boss chest. Fucking master locks, dude. Exotic wood. Man, what a waste. Alright, let's see what's in here. Ah. Okay. Someone will buy that for a dollar. Accurate. Very accurate. <laughs> That's how it works. Like, oh, you found this rare pack? Three credits. Three credits. Whoa. Ah. I would like to open all the doors, please. Or at least this door. You know, like... Ha, you bitch. Put him down. Sure. Pick it up if you want. Good job, Barrett. Where's the other bastard? You over here? There's a few of them. I don't think so. How's that axe working out for you? Get off my face. Rather annoying. I've done this a thousand times. Didn't think this through, huh? Muscle time. I guess the ecliptic were fairly smart about this. They decided, hey, we're getting the hell out of Dodge. Except this guy. Fuck that guy in particular. We got a nice greenhouse here. You good, Barrett? What are you shooting at? Stop shooting into the air. Dummy. <laughs> Did not go in the greenhouse. 
Oh, come on. This would have been the perfect place for, you know, a plant of death. Man, all these expert and, uh... Master locks are just killing me here. Ah. What do we have here? Computer. Uh, computer with nothing. Resume last user session. Right, let's try this one. Okay, nothing on that one. We're gonna let Barrett do his thing. Um... some stuff up, I guess. Cyber Road, there it is. Alright, we got it. So that adds uh, bankable hacking. Bastard, get back here. You can't get outside. You don't know how to open doors. Whoa. Die, you piece of shit. Alright, we good, Barrett? We can get the hell off this planet. Where is my ship? Where is Ecliptic? Isn't there like one left? Something's over here. Ah, oh, one of these douchebags. Travel to Vultures. Well, we're gonna go to the frontier first. We're gonna. I have something for you. Thank you, Barrett. I got a big kiss for you too. <laughs> hey, Dusty. If you're ever thinking to yourself, ah, oh, I could really listen to Barrett's dulcet voice right now. Dulcet tones. Instead of dreaming about me, stop by and say hello, okay? Joe, they stole your line. Hey. Oh, I'm really enjoying our time together. <laughs> what you should know. It's been a long time since I worked with someone so closely. I didn't realize how much I missed it. And you haven't This is a really, really fun play. Once once this got going and once I got that arc welder. Thank you. Uh it's nice to be able to switch. Um But man, yeah, it's it's definitely bromance. Should we should we bromance uh I I mean I feel bad. He still won't really talk to me about... Well, he doesn't like when you asked who Irving is. Like, he's... Like, it says he dislikes it. It's like, what, it's like the first natural question to ask somebody. But then he proceeds to talk about it, like, nonstop. 
I just, I don't know. See, that's what makes you a good captain in my book. You're supportive. I don't like but how he's no. giving me. Oh, now he's. Yeah, yeah there we go. Turn around. About Irvin's case. So I wanted to let you know that I heard back from my contact. Ah, good, good, I think good. You'll want to hear this. They sent me a copy of some public records. Oh, it's interesting. That public records. There was a claim filed against Irvin, accusing him of damaging their investments. Looks like Irvin didn't even enter a plea. Hmm. Who brought the case to court? The Hephaestus Mining Corporation. And they also won the case. Shall I blow them to the ground? Or to the sky would make more sense, right? You blow them up into the air. Okay, never mind. Uh, what was the settlement? Some of Irvin's paychecks were seized. As well as any assets that weren't under joint ownership. I haven't figured out who we're going to wind up... Because I figured with this character, maybe we actually do the romance option with somebody. I, I can't figure... Out of the four we have, I don't know who I would go with. Now, obviously... I mean, maybe you guys don't know. In real life, I am straight. So normally it's, you know, women. Okay. In video games, I don't care. At all. Um... It just sucks that there's only four of them, you know? Is anybody else besides me who is a, like a person who never uses a romance option kind of annoyed that Bethesda limited it to four for this? Because I, because I see how good they made the four so far. So I'm hoping that maybe with DLC that gets expanded and then I can never use it and go ahead and bitch about it some more. I guess that's the way that things go. <laughs> So hybrid votes Sam. I've done. I've, I've. Well, we got close with Sam that one time, but then I didn't because I knew that character was going away. Sam is good. I like Sam. Uh, Andresia is my normal pick. I like her the best out of anybody. Barrett is a very close second. Sam would be third, and Sarah would be last. <laughs> Andresia is. She is the coolest one out. Uh, like if you're just going on cool factors for any reason, she is the coolest. And I'm, I'm kind of annoyed that it can't be. Um, what's the dude? Well, I guess Walter. You could you could throw Walter in there too, right? All the members of Constellation, you should be able to. And you know what Bethesda really screwed up on? Think of the fact there's five factions. There are no romance options for any named NPC in any of the factions. Think of how limiting that is. Right? Compared to Skyrim. All you had to do is wear an amulet of Mara and you could be like, okay, this person you did a favor for, you gave the beggar a coin, now they can marry you. Simple. I get it, it's a different system, but Sarah is my punching bag. <laughs> I would romance the Amelia Earhart clone every time. <laughs> yes, there you go. <laughs> uh, let me. Oh shit! Let me go in here. Uh, I don't understand how Irvin could be guilty of that. Well, if it was Irvin, I do want to understand that because I just can't believe it. It might wind up anyway, being Andresia. I and I ha we have. Well, we have to get her first. Sued Irvin. Claiming he irreparably damaged their mind. They said he killed the apex predators. Sam gets mad, but he's easy to persuade. Mind, which led to herd creatures overeating the grasses. What I like the about Andresia is she uses chameleon. She goes invisible. Fast, which and she has a Varun... Uh, of money. Whatever the pistol version of, of the Varun weapon is. She's, she's pretty damn good. Barrett's good too, though. So, killing apex predators led to all that. They claim the creature he killed was a critical hive species that caused a cascade effect when they were killed off. Irvin killed the equivalent of a queen bee, and the whole hive collapsed, basically. I pissed Sam off and he left. I ended up... Uh, finding him at the lodge, being a... Oh, yeah. 
Yeah, Sam's kind of a... That's why he's my, like... He's in the bottom two with Sarah. Him and Sarah are put in the corner. The explanation is sound. <laughs> I, I gotta be honest. I don't really mind any of the four. So but, anyway, like, there's none for Noel. None for... What's his name? Kotri is his last name. Who was a no-show, too. What's his first name? The religious guy part of Constellation. There's none for him. And, and again, all the factions. So why didn't the witness show up? They withdrew their testimony the morning of the trial. Can't romance so during fan. You think he's a shirt? Yeah, right. Did you know, uh, hey, about the apartment before this? I didn't know he bought it. Ah. Must have been a better deal than renting for the time he was there. Well, yeah, buying's always better than renting. Always. Is your contact still available for work? Yes. We plan to stay in the same system for a while. Okay. I mean, it sounds like the case is closed right now, yeah? That doesn't mean we can't do anything about it. Yeah, this is true. And if nothing else, I just want to know more about what happened to Urban. Okay. So here's what I was thinking. I can persuade my contact to keep digging a little bit more. I don't want to press out. Got to restart my Elden Ring playthrough, which sucks. Up on one thing. Should I tell them yeah, you were saying your Elden Ring was crashing on you, right? Into the witness instead. Uh, investigate the company some more. Investigate what the witness says. What do you want to find out with the witness? I wonder what his real reason was for retracting his testimony. Did he report anything to security? Doesn't Barrett reimburse you all this money? If I give him 4,000 credits, pay your smuggler contact to investigate both. So what can we find out by investigating the company? I just want to know why they picked Urban. Why did they set him up? I'd restart Starfield knowing what I know now, but I'm level 70. I mean, I had a level 55 and I restarted several times. 70 it could be hard to get to, I get that. But if you feel like you want to restart, absolutely, by all means, restart. For that much money, <laughs> they'll do it. You know, this investigation is time consuming, but it's also pretty cathartic. Yeah, it's also costing me a boatload of money. Maybe if we solve this case, it'll mean a better About future for Gagarin. Seven thousand so credits already. Too far ahead. Anyway, Captain. The highest you got was so far was thirty. Thirty is about the average, I'd say, for a lot of folk. Uh, what were we doing here? Hold on. Oh yeah. Ah. Okay. Let's um store my resources. No, 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 no. Uh Take them all. I doubt you need to bring all of that. Yes, I do. We're, we're getting off this planet. And I've made the crew of the Expanse just made Jim Holden. Nice. This planet was pretty cool. I mean, daylight. Obviously, you can go look around. Let's, uh, let's start putting some stuff on my gear. Because I need it. I absolutely need it. Bring it to position. Ah, shit. Hold on. Do I have a... I don't have a skill point. Do I have any... Damn it. Ah, we have these all maxed out. Okay, that's fine. Fucking spacers. Yo, yo, yo.
That sucks. Yeah, my mobility is definitely suffering. This is where I wish I put a little bit more into... Yeah, it's a level 20 spacer. Locking, lock. Time to die. Shields out, we just lost them. Fucking hell, man. I did all those upgrades. Yeah, but I need to. Now in stable I need to take these guys out. Wow, somebody else is firing at me. It's not that main ship that's level 20, it's somebody else. It's this guy. Well, oh, there's definitely more of them. then the mothership comes in. I could do it, it's just a pain in the ass. We are now in stable order. You ran out of luck. Hate that. Hate it. Whoa, big hit. Assessing systems. Oh, jump drive is gone. Thanks, Barrett. Thanks for that. Damn it. That is going to cost me every freaking time. This thing. Shields are gone. 
Got him. Powering jump drive. Stabilizing. It's fully restored. Let's get the rest of my loot. Fucking earn that one. Six ship parts. Holy crap. It's a mineral deposit. Palladium. Okay, I'll take it. No, that's not where we're going. Okay. Uh, that gets an F5. Alright, adventure, enjoy. Enjoy your nap. Alright, let's see here. Where are we headed to? Finding Percival. Uh, travel to the Vulture's Roost. Yeah, we're not going to do that yet. We're going to go back to... Um, Vulture's Roost is where... That doesn't matter. Jaffa. Ooh. Well, we should while we're here. We may as well, because it's a long, it's a long uh, trip back to uh, Atlantis. So I don't want to have to like go all the way back, then come all the way back out here, then go back to Jaffa, then go all the way back. So we'll do this first. I'm surprised I didn't get a level. Grab jump spinning down. Yeah, you can just look at those scholars. The Vulture's Roost. Then we'll have to figure out what we're going to put on our... Uh, on our suit. Some basic stuff. Time to park this boat. Yeah. This seems interesting. What's this? I don't think I've ever been here. Oh, yeah, that's right. I took all my stuff. All right, let's uh, store the resources. Should I bring this stuff to sell it? I don't know what's here. I don't know. Is what it is. Uh, let's get that ever critical hour of sleep. I know. Come on. Let's go. Hi, Vasco. Well, this is weird. Copper. Can we mine that? Doesn't look like it. 
Yo. I don't think so. No, it's just one of the uh, the many things. Ah. How do you like it? Yeah, you will. Oh, he's tough. He's tough. He was tough. There's more of them. Alright, so this is Jaffa. We, we had to be here for something, right? I guess we'll just follow the path. I suppose some Yo. speech is in order. Horbath with the prime. Much appreciated. Let me uh let me see here. Question. If I'm watching two streams, does my viewership count in both? Yes, yes it does, Monica. If you have two windows open, like two like on your browser, it counts for both. Yes it does. Horbath, much appreciated. Let me uh, pop back in my game here. Welcome in, welcome in. That's advanced, I can't do anything with that. Of course that's master, why wouldn't it be?
Well, I suppose some kind of speech is in order. Yo! Monica gifting five tier one well, subs. I suppose that's all that's showing up on my screen. It's not telling me who. Uh, going to Val. Going to Lupine. Uh, Eskilston. Well, wow, I can't pronounce the name. I suppose some kind uh, of <laughs> I totally butchered it. Uh, and I love Slots and George. Monica, thank you. Much appreciated, my friend. Well, I suppose some kind of speech. And you get to listen to Ulfric. I've got some time to kill. Thank you, thank well, you. I suppose some kind of speech is in order. Oh, look at that. You're dead. That was fucking impressive. Even <laughs> I gotta stand up and cheer. Wind. <laughs> No, don't worry about that. I, it's much appreciated. Thank you. Take all their cards. Take your take well, your red ale. I suppose some kind of speech is in order. Charles, he's dropping a prime. Holy crap, guys! Charles, much appreciated, my friend. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Oh no, sure. You guys just kicked off a freaking hype train. See, I can't see the hype train on my on my phone with the desktop on like I normally could. So well, I'm I'm switching over to. Uh, I suppose some kind of speech is in order. Holy crap, Charles! Oh, you guys are awesome, Charles. With well, five gifted subs. I suppose some kind of speech is in order. All right, hold on, because I got to see who this goes to now. Uh, Lost Spartan, Smash, BM, well, Avatar, and I suppose some kind of speech is in Supply order. Supply T. Charles, much appreciated. Thank you, guys. Enjoy your gifted subs if you got them. Well. Uh, I suppose some. You get to enjoy ad free viewing order. while I do not. <laughs> and win with biddies? And Monica with biddies? Holy crap, well, and Vixie with a thousand biddies? I Holy some shit. Kind of speech is in order. Now they're showing up. Holy crap, you guys. All right, I'm a, I'm a little speechless. I know you guys are seeing a locked game right now. Game's there. Uh, Horbath with five gifted subs. Holy shit. Um. Goddamn. Let's see. Uh, Zyron. Sea Dog. Uh, DJ Trailway. Primal. And Tom Mull. Well, guys, enjoy. I suppose some kind of speech is in order. Wind. Oh my god. Really, wind? Well, <laughs> I suppose some kind of speech is in order. Wind. Thank you. Five gifted subs from the wind. Well,. She, I, I, I swear, she orchestrates the stuff, but she's order. like, listen, all I want to do is hear Ulfric talk about giving speeches. I swear that's how it works. <laughs> oh, Wynn, thank you. Let's see, who well, are we going to? I suppose Boom, kind of shakalaka. Uh, Allegren, Darth Paper, Suga, and Stax. Guys, enjoy your gifted subs. Make well, sure to thank those who gave them I to you. I suppose some kind of speech is in order. You're seeing a frozen screen because I'm swapping to desktop to check because I cannot check on my phone. <laughs> She's over there laughing. Well, yeah, yeah. I suppose some kind of speech <laughs> is in order. Well... And I suppose some kind of speech. Uh, Drusilius, 
Is that is that oh that's a drop that's a drop sub right there. Much appreciated, Silius. Well Thank you. I suppose some kind of speech is in order. Holy crap, Fixie. You guys are killing me. Well, I suppose some Holy kind shit. of speech is in I, order. I can't even see what tier it's at because it just keeps going up. <laughs> I don't even know what tier it's at. I know nothing. <laughs> Rokov. Well, <I> <laughs> Wait, yeah, we got to switch it. It's not Ulfric anymore. I'm going to have to switch it over to Rokov now. Fixie with five tier one subs. Well, it just I said something shattered. Hold on a second. I'm order. I'm I'm looking at this. You guys just shattered. I think whatever my record was. Well, for for my channel for hype train. Well, I suppose some kind of speech. When do you know what level it's at? Because I can't see. Um. What's the Vixie gifting five to uh, Jean Baldo? Well, I suppose some Breeze kind of Whisper, Vescu, Cyber Yarl, and Urzad. No crap, well, you go level eight, you I guys. Holy kind of effing shit. Char oh my god. Charles. Ten. Tier one subs. Well, I suppose some kind of total of fifteen. Holy crap, Charles! Thank you. Well, I suppose some kind of speech is in order. Ulfric slash Rokov. He's just gonna keep going. He's gonna be broken. Ten years later, we're still gonna be listening to the. Well. Well. Yeah. I suppose some kind of speech is in order. It says level it. Yeah, it's showing eight on mine now too. Ah, Charles, much appreciated. Um, Ale Fry, Wonderlust, well, Red Hook, I suppose Haster, some kind of speech is Esby, in order. Bros of Stalin. <laughs> I still love that name. Uh, Delusional Texan, Athormus, well, Shadow Fox Zero, I suppose and some kind Noxy of Key is in order. All from Charles, guys. Charles, thank you. That's a lot. Holy crap, ten. Plus the other plus the other five. Well, and wind. I suppose some kind of speech is in order. With five oh my god, wind. With five more. Uh Dove Crow, fix it. Uh well, I suppose some kind of speech is in order. Let's see, one luck. Zeus AM and Sneaky Preacher. This is like, this is an all time level. I just see it says 100% well, again. I suppose some kind of speech is in order. And win with another. Oh my god, 1,000 biddies. Holy crap. Well, I suppose some kind of speech is in order. I'm, I'm, I'm stunned. You just completed level eight. Holy shit. Well, I suppose some kind of speech is in order. I appreciate it, Charles. Anything anything I can do to, to help the community, if you guys learn anything by like watching me screw well, around or or do I serious stuff, that's kind of that's speech is in order. That's kind of the goal. I just appreciate you guys coming here. Well, and hanging out. I suppose some kind of speech is in order. Oh my God, wind with five. Did you really five more tier ones? Oh my jeez. Well, wind. Thank you. I suppose some kind of speech is in order. Uh, schematic. I can't even talk now. Schematic. Darth biscuits. <laughs> Igmo. Well. Kobe Adventures. Some kind of speech is in order. And Matthias 81. <laughs> Spam. Wind is no longer the wind. <laughs> well. And Charles, I they've been taken over by bots that have stolen their credit order. cards. <laughs> Guys, enjoy your gifted subs. Well. Just remember to thank. Uh, I suppose some kind of. Thank the kind people that. Order. 
have donated. If you're not here, obviously you don't hear a word I'm saying, so <laughs> you'll you'll get the notification on Twitch. Well, <laughs> I suppose some kind of speech is in order. Oh my God! And Charles with five more. Charles, jeez, thank you guys. Uh, going to Benny Gant, Urakage, Denthead, BB, and Thoughts. <laughs> Thank you for the hearts, Fixie. Well, yo, Big Head. Speech is in order. Welcome in, dude. Oh my, Big Head joining in the party, gifting five tier one subs. Oh, Frick's never gonna stop. He's officially well, gonna morph into Rokov I and back to Ulfric. Kind of speech is in order. And back to Rokov. <laughs> oh my God! Yeah, you guys, we're like well, we're level ten right now. We're thirty nine percent of speech is in order. Level ten. Holy shit! Big head, thank you, buddy. Big head, gift and subs to Marine. Well, Sleeping Bella. I suppose some kind of speech is in order. A name chan or a name chan. I'm just pronouncing it. I'm probably butchering it. Uh, so sorry. Well, Black Alpha. I suppose some kind of speech is in order. I'm online, but I couldn't help see the, the rain of subs. So I need to do my part. Big head, thank you. Holy crap, you guys. Well. I suppose you know he's not going to stop. He's just annoying. he's just in the, he's going to keep talking. Ten years later, I'm going to be two hours later. I'm going to be finally getting through this mission, and he's still going to be gifting out subs. Well, or at least I suppose I'm giving his speech. speech is in order. Wind with the oh my god, wind! You know you don't have to do that. Another thousand biddies. Well, I suppose some kind of and Drusilius. Holy crap! Joining in, five gifted subs. Uh, to Maria, Destroyer Soul Reaver. Well, Soylent, I Nate some Elite. Kind of speech is in order. And Noob Over. Dude, you guys just pushed me well, past my sub goal. I suppose some kind of speech is in order. By like 10. Holy crap. No, by 7. Well, I suppose some kind of speech is in order. And if that was you doing the shout outs win, much appreciated. Shout out to Big Head. Well, thank you for that. I suppose some kind of speech is in order. I have no idea what just happened. Well,. I suppose some kind of speech is in order. You get a... Th th this is like, yeah. Wind is the new Oprah. Actually, you guys all are. Jesus well, Christ. I suppose some kind of speech is in order. It just says 100% hype. Well, I suppose some I think kind you guys of broke speech me. is in order. I love you too, Wind. Holy shit. You guys just completed a level 10. I've never seen that before. Definitely not here. I'm sure I've... I, I may have seen it in, like, Ferals or Meggies. Not in mine. Well... I know, Wind, you had a... I suppose some kind of... You had a massive uh, hype train the one time. I think it was in double digits, too. Holy shit. Well... Did you just get... I suppose some kind of speech is in order. Okay, hold on. Let me look here. And Big Head gifted another one to... Twitched Hans. Well... I suppose some kind of speech is in order. Wind with ten more gifted subs. Holy crap. Alright, I'm broken. Well, I'm officially broken. I suppose some kind of speech is in order. You haven't had one this... I could have sworn you did. I remember, the, like, the one time, like... I don't know, because I raided into you when you were in well, the middle of a hype train. 
I suppose some kind of like you were level five or six when when I raided in, and I forget what I was. I know I was playing Skyrim at the time. Well, I suppose some kind of speech is in order. All right, let me see. Well, you guys are way too much. I suppose I, I don't know what else to say. In order. I'm on level eleven right now. Holy crap. No. I appreciate it. Well, I suppose some kind of speech is in order. Monica, thank you. Wind, thank you. Wind with 10 more. Oh, man. Let's see. All right. Well, I suppose some kind of speech is in order. All right. So these 10 go into Vili, Iram, Young Keith. Doctor Scoring Points. That's a cool name. Well, uh, I suppose some kind of speech is in order. McCole Soul, Mr. Jazz, uh, Don Quixote, Crow, Chemico, well, and Kronster Kintar. I suppose Kintar. some kind of speech is in order. And another thousand. Holy crap! Don't go broke on my account. Well, and to the point where like I get to the hype and then it's like kind of <laughs> and then the guilt order. starts setting in. Of course I've done this by myself before too, so <laughs> Well I suppose some kind I appreciate of each and every one of you guys just for being here. Even without any of this. You know I like making well, these Yeah. Yeah, you definitely I did. I suppose some kind of speech is in order. Definitely did. Uh, very humbling, to say the least. Very humbling. Well, I suppose some kind of speech is in order. And I need to change that so he doesn't give five speeches every time. Well, <laughs> he's just gonna keep I going. I suppose some kind of speech is in order. I'll be walking the streets later. <laughs> and of course, Ulfric. Well, you guys are seriously I awesome. I suppose some kind of speech is in order. I, uh. Yeah, I don't know. I'm, um. Yeah, you broke me. You're right, Vix. Yeah, I'm broken. I think that was Wind's thousand bits. I could be wrong. I think that, yeah. Man, you guys... If I'm looking at this right let, here, let me refresh my page on my desktop here. No, because I, I don't need to. It's, it's... Yeah, you got me to my sub goal. I think my sub goal was... 150? Those were my biddies. <laughs> Well, here, it'll tell you. There you go, Hype Train. Level 10 emotes? Are they any different? I gotta see what these are. Show me. If anybody gets any interesting level 10 emotes out of that, uh, feel free to put them in there. 7% of level 11. Holy shit, you guys. 75 subs... And 4,300 bits. Holy crap. Yep, y'all just ran a train on me. Okay. I just, I, I'm taking it. I don't wear pants. I'm already bent over. I'm, there we go. I'm taking it. Thank you. Um, that's all I can say, really. Uh, kind of speechless here. Uh, I'm broken, definitely broken. Um, yep. Uh, I saw it. I saw it distribute the emotes. When try refreshing the screen, are you on your browser or are you on your phone? And if you're on your phone, 
Uh, well, you're on iOS too, so. I suppose some kind of speech is in order. And Vixie with the resub. 13 months. One year, one month. Vixie, thank you, my dear. Browser, huh? Uh, I saw them go through because the little message came across. Here, let me refresh my browser just to see if it did anything. I wonder if, um, like, if you've maxed out the Twitch emotes. Oh, shit. Can I not? Oh, the ad break is in progress. God damn it. Can I turn this off? Um, yeah, I saw I saw it go through on the browser. Because I'm looking at my browser. I can't look at my phone because it. None of that stuff pops up on my phone. All right, hold on. Let me uh, let me tab back into the game here. All right, y you guys are seriously awesome. I I can't begin to tell you like how much I appreciate that. I uh, like. I had such a shit day yesterday between the Twitch app and iOS and not getting my stuff to... Yeah, there's some emotes. There you go. I can't tell which... I, I honestly can't tell. I know they're from, from Twitch, though. But yeah, between um, the fucking Twitch app not working like it normally does... Which is like literally forcing me now to have to get that second monitor, which means I need to buy the desk. Which I didn't want to spend the money on, but I obviously have to now. Because I don't know when they're going to fix it. And it's something I should have been doing a while ago. Anyway, I, sh I should have at least had that second smaller monitor for, for, for things like this. But I was, you know, I spent money on the hardware because I wanted it to come across because I wanted to be able to do this consistently and with technology and stuff like that with the app like I don't know if they're going to wind up fixing it they pushed an update out late last night early this morning and it it's the same thing it does not work it did not fix the fucking problem get a sit stand desk maybe close to how much we oh Vixie thank you I, I appreciate you guys being like you realize that I, if you just came here and all lurked and never said anything and hung out, I would still be doing this. Like, I enjoy it. Like, and especially like with this, with this character here, because this is a guy I've been wanting to do for, like, basically since the game came out. And like, I got the cutter and I'm like, this seems pretty cool. I wonder if this could work as a weapon. And then I started it right after my sniper, and then it went nowhere. Like, I did, I think, a stream and a half to two streams, and then I reset. And I reset a few times. I had fun with the sniper. I had fun with the melee character. But I really wanted to see how far I could take this. And the very first time I got destroyed by an enemy's arc welder, I'm like, oh, what the hell weapon was that and I was still researching like what guns were in the game and it's like oh it's an arc welder but it's like a heavy you gotta hold it with both hands it's it's okay but it's like a laser beam I'm like all right well let's see if we can get that to work it'll get fixed 24 hours after you. yeah exactly that's exactly what's gonna happen how, how much do you want to bet that's my luck that's that's just my luck That is just my luck. I've had two things for holding with both hands. I appreciate it, guys, so much. I know I'm like I'm here like dicking around. God damn you all! You broke my immersion. <laughs> I gotta take this personal groomer. 
and I'm gonna do things with it. I don't want that nasty yogurt. What's that? All right. Um. Yeah, I'm lost. I'm uh. I have no idea what's going on here. Ooh, I'll take that. Hey, a selkie. You know what that means? Uh. Where was the cell? We got everything from here. Yes, we did. Wasn't there a cell in here? Crix's journal too. Crewing companions permanently do five percent more weapon damage on top. Wow. Crew and companions. All right, hold on. I wasn't planning on that one, but okay. We can make room for that. Sure. There was one down here, wasn't there? Yes. No. This. There we go. Ooh, Aurora. All right, I've taken the Aurora. Somebody remind me to go to the den first. Otherwise, I'm foobard. Can't get into there. Jail computer. I forget why we even came to this place. It said go to the roost. Spacers! Oh, you're gonna come running at me? That'd be a bad. Look at you, go running away. Now you're dead. See that? He's burning. <laughs> Dumbass. Get wrecked. Oh. Yeah, I should probably reload, right? Fucking wrecked, kiddo. <laughs> Get fucking wrecked. You got him? Ow. Ow. No problem. Boom pop. Hold on, let me turn this up. Taking your credits. Hey, the bar's got a computer too. Uh, shots and specials. Yeah. Moonwalker. Old ragtag. Keep the tap gunning. Hired head. Odds and ends. It's night's tabs. Bill, Walter, and Amy. T method up. <laughs> you could use Aurora. Oh, that's right, you can. I forget what it does though. Let me see here. Hold on. Uh, slow. St oh, that's right. Well, let me uh, here first of all. Let me amp it up. Let me get. Uh, I don't need the pick me up yet. Let me use a squall first. You still fighting a bunch of them? Hi. Take cover. I saw it. Look out. Oh, that's advanced. Ow. Who's throwing them grenades? Take that med pack.
Oh, okay. Bear was a stormtrooper in a previous life. Yes. Would agree. Uh, do we have another third? Is that gonna work? That's gonna work. Uh... There we go. What do we got in here? Mine. Money. Uh, we could sell it. Jeez, is he out there taking... No, nope, that's these guys. Wow. Fuck you, dude. No, they don't. guys up. I think we missed the one. Am I out of med packs? Hold on a second. He's still taking damage. There's no way. Uh, yeah, I'm out of med packs. Uh, okay, trauma packs, you are going on there. Because trauma packs are actually better. I don't know why I'm here. I honestly don't. Barrett's still out there fighting. Them. 
That's the problem, I can't see them though, where are they? Alright, yeah, I got a new appreciation for, uh... For lasers. Well, we definitely went through a uh, shit ton of ammo with this. That is that is the problem with the arc welder, though. It, it just rips through your your ammo. So many fucking adventures. Dude, let's go tag team some bitches. Yo. Man, you, want, you want to go tag? You didn't want to? Okay, let's go explore. Cyber Yarl. Next best thing. Appreciate the follow. Welcome into the shadows. I could have sworn we were here. Yeah, yeah, we were. We kicked their ass here. Oh, this is where they had all the, uh... That. Take a moment to go through your things. And lighten the load. Are you telling me I'm fat? He is, isn't he? God damn. Ah! Well, this is what I get for not having uh, lock picking. Yeah, we were definitely here, right? Black Market Antiquities. Alright, we're going to have to absolutely go to the den. What was here? Aside from, you know, this stuff. There's got to be more of these guys. Everybody needs to kick back and relax sometime. Even killers. Maybe especially killers. Vultures in contraband heaven, right? Cyber, welcome in. I appreciate, yeah. Uh, there was a lot of that going on. <laughs> uh, yeah, you were. You were, uh, you were gifted a sub. That looks right. There we go. What do we got in here? Let's see. These guys love their hookahs, though, right? We have a green one. Alright, this just takes you in here. I can't believe I missed this part. Are oh, you about to finish the uh, the main quest? What uh, What level are you at right now? messed it up. <laughs> it's always the novice locks that I mess up on. The other ones are easy. It's like, yeah, whatever. Uh, 
Did I mess up this one again? I did. Look at the holy crap. That's what happens when I don't pick a cyber runner. Magus fucks up. That doesn't seem right. That seems right. That seems right. That seems right. Okay. That also does not seem right. That seems right. That seems right. Weird. Okay. It's valuable. All right, Barrett. Let's uh, advance. We can't get in. Have one. Why you check the bathroom stalls? I think there's just shit tons of cred here. Um, all right, we got to you're level 49. Nice, nice. We're not that high, not in this character. We're not. Um. We will be. Maybe. Let's see. I put you there and you there. We're, uh, so this character is using the cutter as his main weapon. I have an arc welder as sort of a backup. And then, um... An Equinox, just for range, but it, he mostly uses the cutter. Heller's cutter. Of course it's advanced, why wouldn't it be? No lockpicking aptitude whatsoever. Alright, let's, uh, let's GTFO bear, come on. Gotta be a few of them outside, right? So we went out here, went out here. Let's get the rifle. Guarantee you there's some down here. I have no med packs. Do you know how awkward that is? I also don't hear any of them. means they're probably somewhere. All right, we got to go to the den. Yeah, we're looting all this, all the things here. Um, I swear more of these guys are going to pop up. Or maybe not. Okay. Alright. 
How's it going, Vasco? Got more stable than I expected from Eclipto. Almost like a city. Hey, you might want this. There's stuff in the toilets too sometimes. You have to hold something to lift the lid. Ah. I didn't even realize that. Now I know. <laughs> now we know. Uh swap over. Did I pick up any? Yeah. Keep that. Keep that. Alright. All the stuff we have. Bear, did I give you anything? Come here. Let's get out there and do something new today, shall we? Let's try it. I have room for that. Ah, he's just got the Grendel. Okay, cool. Well, that's all I have too. All right, we gotta go see Marcel. That's definitely getting a full save because I was not expecting that many ecliptic, and I, I'm gonna need more. Uh, I'm gonna need more ammo for the freaking. Uh, Arc welder, that thing goes through ammo like crazy. Ship's good. Welcome up and let's go. It's not not uh not keel hauler, but what's the other one you get at the end of the fleet quest? On board the on board uh, the legacy. Ah, there. That eats up a lot of uh like a toy self. It's level 35, that's why. I don't think we can go to Crix. Alright, uh, so here's the problem. We can't go to Wolf. We can go to Crix. They're going to attack me on sight though, aren't they? Fuck it, let's try. They're going to attack me on sight. <laughs> this is a bad idea. Yes, we're here. Holy crap. Yep. Yeah, you gotta be a member of the fleet. Rip. Uh, we're gonna go this way. Get fucking wrecked, we're gonna kiddo. The map. Get fucking wrecked. Actually, you know what we're gonna do? Uh, shit, I do not know. Because I I don't just have Aurora, I have those organs now, so I can't... We're going to get a bounty. If I can even jump out of here. Um... Where the hell's the den? Yeah, we'd have to go to Cheyenne anyway. Come on. See you later. Now, don't worry about me. See, they didn't even have a chance to respond. Yeah, let's just 
nice casual, leisurely uh, flight over to the den. <laughs> that works. <laughs> yes, it does. All right. Let's go sell my ill-gotten goods that I didn't mean to... I forgot how far away we were and that the fucking Frontier, even upgraded, won't, uh... won't fly. Ship is now docked. Perfect. Didn't even smudge the place. This station was rebuilt after it was destroyed by House Varun. It's unclear why they felt like rebuilding it was necessary, but they did. Well, Marcel. Was there something you needed? Yes, let's see what you have. Certainly. Okay. Uh, you need these black market antiquities. Because of reasons. Uh, we have that color will be. I picked up a bunch of crap. We don't... You can't have my plushy star pal, but you can have that. Okay. Now, aid. Five Aurora. You can have all that. I didn't think I picked up that much. Uh, we got a lot of amp. Let's keep the amp. Wow, I picked up a bunch of crap. I really did. Concussive rip shank. Legendary particle beam, huh? Disassembler radioactive and frenzy. That one's really not that good, to be honest. And these we're not going to be using, so, I mean. Switch over to the. What else did I pick up? Tons of ammo. Alright. Okay. Packs. Uh, Cliptic Balanced Pack. Kind of sucks. Bolstering Sysdef Pack. No, because I've got that, and I've got that. We'll keep them. Helmets. Uh, calibrated. No. You can go. Hackers, refined navigator, space helmet, technician, and hacker. At least you didn't have to jettison the car. Oh, yeah. Get on Jabba's bad side. <laughs> nice. Uh, this is the same as this, but without the... Oh, my bad. Do you have the ammo I want? Yes, you do. You have a lot of it. I need it. Uh, one frenzy Nova light for you. What else do we have? Mines. Uh, 
aid. Let's see, does he have any ship parts? Oh, you got some med packs? Alright, alright. Take the trauma packs. He doesn't have any ship parts. Uh, out of curiosity, what do you have for weapons, though? Probably nothing good. I really lucked out with the arc welder I have. 66,000. Okay. Can we sell him anything else? I think we're out. Yeah, we're out. I probably should sell this too. I know it says bolstering, but we've got the calibrated Vanguard now, so. There. Thing that sucks is I wish these numbers were on this pack. With this look. Kind of sucks. That's why I'm holding on to three packs. Okay. We're, we're good. Thank you. Uh, come again. Let's go back to the quest. Since I, I totally got sidetracked with this. Um... Let's go find Percival. And I have an affliction. What is this? Stimulants addiction. God damn it. And contusions. Alright, hold on. There. Bandage up those contusions. Need some work done? We we need to get back to uh See, we're almost level 16, and yeah, we got to go back to New Atlantis. For you. Oh, do you? Uh, where are you? What's up, Barrett? What's new? What do you have for me? Oh, right, right. Almost forgot about it. No, you just told me this about is it. For you. Creature jam. Interesting. Okay. All right. Hopefully I did not get a bounty. I was able to grab jump away. We'll find out. Locks, air pressure, drive. All good to go, Cap. So what upgrade to your ship, uh... ...allows you to grab jump further? for that. Right to the lodge. Fuel tanks? That sounds right. Better grav drive? I think I put a better grav in. I know I did a reactor because I can only do... Well, like I said, we're still on the frontier. Oh man, we're, we're gonna get into so many fucking adventures. Dude, let's go tag team some bitches. Eh? You want, you want to go Derek Burkham. Okay, let's go exploring some shit. That's the next best thing. Appreciate the follow. Welcome in. But you need I fuel to get there. That's per se. that's probably why. I do realize how fortunate I am to be a part of all of this. Okay. So, oh no, we got to we got to do the research first. My bad. 
Hopefully we can get some stuff out of here. Uh, spacesuit mods one. What do we got? Polytextile. Just enough. Nice. Pack mods. Model propellant. We need two more. I think we could do that. Hold on. I think I have enough for this, yeah? Make it over here. Ah, oh, come on. All we can make. I hope that's enough. I think we only needed two. Uh, yes. We don't have any sterile nanotubes. I'm one adhesive short. Look at this. Alright. I'm always short of adhesive. Let's go get some. Come on, Barrett. I think they have some you're in eight hours. So Frontier is dwarfed by the Manus, is dwarfed by the Star Eagle. Yep. Would agree. Uh I don't like going through the free star line though for uh for the Star Eagle anymore. I know it's technically the best class A ship. Um or I didn't want that to happen, but sure. And I know I could get the Mantis, but I don't think this character would, uh, would do that. Ah, oh, fucking mouse. I went to the wrong district. Stretch, huh? All right, hold on. There you go, wind. <sighs> My back does feel better, though. I mean, it's always in pain, but it it's in less pain. I must have hit mouse three by accident. I didn't realize it was in eight hours. Sometimes it feels like it's more than that, you know? Hope you're finding everything you need. If it belongs on your ship, then I'm sure we have it for sale. Loa moly. Oh, please, take a look. No adhesive. It's got a lot of other stuff. Okay. Appreciate the business. They usually have the uh, stuff I need. You look like You've been busy, I hear. Clearing out bad guys. Yep. 18, somebody just gave me 1,800 credits. Was that the guard? 
stripping the frontier and building something for I I'm going to uh let's go to the commercial district. We're gonna have to strip it down a little bit. I didn't want to spend a lot on a ship, although I know you could buy some. But they're really expensive. And it would be just as easy for me to do uh to do that to the frontier. I don't need a massive ship or anything like that, you know what I mean? Alright, let's see here. I'm afraid low when legislative action. I'm no longer able to allocate ships. I ah. can, however, deal in general goods. Do two legislative action. Huh? Something I can do for you? Uh, yes. I hope we have what you need. I hope you do too. I don't feel like chasing it down. Beautiful. Watch there be something else I need. Well, we know she's got it. Okay. So. Oh, ammo. Oh, well. Thank you. Back to it then. Yep. Spending a good chunk of that 1800 uh, credit that somebody just randomly gave me off the street. Because that's a thing. Uh, let's just tri let's just fast travel to the lodge. A little bit easier. Can't believe I was off on adhesive by one. Sorry, Barrett. Even on my worst days, returning to this place made me feel better. really hoping for a level up, but no. We'll make do. So let's see here. Uh, my Vanguard suit. This would obviously be ballistic shielding. Can't do anything with two. Or three. Four. Definitely ballistics, because that's... Heavy shielding is fantastic when you get it. Helmet mods 3. Uh, what pack? Let's see here. Pack too, huh? Probably make it fit a lot better than storeboard ones.
Okay. So no matter what we wear now, we got a little something. I... <sighs> We're right on the cusp of having another level. Which I guess is fine. Alright. Toss in the resources. There you go. Do we need ship parts? We have one med pack. We do have 17 trauma packs. This is great. So 10% health for 3 seconds. So here's the question. Where do we put the next skill point? Um, we could do something in piloting. Because... I mean, we could do spacesuit two, right? I could do medicine. Well, we can't do medicine three. We could do astrodynamics. We could finally put it into heavy. I, I think heavy cert three, because to get that extra last bit of damage, uh, the extra ten percent. We we definitely need that. Um, and then I can start concentrate. And then I can start concentrating on things like this we need this up we need this up just a lot of stuff here in this tree so. kind of surprised you're crafting at the lodge found my OP on Bessel 3 it was a little easier to hold my mats I typically do astrodynamics is good if you want to be able to grab jump further yep well, I want to get that base damage in. Like I said, we got an extra 10%. So, like I said... Oh, here, if we go to the workbench, Let me see if I can show you this. Although, I don't know if the cutter will come up. Ah, see, there you go. So, it's rounding up. So, it's 6.7. So, you see here... 27 35.1 it, it gives you a you know to the tenth what it's really supposed to be so the cutter is actually under seven but it's telling me that it's damage is seven right here see 27 this is actually accurate this is 35 but it's actually a little more than 35 so I think that extra 10% will push us a little over seven you have persuasion not on this character no I don't want to start spreading my uh, abilities too thin uh, what I think is Barrett you're handling this whole captain thing really well you know I might have some room if you need me to carry something okay okay I cannot wait to meet him it's been ages we haven't actually talked to Sam yet. I wonder what he's like. Just go easy on him. Being interrogated by a kid ain't exactly the best way to make a first impression. I'll limit it to the really important stuff, Dad. The list does not bode well. So the list does not bode well. You must be the latest poor fool to get dragged into our dysfunctional little family. Welcome back, Wind. No. Funny story, I caught this one stealing my ship. Only reason I didn't turn her in is because we have the same last name. Dad! <laughs> All right, that's my one. Whoa, I know a few dark sides of the Aquila moons, but if you're looking for deep history lessons, well, I'm gonna fall asleep before you do. Fair Trust enough. me, don't encourage him. Goriko, by the way, hi hi. What's up, kid? Good to meet you. Nice to meet anyone brave enough to fly the frontier. Brave enough? Perfect. And you must be the new engineer. Or maybe our new gunner. Hey, don't spook our new friend. Frontier's a fine ship. Honest. Now, let's talk business. Sarah tell you about the expedition? Not really. Uh, gets me out there. Yeah, oh, that was in Freestar Collective Space. Sure enough, that's where we're heading. The three of us are heading to Aquila, for a settled planet of the Freestar Collective, and, not coincidentally, the home of their capital, Aquila City. We'll land in the city's spaceports, but the frontier is our goal. 
It's a rough country. Spawned a lot of stories. And I got a lead on the tale that um, makes me think one thing. Artifact. All right, listen, I'm still getting uh, my bearings, so let's head out later. I guess it wouldn't hurt. We just got back from a supply run anyway. I like them more than Sarah. Yeah. Alright, Barrett. We uh, we got some stuff to do. We're about to level. Let's go find Percival. Married Sarah just so she should die. She did in my first, uh, but I don't remember us. I don't remember like marrying her or anything like that. Crazy raccoon. Meet you the stars. Welcome in. Oh. Shit. I should have had them repair my ship. I think we should be okay. I know I say this. But I think we should be okay. <laughs> Maybe. Eh, not really sure. Oh, of course not. Yep, we were wanted in free star space. Oh, don't hit the grab drive. To check those bounties, yep. Back. <laughs> Welcome to UC Space. We're here. Maintain your current force while we scan slide. your ship's cargo. Scan complete. Welcome to Mars. You are clear to land at Sidonia. Should have, yep. Well, that's something else I gotta do now. Everything I didn't even out. see myself get a bounty. I'm gonna have to check in the, the menu. We also need to see a doctor. I think my second playthrough will be... Pir Pirates are fun. Crimson Fleet's amazing. Um, yo, wait a minute. I was going to say, weren't we here? Yo, yeah, we were here. Hold on a second. Oh, that's right, because we... Yeah, never mind. Okay, it's too cold. 
cold. My fingers can barely bend. It's not that bad. Oh, wow. This is the old way. Look at this. It's a huge drill. No lasers. Coming. Whoa, there he is. Yeah. If your map doesn't match up with reality, time to evacuate because Aqueous hematite, we need all the stuff that we can pick up. If it's here. Expert. Bastard. There we go. Nice. Well, that makes me feel a lot better for the last mine that we weren't able to get a bunch of the mat. Well, this must be the place. Looks like there's a light in the door, too. How charming. How charming. Come on, Barrett. I don't really see anybody here. <laughs> Hard earned debts. Uh, I'm uh, I'm here to make a delivery for an old colleague of yours, Hadrian Sanan. Hadrian sent you. Hadrian, yeah. She's did did she look okay? Uh If you consider getting gored by a terramorph and living as okay, then yeah. A terramorph. That's right. She's fortunate to be alive at all. Hope you two had plenty of backup. So what's this she had you bring all the way down here after putting you in harm's way? Uh, an anomalous terramorph sample. Specimen was found on Tau Ceti 2. Get to use our xenobiology on him. Tau Ceti? Yeah. That's a joke, right? Not a joke. There's no settlement old enough on Tau Ceti to have a terramorph. Uh, someone setting up the worst negative. petting zoo in the universe, or... <laughs> worst petting zoo in the universe. Let's get inside. I need to see these cells. Oh man, we we are gonna get the so many fucking events. Yo, let's go tag team some bitches, eh? You want you want to go tag? You didn't want to? Okay, let's go exploring some shit. That's the next best thing. Agreeable contrarian. Appreciate the follow. Welcome into the shadows. Welcome in.
Gonna ask you to not touch anything. Got some projects in the works now. I want to touch all the things. Yes. There's the oh, Red Devils. Lou mentioned how you took care of the dead. Can't say I'm thrilled the Trade Authority got their mitts on. This guy's cool too. I like this guy. I guess that's the price you pay not to live in a cave the rest of your days. Yeah, no worries. Uh, all right, you you do your thing. All queued up. Let's gaze into this abyss, shall we? I'm gonna go touch all things. Right. Just get those cellular markers tagged. Wait. Oh, wait. This this can't be right. This sample, it's Londinian. I'll I'll need to get this all in a slate. Adrian really gave you this sample. You're not lying to me. I got the if sample myself. If this was a hoax, and it'd be the best damn fake I've ever seen, I'd be mad and very, very relieved. Yeah, no. No, it's not a fake. I collected it from the Terramorph myself. Can't just humor an old man, huh? No, not this really. Sample, it's got all the indicators of the worst Terramorph attack in human history. I presume you've heard of Londinian. Uh, yep. Oh, you get... Wow, that's awesome. Blundinian at Terramorph Attacks. They were, uh... They were vigils for weeks. Doesn't ring a bell. <laughs> Let's go with this one. That's putting it mildly. The swarms are so bad, they had to blow the spaceport and seal the place off from the galaxy at large. Not a lot of samples made it off the world from the time of the attack. But the ones that did, well, they look just like this one. I didn't detect any of the telltale signatures this specimen ever sat on a ship while it was alive, either. I don't think it was transported to Talzetti. This specimen, it grew there. Faster than any Terramorph should. Which means, if we're about to start a new era in human terramorph relations, where big, sudden Londinian-style attacks can happen outside Londinian, that's not going to end well for humanity. Humanity has survived a lot, but this could be a bottleneck event for our species if we survive. And the devastation to society, to knowledge, it would reduce civilization to shambles. So you lugged this bad omen all the way here. You want to tell me what your plans are for it now? Huh. But you, uh, you said the Londini attack was massive, right? So why is one odd Terramorph so scary? Because until now, the Terramorphs that wiped out Londini and had the good sense to stay put. What happened there? It was a tragedy, but at least it was contained. So to find evidence for a similar attack on a different world, well, we don't have enough information to know precisely what this means, but I doubt it's good. So I'd love to know what it is you're planning from here. All right, well, orders were uh, to take you and the analysis back to Hadrian. She should be waiting for you at the Sixth Circle. The Circle, huh? Mm-hmm. Could use a drink. About Where do you go to clear your bounties at? I know there's like uh, kiosks that that do it, but where would like the next one be? Let's get going. Because obviously I can't uh, I can't keep flying around if I even have one. Well, I do have one, obviously. Um, yeah, it's only eight seventeen. I don't want to be blown up a ship. Uh. Easier ways to plop one down in your outpost. Yeah, that'd be great if I had an outpost. Tracker's Alliance. There's one on Sidonia too, isn't there? The Tracker. And we're already in the system. As far as I know. Let's, uh... What you got in here, buddy? Anything for me? No? Just a bunch of secure doors? Okay. Let's go back upstairs. 
this is the uh... oh yeah we'll be back here later don't worry isn't there a magazine here I could have sworn there was one in the center Maybe it's after the place gets cleaned up. I don't know. Or I'm just not going f far down enough. Uh, just go to Sidonia and clear it there. Either the tracker or the kiosk. Oh, yeah, that's right. I'm on Mars. Never mind. Thanks, Wind. There is one there, just not... Oh, okay. Yeah, there it is. UC Vanguard tactics. So I still have some ballistics. Oh, ship energy weapons. Nice. That's a little different. Okay. Beautiful. Yeah, I remember there being one here. Uh, upstairs, right? Yeah, before he said not to touch anything. Oh, that's... yeah, never mind. <laughs> Going the wrong way. Back into the HQ. Okay. Can I... can I lay in that cot? No? Let's go, boys. Coming? Yeah, we'll just... we'll head over there. Speaking of ship, where where is my ship? Nice. Okay. Let's go, we'll go to the tracker, I guess. This next part's gonna be pretty interesting. I should get a level, hopefully. And, uh, it'll go into uh, Heavy Weaponry 3. Uh, 
ever forget that you helped us finally catch that crazy bastard. Oh, so she won't clear it. Huh. Careful out there. Where was the kiosk? Now I gotta remember. I think that was outside, right? Maybe was it in here? There. There it is. In the bar. Alright, very good. No more bounty. Out of curiosity. Well then, what can I do you, you for? You got any other work? So, you're fixing to take yourself on a little bounty hunt. Well, look no further than the broken spear. The Trackers Alliance posts jobs on the mission board over there. Big old console, can't miss it. Fair enough. Now, look, much as I'm itching to get back out there and take down wanted marks on my own, I can't help you any more than that. So, don't come crying All right, so we'll, we'll check the board for that once in a while. I don't need one right now. Okay. What if we took the kids <laughs> Bye. Hope I never have to kill you. <laughs> Hope I never have to kill you. anymore major our friend here showed me your sample suffice it to say not here let's talk somewhere more private and lou said we could use the back i think there was one in the back here too i just can't remember <clears throat> gave me the abridged version of what went down. Yeah, I can't thank you enough for taking care of all that. Makes two of us. I hope it ultimately didn't end up being too much trouble. Uh Yeah, a little bit of gunfire than I usually like on my deliveries, but nothing I couldn't manage. That's well, that's certainly not what I was expecting you'd have to go through. But thank you. I'm just glad you both came through intact. So, were you two able to get that work up together? Got it right here. That sample? It's an exact match for the ones from Londinian. Londinian? That's... That's exactly what I was afraid of. Not thrilled to be the bearer of that kind of news. That's for damn sure. So tell me you've got some kind of plan for that work up. Well, right now, we've got more questions than answers. So I've been trying to figure out what it's going to take to access our old Terramorph data. Good place to start. What'd you find? It's in the archives. The Armistice archives? Doesn't that mean we'd be dealing with the Cabinet? And the yep. Freestar Collective? And House Varun somehow? Mm -hmm. Guess we can kiss that approach goodbye. I didn't think the Cabinet would be willing to hear us out either. But I called in some favors. They've agreed to hear us out on two conditions. Two One, things. They want to see this analysis you two have procured. And two, they want to discuss what happened on Tau Ceti with both of us. I'm game for that. The only ever uh, read about the cabinet in civics class. Never expect I get to talk to them. Let's go with that. It can be a daunting experience. Which is why I wanted to make sure, before you agreed to anything, we gave you the whole truth. Percival and I, we're not just researchers. We were military scientists, ran a division of the UC together that deployed aliens on the battlefield as weapons. This'll be interesting. Place I was hiding out, that was our unit's home base. After some early fits and starts at other facilities, the place eventually became the heart of UC Xeno warfare. A practice that's been banned ever since the armistice went into effect almost 20 years ago. And the UC military cut us loose for what we've done. Interesting.
I don't want to. That seems kind of rude to say that to like your past. It's none of my concern. I mean, it's not, but I mean. Out of curiosity, then. I guess, would that make you guys fugitives? UC's not going to throw me in prison for helping you out, are they? You need some time? No. We were both dismissed after the war for what we did. Just gonna grab a drink These real days quick, guys. Just concerned citizens. Concerned. With a very particular citizens. area of expertise. Our damage has been done for a long time. All right, let's see here. Well, then let's let's say that. Oh, well, that. Um, oh, I guess she liked that. That means a lot. Since we know it's her, it's not something I'm exactly proud of. We know her past, but and we're not judging her. I guess that's how she's taking that it. The UC so that's asked good thing. us to explore deploying terramorphs on the battlefield. The project never got off the ground, but the data our team gathered is now sitting in the archives, along with all the other information banned after the Colony War. Under the watchful eye of monitors from all the galactic factions still participating in regular politics. But if we can convince the cabinet to help us access that data, it'll give us the tools we need to decipher what exactly this sample might mean. And hopefully, how to prevent more attacks like the one that spawned it. That's weird. There was a fourth option here and it just disappeared. Did you guys see that? So why wouldn't the cabinet agree to help us? I mean, I hope they will, but accessing the archives, it's not 100% up to them. They'll also need the consent of the other signatories of the Colony War Armistice, the Freestar Collective and House Varun, in order to unlock it. Since neither group is exactly on great terms with the UC at the moment, for various reasons. Exactly. It's going to mean negotiations and deals and plenty of diplomatic legwork to see this through. But I don't see a better option to solving what's going on here. So it's going to be up to us to get them on board. Okay. Uh, let's go talk to the cabinet. All right. I'm going to go get this work up into the cabinet's hands. I'll meet you out so front no of bounty. New Atlantis. Good luck. You two are going to need it. Yeah. There we go. Level up. Can I, uh, can I get out of here? We just need to get the cabinet to see this for the threat it is. So, what do you think the sample matching the one from Lindinian could mean? I wish I knew. Despite the difference in scale of the two attacks, the samples having the same markers, it's too big of a red flag to ignore. But whether it's something internal to these morphs that's different, or something common in the environments, or something yeah. else completely, we can't know yet. We just need more information. That's why we need to speak to the cabinet. Gotcha. So this data we're after was banned. That's why we need all this help to get it, yeah? Exactly. To access the archives, we need to get the UC Freestar Collective and House Varun to all agree to help. And just getting the UC alone on board is going to be hard enough. Two things. I don't expect the cabinet's going to be thrilled about the prospect of rocking that diplomatic vessel. Okay. Let's take it here. So I can get out, oh, out of the way. Heavy three. Kill a hundred enemies. Beautiful. Did it go up? Nope. What's, uh, this is up to 29. It's a little over seven, I would imagine. Which, you know, it may feel like it's a wasted thing, but it's not. I wish it, uh, increased, like, pistols, but... You should give that recipe a whirl on Percival's research test. 
So what's to this? First we're gonna go to full eye. There's a laser magazine there. It's gonna help my crit chance. So I'd like to get more of the mining monthly. Uh, it's just that they're quest locked, sadly. Well, not all of them, uh, but some of them are in random locations. So, and if you look in the, if you look online, look at the guides to like where they're at. You you can see like where, um, like one's locked during one of the Reunion quest lines, pretty far in, which is really odd, but it is what it is. So. Let's go to the frontier. I was like, where the hell is my ship? What's out there? I forgot that I parked it over here. The ship's clear and the sky is calling to us. I think that makes two of the three that I need for this. I know I got the one. I may have gotten the second, so if this is the third, I'll be happy. Talk with the tech. See that huge shield? Yep. It's part of the power system. The lightning grid. provides a substantial amount of neon's energy. You should have got anything you need to offload. Sure thing. We'll get it fixed up. Good as new. Sure. How about it? here. Regenerative 10, which is solid. And max power, let's see, shield max health 420. I 
I think that's the best. Yeah, look at that. The van. Yeah, we can't even get that until I'm on a B level. Damn. But man, does it jump up in. In, uh. Shit, look at that. Vanguard Bulwark. For 40,000. Holy hell. Spending the money on this. So, let's flip you up. Pop you there. And delete you off my total. Could do anything with the helium? 200 G tank. Fuel, right? Yeah, I remember this didn't fit right for some reason. I don't know why. Like a 300 G does not fit on this ship. It's weird. Oh, maybe it does. Let's see what else we have. 400 G. There we go. That's interesting. All right. That actually looks pretty good like it does. Like that, huh? What do you guys think of the color? Switching up the frontier a little bit. Uh, that's color one. Uh, let's see. I kind of like that. My, mo my mobility's down, but eh. I'll have to get that back up to 100. Nothing fancy. Uh, yeah, we got the Vanguard grab drive. Let's try the uh, 350T reactor. Color looks good. Thank you, and what uh, what gets your mobility back up? 
out of curiosity. Is that your engine? Because, like, right now, I think this is... These are the best engines we can get. These white dwarfs. Let's see. Yeah. This is class B. I can't I can't touch these. And then the Vanguard stuff I think is below it. Nice looking color, I like that. So it's repaired. Ah, that looks good, I like that. Nice. All right. The mass slows it down, but yeah, I I think engines, but like right now my engines are kind of locked. I'm sure I could swap a few things out to. Let's let them do their jobs so we can move along. See that huge shield? It's part of the power system. Lightning provides a substantial amount of neon's energy. Cut the act. The snippers picked up the Aurora you're carrying the second you step. Oh yeah, Aurora smugglers. Definitely not me. I, I I never had a ruler on me. No, nope. not ever. All right, how much money we have? About f yeah, fifty-eight and a half. Let's check our aid here. One med pack. Wonderful. The astral. Not really. Yeah, we're down on med packs, huh? Hey there. Got the shakes, huh? Doc the Manning. Of your medical emergency. Isn't that obvious? Yeah. Haven't zoned in like a week. My whole body feels like it's. Oh my goodness. Another poor soul. All right. Tell me what happened to you. Is it an Aurora overdose? Something else, perhaps? No, no. Nah, I'm just here to purchase some medical supplies. If you're addicted to this stuff. Oh, you're certainly welcome to take a look, but I'm afraid we're dangerously low on supplies. Yeah, it's kind of unusual for a medical supply company. I can assure you it isn't by choice. You see, I'm a bit at odds with the current administrator of Neon. His drug is turning the streets into a graveyard, and he doesn't seem to care. We've argued about it on more than one occasion, and all he's done is try to persuade me to quit. Thinning out my supply chain is his newest tactic. Interesting. You ever tried taking it to a higher authority? I've spoken to the people at Reliant Medical Corporate, I've talked to the Freestar Rangers, I've even gone to the Freestar Collective Council. Every answer is always the same. We're working on it. It's corruption at the highest levels. Ugh. Damn. So aggravating. Huh. There's got to be a way to re get around the blockade. There is, actually. But it requires... outside assistance. Outside assistance, point, you say? I've resorted to asking anyone that has a ship registered outside of the Voli system to bring me medical supplies. I pay them for the supplies, of course, but... It's the only way I can sneak them past Bayou's people at the spaceport. Now, if there's anything else I can do for you, anything at all, you just let me know. I have a few items left, I think. Let's see what he's got. Uh, yeah, I need them med packs. And I'll take your trauma packs. Can I sell you anything? Did I pick up anything good? I think we're good on that. 22 trauma packs, 8 med packs. That's a lot. That's 30 in total. 
Let me look you over. Not so bad, really. I've seen worse. Not very often, though. Hold on to something. There. Good as new. Well, All right. Appreciate it, Doc you Manning. Know, remember real life. Yep. Miscreant. Speed is mostly on the reactor side. Type C or only 130 top C. What about stability? Or, I'm sorry, wait, mo mo mobility. Words of the wise? You don't want a piece of that. It's nice to see you today. Welcome to the Hotel Voli. I think you actually have to get a room for this to show up. I think you'll be pleasantly surprised that our luxury accommodations are more than reasonably priced. I hope so. Uh, what sort of luxury accommodations do you have? We have finely appointed spacious suites, all featuring fantastic amenities. Best of all, each room is security protected with an encrypted password locked door. So, you can rest easy at night. But it's neon, there's always a catch. Nope, no catch. My Lies. Hotel is completely free from administrative Mobility is engine. So Got it. Yeah, so our engines the on the frontier are not that good. <laughs> uh, what do you mean administrative influence? Well, almost every business. I'm gonna have to get up to a uh, class B. And taxes. They claim that it's because neon. So now I know where the next uh, several to region, ability points are going into. But I think you and I both know that's not true at all. Huh. Yeah, I didn't think such a business extended on this world. Indeed it does. Well, that's wonderful. And all it took was a dash of my own ingenuity to make it happen. But that's a story for another time. So, can I book you a room for the night? Yeah, I may as well. Wanna let me in on your little secret how to beat the system. Uh yeah, I need a room. I've got one with your name on it. How long are you planning on staying? Uh just a day. I have a room with your name on it. Okay. Alright, Barrett, come on. Second floor. Now, if this is here without... I only spent 300 credits, so... Oh, that's right, because this door doesn't open unless you rent the room, so... There it is. Cyber Runner 4. Adds a bankable auto-attempt for hacking. So, what do we have here? Let's, let's check this out. I thought this was something different, but I guess it's wrong. Uh, not resources. Aid. Uh, notes. So, this is Laser Weapons 5. This is Bankable. This is Bankable. That's not right. Oh, uh, Miscreant, you're going to have to... Uh, yeah, because the links are disabled in here. Uh, so maybe w uh, the wind, if she's still here, she'll be. you'll have to whisper it to her. She'll be able to post it for you. Thank you, Wind. Hey, Yuki. Welcome in. Give me one sec. Uh, this, something is wrong about this. This is not supposed to be this uh, Cyber Runner. Unless the website I'm looking at is wrong. Cyber Runner 4 specifically says the Volai Hotel. And it's Laser Weapons 5%. So the website's wrong. All right. All right, give me one second here. Let me just refresh my page. All right. Well, we we got another one. That's fine. Uh, 
We got five save. Uh, I'll sleep for three hours, I guess. You only ever need one, but. Good. You're up. Let's move. All right, let's move. Come on. Out of curiosity, what's on the third floor? Probably their room if you if you get a week, you get the room up there. Already done that. Welcome, Offworlder, to the Hotel Bola, your home away from home here on Neon. All right. Well, that was uh, less than useful. I think there's one in. Uh... James Newell better watch his back. He's causing problems. No percentage in causing problems in Neon. Ever run into spacers? I would have loved it. Now I realize how dangerous that should be. Just double check here. So I guess I guess that's either wrong or Oh boy, let me go back. Yeah, the website's got to be wrong then. That's kind of crazy. Sorry, I'm just looking at uh, what I have left here. It's probably this website. All right. Let me just check to see mining monthly what we have. Let's... All right, we've got three, six, seven, and nine. Uh, mining monthly ten is. It says inside a random science facility or deserted robotics lab. Eight is at an abandoned mine procedurally generated location. We have seven. Uh, we have six. Five is at an abandoned mine procedurally generated. Same procedurally generated location as mining monthly eight. So that's random. Four is Autonomous Dog Star Factory, procedurally generated location. We have three. Uh, two is during the key ingredient quest for Ryujin. In Karen A3. Which means I'm probably not able to access it. And... One is into the unknown at an abandoned mine. All right, so that's fine. 
Give me one sec here. Let me just refresh the page yet again. Because every time I switch and I come back, I have to I have to refresh. They don't make it easy. Uh, let's take this off. Let's take off that. It's it's one of these for Into the Unknown. Uh, I don't want to speak to Nashar in jail. All right, let's let's do it to the unknown. Let's go, Barrett. Anyway. Yeah, that does look good. Alright. Way better than the white. I am satisfied to see that you survived your most real. Hey, you might want this. Oh. What do you got? Sure. I've got a minute. Oh yeah, I do. You may as well have it now. <laughs> nice. Okay, nothing in the captain's locker because you threw it all in here. Uh, 13 ship parts, basically. Let's keep that on. Same with the helmet, huh? Yep. All right. We got enough ship parts. We should be fine. Oh, that's interesting. Yeah, it changes the color of the inside, too. That's nice. Hey, Fenrir. Welcome in. How's it going? Yeah, it definitely looks better than the white.
Yeah, I'm a guest. No. There's a science outpost. There's two of them. Abandoned maintenance bay. Let's see what this has. Win. Thank you for the shout out to Fenrir. Nice that you're still with Skyrim, Fenrir. I will eventually be uh, going back to that myself. Maybe when this build is uh, is finished. I've, uh, in my spare time, I've been slowly remodding my game, so. We shall see. Oh, yeah. You're dead. Ah! There you go. Not like you. Creatures have so much in common. Everywhere we go. Yes, we are so good. Yo, this thing wrecks now. Look at this. Oh, he's over here. See you later, turret. Oh, it just melts them. Look at that. Get wrecked. Oh my god. I can I can literally feel the difference. Which is awesome. How's it going? Still down there, Barrett? Erect. <laughs> nice. All right, I like the arc welder. All yours. Thank you. I, it's still not the best, but I mean, nah, it's not that bad. Is there somebody left? There is, isn't there? Up top, huh? Okay, let's get him. Ah, med pack. Calibrated. Demos. I'll take that. What else see you hiding in here, huh? Anything good? Anything for me?
I hear him. Ah. Aha. Damn. You're up here? No. What? I hear him. He's down here. He's in here. Of course he's in the locked door, right? All right, everything's locked up now. <laughs> uh, okay. Uh, let's see here. What about here? Yeah, maybe one there. Yeah, put that there. Yeah, I'll stick you there. You go there, and you go there. Ah, like butter. Cyberware Streetwear. I don't think I've ever seen that. Garbage. Take that. Tuh, nothing. Garbage. Take the toxin. Okay. Uh, nuclear fuel rod. I think we need that. Nice. And some metabolic cage. Wow, there is stuff all over the place. Uh, here we go. What you got? Garbage. We looted this place. Looted you. Subsurface garage. Hey, fix it. Holy you crap. Took me to an industrial facility. How you oh, been? You shouldn't have. Dude, it's been a while. What uh what's been going on with you? Somebody hit me with something. Let's go! Ah, never 
Now there's more. Yeah, it's not gonna work on me. Oh, there's, oh, there's a lot more of them. Okay. I've uh, been good. Started streaming again about two weeks. Nice. Good to hear. We were, uh, we were wondering, like, what you were up to. I was gonna, I was gonna say, yeah, it was like a while. Are they all downstairs? Likely. Huh. Yeah, I must have scared them off, right? I can identify the problem with the production line here. <laughs> what do you think, Barrett? Oh, wow. Oh, really weak, but... Go, Barrett. Come on. to just rip through these things. Whoa, hold on. We're wearing this. Incendiary Advanced Navigator Spacesuit. It's one down in physical, but it's up in everything else. Automatic Incendiary Chance to Ignite and... Uh, yeah, I think we're wearing this. Yep, new suit. So got one asshole left.
Where you at, asshole? Yeah, they're here somewhere. Uh, let's see. Had medical issues and bought a new uh, house in the countryside. Found oh. Uh, that sucks. That's awesome. Finally got settled in. That's also good. Got three acres in farm country. Nice. It's like me. It is some of the best way to live. In my opinion. Ah. Damn expert locks. Didn't you say you could like lift up the toilet seat? With what I don't Ah, there we go. You have to like run into it. <laughs> You're right. Leaving all the stuff in here. Uh, there we go. There we go. Yeah, you are. Oh, get down here, dude. He's so fucked. All right, something. Goddamn locks. <laughs> Yoink. Uh, ah, see? It's this damn novice locks. And you know what? There's not going to be anything good behind this, right? You know this. It's, it's absolutely going to suck. That's not going to work either. That might work. Or maybe this, right? Yeah, let's go there. And then... There. That works. Yeah, the novice one. See? Garbage. Garbage. Fucking hell with the locks, man. Uh, that's not for this one. How about this one and this one? There we go. Maybe over here. Beautiful. My neighbors are cows, donkeys, horses, and a lot of deer. They are some of the best neighbors. Expert. Uh, junk. 
Okay, where are we going, Barrett? Going back down here? I bet the folks who built this place wish they had invested in better security now. Well, yeah. I'm glad that people try to keep dangerous lab work outside of settlements nowadays. Alright, Joe. I appreciate you stopping in, bud. Get some rest. Hope to see you again soon. And, uh... Etc, etc, etc. Niceties, pleasantries. All the fun things. <laughs> I don't know. But I am happy you stopped it, but thank you. How do we miss this? Just sitting right here. You know, just hanging out. Yes. Probably shouldn't be in there, should I? that vein, we got that vein. Got that vein. I guess that's it. Just the stuff that's here, right? Artifact was a Zeta. Very quiet except for donkeys and friggin' roosters. <laughs> you get used to the roosters. Ugh. Let me see here. Give me a second. I'm gonna get up and stretch for a second here. That was, uh. Quite the excursion into here. Uh, 
out of curiosity, uh, actually, hold on a second. I can, I can just look real quick. It is, let's see, not even 11 o'clock my time, and I am at 9 hours 37 minutes. Seems fine. Whew. Just got to worry about my uh, left foot falling asleep. That's the other thing I need to buy when I swap this stuff over is I need to get a uh, an office chair something with proper lumbar support because these gaming chairs are not comfortable at all <laughs> okay uh, one down there buddy uh, what's the way out that one that's one we can't get for some reason, that beryllium. Oh, there we go. Fine. Okay, artifact sated down. The big question is, um, was there a magazine in here? And if so, I know I definitely missed it. Although we haven't been in the maintenance bay, so. Well, we've been on the other side of the maintenance bay. Oh, no, we've been in here. Alright, hold on, because it, he said it was during... Mining Monthly. It's in an abandoned mine. So let's go to the map. That's abandoned maintenance bay. Okay. So we're, we're, we're good. No, I'm carrying too much. So it's an abandoned mine, procedurally generated location mission. Mission into the unknown will send you to one. Okay, so that's... That's fine. Alright, I guess we're, we're carrying too much junk. Typically is the, uh, is the thing. We got a pretty damn good suit out of it though, I'd say. I have no complaints with that. I mean, doesn't... Well, it sort of matches the ship, I guess. The blue does. Hello, Captain. Better, uh, better stats than our Vanguard stuff. And it's, it's legendary. So, yeah. Sort of lucked out with that one. So, let's see. One inch punch. Modified Maelstrom. Look at that. <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> Hand loading. Volatile rounds that are designed to pack a bigger punch but aren't as stable and can fail. That doesn't sound very good. One inch punch. Rounds fire into shotgun like spread. Yeah, we're going to sell that. It's not even worth that much. This, hold on. Staggering. Small ch- oh, yeah, never mind. Um, uh, My inventory. Yeah, we got an incendiary advanced navigator. So that's actually really, really good. Uh, considering... We were rocking this with just ballistic. So I could put ballistic shielding on this and physical ballistic damage will already be over. Perfect. And we could always sell these. Look, look how much they're worth. With nothing, just the pirate stuff. S 6,000. Right? And the numbers are crappy. We're wearing that. Swapping that out. Okay. Helmet. Uh, sticking with that. 
Yeah, Vanguard stuff can all go. Cyberware streetwear. There we go, abandoned mine. Beautiful. So this should net us one of the uh, randoms that's quest generated. Landing now. I'll have to make a uh, note to look for it. <laughs> anything that helps. As life forms ourselves, is it even possible for us to feel comfort in anything but the familiarity of other life? What do you think, Barrett? Yeah, hey, it doesn't look all that abandoned. Cold native nettle. Creatures? We got some stuff here. What's this? Copper. Oh, did he take it down? Oh, dude. Nice shot. What is... Is that another one? There we go. for some wild alien pie recipe. All right. Silver Drift. Welcome in. There we got some more. All right.
Oh, these things are quick. Uh, another one. Oh yeah, here they come. Hurting. I see what you did there, Barrett. How many do we have? Let's see here. 20 of 100. Alright. That's going to take us a while to get up there. Not that we need, you know, but hey, they're, they're low level. Yo, look what they're casting. Do you see that? They're throwing the uh, little flare at me. That's kind of cool. Damn it, Barrett. Enough. Here, you take them. What's up, Trotsky? Dude, welcome. Yo, this build is starting to ramp up. We're level what? Uh, ah. Nice, neon. 16 now? What are we? Yeah, level 16. So I got four in lasers. We just got our rank three in heavy. Uh, one in astrodynamics, two in medicine. We got spacesuit design. I need to start putting some stuff here, and I also need to fill out uh, wellness because I'd like to get to rejuvenation. Um, am I still working on medicine? Oh, we've only got three left. So let's let's do this. I need to actually use some. Let's save the med packs. Let's just use a trauma pack. 
And we're also killing creatures. They just fall out of the sky. So when you kill them like that, you auto-scan them. I think that's pretty cool. I'm so used to going around with my scanner that I forget about that. Cutter damage getting better? Yeah, let me sh let me show you here. Uh, so we got Hellers. It's it's now a little over seven. Uh, I'm still using this lacerate uh, arc welder because this thing is phenomenal. You can ignore this is actually like 35. You could ignore this, or I'm sorry, this is 31. And then we swapped. So now we have an Orion instead of the uh, Equinox. This is way better, and they use the same uh, the same ammo, which is fantastic. This Orion is actually badass. I love this weapon. Uh, did not think I would like lasers this much. This arc welder is also fucking badass. Um. So yeah, this is long range. Obviously, the uh, arc welder is for like multiple enemies. Uh, but of course, we are still. It's still the uh, still the bad boy we're using. Did I see hurting? Just so much fun. I hear him. This has all the good stuff. Look at this. These are where all the good materials are. You gotta get dirty. Look at that, it just melts him. See you later. Get wrecked. Alright, we got about a thousand left. Let's do this. Let's uh let's go back to the frontier. Let's stash these uh the arc welder is like the laser shot, basically. Slice and dice. Yeah, the arc welders. They they say it's one of the worst uh, heavy weapons. I disagree. It, it's it may not be as powerful one shot as um. Oh yeah, as a lot of uh, some of the other stuff that we have, but it, it's damn good.
It is damn good. For what I'm doing with this build, anyway. Every ecosystem has its own I was going to use challenges. the Bridger. That life conquered to just exist. We should take notes. That says anomaly. Not many miners make such a dramatic career change. You ever miss it? Uh, better watch out for those. I kind of really didn't have a choice, Barrett. It was sort of your idea. <laughs> What we got here? Calibrated, uh, garbage. Also garbage. I will take those. Not garbage. All right, let's get inside before we uh, don't. Ooh, let's go over here. Fucking hell. Come on. Coming in? No? Okay. Nice. Uh, let's see here. Uh, what are we doing? Uh, not one of these. Not one of these. How about one of these? And maybe one of these? That looks right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Let's see what we got. There we go. Everything good? Yeah, some credits. Nope. Aha! Mining monthly one! Bed pack. Every time we get one of them, we get a hard save. Let's see if it bumps it up. Hillary's cutter is now still seven. We'll have to check on the bench. That's okay. There's a bunch that are quest locked, so we don't have them all. We don't have the full 20%. And trust me, you need 20%. Although we're we're halfway there, I think. I think we have five now. Let's see. No, it's uh one, two, three, four. Yeah, we have five. There are five more that are either randomly gener uh generated or quest locked. One's quest locked in Ryujin, which I mean we could do. I could I could put one into stealth and we would be okay to do that quest. Uh but I believe it's pretty far into the quest line for Ryujin. Because I remember picking it up on the last one and my first... No, I'm sorry. The last one I just did. The second sniper. So, this means that... Uh, what? 10% more. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10. And then, of course... Uh, two cyber runners. Although... This wasn't right. Cyber Runner Cipher 4, from what the website says, was supposed to be 5% more crit damage with laser weapons, but it's not. It's uh, it's another bankable auto attempt for hacking. So I, you know, is what it is. So the website's wrong. Uh, we don't need that. Do we need that? Great. Nah. No, 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 no. Magazine. We got it. Let's 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 now go find Andresia. That's what we're here for. Let's go kick some ass. Let's go pick up some copper. <laughs> God damn it. Also, if you come here, there's a shit ton of helium. All for you, just take it. Doesn't belong to anybody else. Yeah. 
Anybody up here? Come back and check that out in a minute. Uh, what do we got here? Terror Brew? Let's check out what's in here, Barrett. Come on. I did it. You finished the main quest. And what did you think? Crimson Cabin. We don't have a Tale of Two Cities. Am I missing something? Is there supposed to be something really good in here? Like a safe I can't pick? Or it sounds like... We have the books. I know we have the books. No. Okay. It's GTFO. Well, because yeah, no, I know. Trust me. Don't come any closer. I did. There's my girl. Myself. I'm with. Oh, here, my name's Quinn. I'm not here to hurt you. You are from Constellation. Yes. Vladimir said someone might be coming. Andresia, good to see you. Looking a little more. Murdery than usual, but <laughs> say they had it coming. You are the newest member, yes? She just ignores the Barrett. Didn't send you to <laughs> I love up it. On other more senior members. Uh. I'm just doing what I was asked. Dutifully following orders. I should not be frustrated with you. It is good that you have their trust. We waste time. We should complete our mission and then we can talk. Fair enough. We are here for the artifact. We should keep going. You don't want to talk? Let us talk more once our mission is complete. Okay. Always worth checking. Never know what you might find in their pockets. There we go. You're not wrong. Uh, computer, what do you have to say? Hey, update the uh, friend foe setting. Yeah. Oh, see that ecliptic there? Fry the, sh Fry the shit out of him. Are there more? Are they coming? Yeah, come find your buddy. Oh, look at that. Yeah, I get wrecked. Yeah, look at that, see? Yeah, they just fall over after the burn. <laughs> and it works with any laser weapon. Ooh. I love fighting the ecliptic. Clip dick. 
That's gonna be a thing. I think it's been a thing. Wait, two things? That's two things. All right, let's see what else they got. Hang in there. No. That, not going down there yet. Come on. Let's see what these bozos had. Uh, we'll take that. What about you, huh? Nothing. Where'd your buddy go, huh? Is he over here? Let's go up here first. No. I already have one. Okay, is this the way out? No. This is open. Sell it to the highest bidder. What the? What the? Just watch that health go slamming down there, buddy. Could do that too. Oh, am I cucumbered? God damn it. Yep. Alright, weapons. What uh, what are we losing here? Two Orions? Uh, they're actually kind of a 
expensive. Suits. Nope. Oh. Yeah, I made pick me up for this reason. And I haven't used any. There we go. Yeah, 190. Beautiful. Let's get in there and fuck them up. Look at you. Look how cute. Wrecked. Wow, Sentinel's deep seeker speed. All right, hold on. Oh, it's not as good. What's this do? Technician, acrobat, and Sentinel. Seventy percent chance to reduce damage by fifty percent while standing still. Fifty percent chance, or minus fifty percent fall damage. Minus fifteen percent damage from robots. Crap. But we'll sell it. Uh, the Vanguard is honestly my favorite. I, I'm doing uh, Vanguard and UC stuff now. Did they just throw a grenade up at you? Yes, they did, Trotsky. Yes, they did. Sorry, let me go back to chat here for a minute. Yes, they did. Uh, I am liking the Vanguard too. It's my sec probably my second next to the Ryujin quest line. Ryujin, I still think, is my favorite. Uh, but, but, the Vanguard stuff is... Uh, it's no joke. Um, and I don't want to jump down. I think there's like stuff over there for me. Probably. But uh, where are we heading to? Oh, we got to go there anyway. Yeah, why couldn't they make these veins as easy as these veins to mine? Look at this. Water's that hard? Come on, Bethesda. You could do better. I think this is the place I was telling you about where it's like you can't mine half the stuff in there. Pain in the ass. Like, what's that to? <laughs> Like, this one should be easy. Oh, there we go.
good. Artifact Iota. Gotta go prepare for stream later. Fix it. Much appreciated, buddy. Uh, fix it before you go. What are you playing? He did not respond when I called to you after you pulled out the artifact. Does that mean Barrett's theory and experience? She said I correct? pulled out. The artifact grants I always the first person out. who touches it a vision. Uh. <laughs> uh yes. Not that I've been able to make any sense of them. The fact that it has happened to both you and Barrett is already more than we had before. I think it is important that we discuss what you saw back there. That man. What I had done. Well, it was either you or him, right? It was, yes. I appreciate that you see it that way. A very practical... I mean, he was a one I find ecliptic or spacer or whatever they are. On you Skyrim as always, fix it. Nice. Very nice. Uh, well, I was a miner with Argos Extractors. Argos? Mm -hmm. I have heard of this company. Small... Reckless. Interesting. I do not have experience with this profession, but nice. I have my own experiences with... Risk. We both seem to be... Unusual additions to Constellation. Please, I would ask that you not mention to Vladimir... The, the men she killed were... The circumstances in Var which Ah, that's me. right. Yeah, because I picked the Varun the stuff off the one. That's, you're right. Have you're right. Thank you, Cyber. Me. If it is known that this has happened again, well, it has been a while since I was given an assignment on my own. I would not want it to be even longer in the future. Do you understand? I think so. Uh, Mum's the word. So they've come after you before? Yes. It would seem they have not yet learned how much it will cost them. But then that is their fundamental problem, is it not? An inability to see anything... Oh, yeah, no, I knew what you were talking about. they have created All good. for themselves. All good. I just, I figured it was just a... Just a typing thing. All good. <laughs> uh, yeah, you got it. Mum's the word. Mum? Yes. This means we are in agreement. Yes, it does. Thank you. That is good to know. I like her. She's my favorite. I will finish here By far. and return to By far my favorite. when I can. You should go now, as they will be expecting us. Okay. What do you think, Barrett? Barrett? Barrett. Did you kill Barrett? I will meet you back at the lodge. Back at the lodge. Okay. Uh, yes. Uh, we got all the stuff out of here. That's good. Well, uh, no Barret. Um. Hmm. Can we get up this way? Maybe. Am I going the wrong way? I'm probably going the wrong way. Oh, yeah, this... Find anything worth selling? There he is. Let's see what they have here. Yeah, we got him. Hey, check this out. Yeah? Check it out. What do we got? That's the same dead guy. Uh, we are going up there. I think this is the right way, yeah. And once 
me to go there. Err, no, not the right way. Let's go this way. This is where the uh, artifact was, yeah? Not a problem. Some. Let's see if I have space. I think you do. There, see? You get a lot of space on you. Well, okay then. Oh. I guess we gotta go up that way. Yeah, artifact isn't there. Alright. There is, uh, can we squeeze in? Right there. Okay. I feel like I'm missing a way to go. You got a bonus. Try this. Try this again, right? What am I missing? Takes you up, yeah. A little further. Ah, this way. Okay. Should have just done that from the beginning. Hey, put the little arrows down on the ground. We get all this? Yep. Anyway. But, uh... We got a lot of stuff to. Uh, oh, heal each. I was gonna say, I didn't think we came over here. I guess we did. Alright, that works. Who, uh, who didn't we loot here, Barrett? You see anybody? There's 
Probably one or two more, right? This guy? No, got him. They were absolutely right, two of them. Interesting. On some planets, it takes a millennia for some cave formations to grow. On others, it could. Mining operations are surprisingly easy to abandon. They need a dog meat companion that can send a check for Miss Loot, yeah. Or, you know, a space fox. Just saying. Maybe coming to Starfield. Ah, oh, really? Am I a fatty? Fine. This ship's right here. What's up, Vasco? How's it going, buddy? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Breathe in that technically suitable air. Uh, yeah? Anything I can help you with, Captain? Yeah, it's trade. Happy to help. Let's see what I've got here. Yeah, let's see what you got indeed. Those are mine. Uh, what does he use? He's been using the, uh... I don't know what he's been using. Yeah, we're gonna sell that. We're gonna sell that. We'll leave him with that, I guess. Wait. Is this all my stuff? Hold on. Uh, really? He's all right. He's got the Assassin's Beowulf. I probably should leave him with this, right? He seems to be doing fine with his own. Alright. Okay. We're good. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. We gotta go back to the lodge, so... Cat. I hope I pronounced that right. I probably didn't. Have to head off now. Get a good stretch. Vegas and th oh, you're welcome, Monica. Anytime. Get some rest, on. Huh? Definitely appreciate uh, everything uh, from today and and just being here. Speaking of stretch, there we go. Alright. You see Navy. It's nice to see you. Been busy risking your ass for total strangers, huh? Oh, that's uh Captain Myung. 
So what have you been up to? We were furloughed on New Atlantis for some R&R. &R. Just got our orders that we're shipping out. No idea exactly where. They like treating us Marines like mushrooms an awful lot. Kept in the dark and, <laughs> you know, the rest. Interesting. How about you? Uh, well... That's not really the answer, but okay. <laughs> you are giving us a run for the money. Do I have to? <sighs> Fine. Private Psy says hi. <laughs> Why don't I believe that? Decorum, Marines. <laughs> so, command signed off on our unauthorized training mission. Nice. Sadly lost some men, but training accidents happen to the best of us. That's right, training accidents. Uh, yeah, it was one hell of a training mission. Honored to go through it with you. I stand by it. You'd make a hell of a Marine. But, uh, damn proud to know you too. Command's shipping us off to parts unknown. But would you accept a final parting gift? Interesting. Would I? I mean, I'll take it, but we might bump into each other again. It's a nice thought, but the galaxy's a big place. A lot of good people owe you their lives. Maybe one day, some of us can return the favor. <clears throat> Myung out. We can't manage all this stuff. Instigating can we take a moment boosted lawgiver. No, Barrett, we can't. We're, we're going to do that back. Back where, you know. We have to add these artifacts to the collection. And, uh... We're going right to the lodge. I have a ton of stuff. <laughs> Resources and all that. We picked up a lot of stuff on this one. Funny thing is... Even being level 16 and going through this quest, I don't feel under or overpowered. Right? He does look pretty good, though. Ah, there's nothing more beautiful than seeing all those books. Sarah Morgan? Yeah, what is it? Something you need? No, no. Talk to you later. You ready, Bear? Andresia, thank goodness. We were worried. Why? Was there a concern that I would not contribute to the mission? No. God, I love of her. Not. We thought She's you awesome. Hurt. Oh, I then thank you, but it was not necessary. We succeeded. Thank you for your help before. We found the artifact. Look at you two. Two of them. I'm jealous. I tried following up on some leads myself, but came back empty-handed. They could be anywhere, can't they? Embedded in a rock or in the hands of Now, obviously, we still have Sam's to do, but... Goods, trader? Which leads were you following? A couple of scans from the eye. But it looks like you got there first. Shame on me for taking the scenic route, huh? Yeah, they really are something else, aren't they? I catch myself just staring at the collection sometimes, wondering what it all means. Maybe that's how our ancestors felt when they were looking up at the stars for the first time. They didn't just gawk at the stars, Mateo. They explored. They tested. Science brought us to space, not daydreaming. I disagree. What's the point of science if not to enable humanity's dreams? And where do those dreams come from? Not every dream is a pleasant one. I agree with Noel. The work is what moves us forward. You're with me, right? Science or dreams? Which one is the true muse of space exploration? I'm not taking sides between you two. Wait, should I?
another realist. Yeah, and Drizia likes that. Race. There we go. <laughs> the truth hurts, Mateo. Science is a scaffold for our hopes to materialize. Oh, Sarah and Can Barrett like that. Okay. Upon dreams. You know what? I just realized I completely overtook this whole conversation. This should be about you and Andresia celebrating a win for the group. So now we know what the right answer is for this part. I asked to join in a debate. It was good to hear everyone's sides. But I do agree that we accomplished something together. Thank you for your help. Uh, and for yours, I'd be happy to keep traveling with you. I have no objections. Let us see what else we can find out there. There we go. Oh, well. Pulling some interesting data from those new artifacts. Tell the Rook to meet me back on board this station. Roger that, Vladimir. He's on his way. What's up, Noel? Ah, crap. <laughs> Run key. Talk to Vladimir. We'll do that in a little bit. You went outside? Hold on. Bet you never expected to end up involved in something like this. Did you need something? Yes, of course. So what do you do with your free time? Honestly, I... I cannot answer that. So many years have been driven by survival in intense circumstances. Leisure time has... It's been in short supply. And I suppose I have conditioned myself to not think about it much. I do enjoy combat training. Though, I suppose that is hardly the answer you are looking for. You have given me something to consider. Thank you for that. <sighs> you might find it absurd, but honestly, the Lodge... I have never been surrounded by such a remarkable group of people, present company included. It has been a very long time since I have been someplace that could possibly feel like home. There are worlds beyond count out there, but that feeling is rare and precious. I have done so in the past, when necessary, but I am not the best pilot, and it seems prudent to apply my skills where they are most useful. Lately, that means aiding you. And that, I think, has worked out very well. Okay. Let's get all that out of the way. All right, then. So, let's, uh... Is that it, then? Uh, keeping her, uh, keeping her with us here. Let me go, uh... Check on this new suit here. We're gonna add some things to it, I think, if I have the, uh, materials. I know we picked up a shit ton, but... Oh, can we, uh... What level? How close to leveling are we? We're close to leveling up. Alright. Yeah, we picked up, um... What is it? This. Yeah, this is actually pretty, pretty solid. And there we go. We could add some ballistics to it to make it even better. So we take less ballistic damage. Uh, we have nothing for two yet, obviously, but we'll wind up taking. Uh... Well, we really don't need explosive. Optimized servos would be would be solid too. And then of course heavy shielding. All right, we got some stuff to sell. The Varun spacesuit. That enough. Can we make any more pick me up? I don't know. Yes. 
Anytime you can, do it. If you have them. Alright. A little bit more XP, that's fine. Still, uh, still a little on the heavy side, but that's fine. Let's go sell. And then we'll go up to the eye, we'll go chit chat with Vlad. Let's go to, uh, I guess we'll go to the well. Seems to be my, uh... Standard place to start. You guys might be right about that sit stand desk. <laughs> we'll head to the uh, to the TA first, just to see. Zoe? It's crochet, but it's true. Everything has to be my guest. Just my cat's just sitting here staring at me. Didn't realize she was even there. Okay. Let's go to weapons. We'll do them first. Actually, uh, let's go to buy. What do you have, my dear? One med pack. Do you have, you have some squall and a trauma pack. And ammo. Chris, we're going to need all you got of that. Now, we can sell. Modified Razor Bat's actually not bad. Instigating Boosted Lawgiver. I think that's what Barrett has, or was using. The one inch punch modified maelstrom. <laughs> Keeping Orion. Uh, that's actually better than this. And it weighs less. Exterminator. Okay. Uh, spacesuits. Sentinel's Deep Seeker. I don't know what I would even do with that. Like, the numbers on it are terrible. I don't know. We'll keep our Vanguard stuff. How about the packs? Any ballistic calibrated nav? Uh, no. Nope. Nope. Uh, keep the Vanguard. Uh, we'll keep all these. I should be packing them on the ship. Keep that, keep that. Okay, fine, fine, fine. Cyber... Cyberware. Fuck it, we'll get rid of that, I don't need that.
Okay. 81, almost 82,000. Hey, bear. 11 hours is nuts, so? Is it 11 hours? Hold on. I mean, 10, 14, yeah, almost. We're almost there. <laughs> Something like that. Let me, uh, let me all tab back in the game here. Uh, probably a little bit. Not too much longer. Yeah, it's midnight here for me, so... Uh, we got our carry weight down. All right. The trade authority appreciates your visit. And we could actually put that barrel knife on, even though I'm, I'll probably never use it. Um, let's throw it on three. Better than my UC cutlass. We also need to see, uh, what's his name with the surplus? He may have some ammo for me as well. And my mother wanted me to be a doctor. Bianchi, Antonio, what up, buddy? You need stuff, I need credits. It all works out. That's how it works. Take your time. I got all day. I got all day. What do you got? See, we need like a modified Orion. We need something a little bit better, a little bit better. Specialized Beowulf. Four grip with recon. La uh, too bad we're not using ballistics, but that's actually a pretty solid uh, Beowulf. All right, we'll just take the ammo. That's all we really need. Yo-ho! Welcome in, Raiders. Wow. I didn't know you were going to do that, Bear. <laughs> Much appreciated. Hold on a second. Let me... Oh, is there an ad going? <laughs> That's why I asked. Welcome in, Raiders. So I gave you like a pre uh, preemptive shout out. I had no idea. <laughs> Where are we at? Are we getting the hell out of here? Uh, we got to go back and visit uh, Vlad up at the uh, up at the eye. Still on Skyrim too, huh? Nice. Yeah, I was I was saying I'm uh, I'm slowly remodding my game. Uh, so I'll be back doing that. I'll be trying to split time between uh, a Skyrim play. I have a character in mind for that. Um, and splitting time between this build here for Starfield, which, uh, I don't know. It may or may not work. Because usually when I start playing a game, it's like I'm stuck on that. And that's, that's usually all I do. But we'll try. We'll, we'll attempt and see how it goes so we're doing this is the uh, this is the cutter uh, he's a xenobiologist but we're using uh, Heller's cutter as our main weapon and then I've got an arc welder as sort of a backup and then an Orion for you know distance but the main one the main one's this one so Good day, basic basic cutter trying to make it better and uh, yeah, so far it's kicking Terramore's ass. <laughs> Always a satisfying moment to return to your ship. Yes, yes it is. Uh, let's see who's on my crew now. I think it's still Vasco and Barrett's assigned. Okay, so that's that's good because he's starship and uh, particle beams. She's also energy. Oh boy. Well, that's a that's a good thing. We could probably switch Barrett for uh, for Sarah. I mean that would make sense, but mm -hmm. do you need something? Let's uh, let's toss the Vanguard stuff in here. Keep that. 
Okay, down to 81. It's going, yeah, it's going so good. No, these, I finished the assassin. I was done with that. Um, yeah, this guy, this guy makes use of uh, the cutter weapons, like the mining tool. It's actually pretty effective. It doesn't start out that way, but orbital pattern lock. Let's see here. All right, we're going to the eye. Travel, travel. <laughs> Let's go. I sometimes accidentally use my cutter when I forget to. Sw yeah. Yeah, it's 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 viable, but you got to do it like. A certain way. You need the eye. There's uh there's ten mining monthly magazines. And each one of them gives you a uh, grip tool uh percentage of two percent better. So, so far we have five of them. A uh, few of them are quest locked. A few of them are faction locked. What's up, Vasco? Oh, did he restock? He restocked. That lube. We have Andresia with us too, which is nice. Uh, okay. Hi. Okay, tell me I didn't... I, I definitely picked up all this stuff. Yeah, we we absolutely did. Um, but if I can get seconds, sure. Right? Like med packs? Anything for free. Uh, nothing in the shitters, huh? Okay. <laughs> Let's go into the crew quarters here. Interesting. Nah, maybe not. Maybe, uh... Maybe... I don't know. Maybe I didn't grab the stuff when I was first here. I could have sworn I did. Yeah, we definitely did. Alright, let's let's go see, uh... Vlad here. Now those artifacts aren't just blips of hope in the Blackest Sea. I found an interesting pattern. The grav anomaly generated by one of those artifacts? It matches one on another planet. A bigger one. There we go. Now we're talking. All right, point me at him. Let's go. All right, let me transfer over the data. But I need you wearing caution's boots for this one. No telling what this thing is. So find somebody named so Caution, hard. steal their boots. Got it. Going to send you the mark close as I can. But I'm having trouble pinpointing the source. You'll need to explore the area on foot. Put your scanner to work. Don't know what you'll find. Keep your eyes open. Interesting. So land near the anomaly, use my scanner. Got it. That's pretty much what it is, right? Yeah, you'd think something so big would be so easy to find. That's two things also. You're looking for the eye of the storm. Whole thing is a whirlwind. But getting to the source? Need to wear your patience thick. <laughs> Alright, so go to Procyon 3. And is coming with me. Right? What did you need? Ah. Oh. Ah. 
Yes, we're good. Come we on. Are done. We are done. Yes. Let's Captain go. Quinn. Let's go, Vasco. Any adventure you can fly away from. And then. Is, is that how the saying goes? Lay it on me. Alrighty. Just try to remember the right order I'm supposed to be doing these in. I had a certain way that I wanted to do it, so. Uh, so show me where this is on the map. Scanner anomaly, there we go. Oh, because my ship is docked. Of course. Tch! Releasing ship from dock. Okay, now show me. So yeah, you'll get to see how this sort of all works uh, using the cutter. The cutter starts off with like a, I think a damage of only three. Right, we've essentially almost doubled that. But it's the stacking fire burn that makes things, that makes it really powerful. Um, I'll show you. Let me, let me get off my ship and I'll show you. So, it, it doesn't matter. Uh, Heller's Cutter is the one that I recommend, obviously. Captain Quinn, right? you require my assistance? Now, it, it does the same damage that a regular cutter does, right? So they start at 3, but we got it up to 7. They have the same fire rate, they have the same crappy range, same accuracy. Obviously there's no ammo for this, uh, but this has disassembler, so this is 20% better against robots. And you can't put any mods on this, right? So well, the way you got to start this out is you got to get all four ranks of lasers because it's a laser weapon, right? And then you absolutely need like the build won't work without this. This is this is key rank four, right? And you can get this real early on. So start with the like I started with the xenobiologist, which started with, started me with lasers one already. So then I just needed these three, okay? Because it's a constant stream weapon, the chance that five percent chance skyrockets, absolutely skyrockets, and. It's a heavy weapon, so it benefits from heavy weapon certification, which right now I've got three ranks, right? And it's easy to kill. I mean, it's easy to rank these up. Just use, you know, this or an arc welder or, you know, any heavy weapon. Uh, but what I did is um, I specced into medicine. I specced into spacesuit design so I could start putting mods on my suits. Uh... For my ship so far, we, we really need to start working on the ship stuff, but in order to keep yourself alive in the process, I've, I'm not using anything in social, but we're going to wind up maxing out wellness. Uh, I'll probably put another one in fitness, gymnastics, and then rejuvenation, so I regen uh, health outside of combat. Um, at least three ranks. Four if I can afford it. Off for the night? Yeah, enjoy, bear. Get some rest. Appreciate you bringing everybody over. All right. So we're looking for... Not this. Yep, it's this direction. All right, so I'll, I'll 
kind of show you how this works. So see these... Now I have it focused, right? You don't have to focus it if you don't want to. I know he's level 1, but... See the health just melting away? It just it's just tearing his health down. Look at that. He's dead. <laughs> I hope wherever you store that the smell will not be an issue. And it stuns them too. That's the nice thing, is it stuns them. That's all enemies, it's you know. Oh, this temple was pretty easy to fucking find. It's a pretty planet, though. Hey! Get back here, you. Oh, he's level 10. And that's when you swap out to this one. Get wrecked, son. You got any more? No. Oh. That is go I gotta get a picture of that. That is gorgeous. Get me up here. So's that. And then, of course, I've got the Orion, which uses the same ammo as uh, my Arc Welder, which is fantastic uh, for long range. Let's see, if it's, maybe I can hit that guy. That is not that it's doing much damage to him, but see the burn? See the little threes popping off? That's the burn damage from the fire. It's a pretty it's a pretty nice build. You haven't had any issues finding the temp Yeah, they're all pretty well, the first one's the first one's solid. Uh but all you gotta do is use your use your scanner. See how So look at the ring. When the ring is freaking out like this, that's that's how you know it's the direction you need to go in. If I was facing the other way, right? The ring's not doing anything. That's how you know not to, not to go that way. So if you can't see it or it's on the other side of the planet, that's that's how you know. Let's get this guy here. Let's charge this up a little bit. Come here, big boy. dead. Now he did a decent amount of damage to me, but that's fine. God, I, I love the temples. These are one of my favorite, uh, parts of the game. Temple Ada. It's on the other side of the planet, you landing on the wrong spot. Accurate. <laughs> that is a thing. Let's see if I remember how to do this. It's been a while. We haven't done this part of the quest here. Are 
Eh. Can't miss that one. She decided to pop in too. <laughs> Wish there was more to these temples than floating around collecting stuff. Yeah. Yeah, missed opportunity. Absolutely. Yo. Alright. We got a level we got a level up here. So here is the question. I still need one more in something, whether it's boost pack training, we could do piloting two, or I could start maxing out my health, which I'm really thinking I need to. Uh, let me do this. Let's check. It's my status. We have 700 health. Max, right? So let's do this. Let me make a save. Make a hard save. We'll do a little test. Are you alright? We need to get you back to the lot. No, I'm fine. So if I put wellness three. We're almost eight hundred. Okay. Now, do you guys think I should do hold on. We should put that in wellness. Uh because it's really easy to get heal a thousand damage. I mean, that's just a couple med packs. Or trauma packs. It's not that hard. And then get it to four, and then we'll be around 850, 900. Or should I reload that save and put it into something like boost pack training two. We could go piloting two. But then, of course, the challenge is a little bit different. Um... I could do spacesuit design too, although I'm not. I'm gonna I think I'm gonna do this around like level 20. And while we could have put it into rank four here, I'm not getting any percentage increase, but it's just a gain 25 resistance while aiming down sights. I I don't really aim down with the uh, arc welder. And I don't think you can aim down. There's no down sights with the cutter. It's just focus the cutter. That's all it is. Now, if the cutter, by focusing it, counts as aiming down sights, then this would be great. I don't know if it synergizes, though. That's why I haven't taken it. Um, I'm inclined to stay with wellness. For right now because we've got three now we've got four 
now I can move on to... I could definitely put one into gymnastics. 15% uh, less fall damage is great. And it's ultimately going to get us closer to our... Let's see here. Our objective in physical is to get to rejuvenation. Right? Slowly regen health, regen health quickly, etc., etc. Okay. That's a tough that's a tough call for me. I think we'll stay with wellness. What do you think? Oh, hello. Oh. Goodbye. And there it is. And this is exactly the one that I wanted too. Let's go. I'll go, we'll go find some some dummies, and I'll show you why. Especially with the cutter, this is going to be fantastic. If they're suspended in a state of... I can't do absolute shit. Uh, I could just pelt, uh, pelt away with my, uh, with my cutter weapon. No, uh, no repercussions. I don't see any. No creatures? Weird. Do you see anything useful? Yeah, some plants. I definitely hear something. There we go. There we go. This guy's level five too. Let's let's check him out. All right, come here, buddy. Hey. Oh, look at that! Right up in the air where you can't do anything, and then he's got to get up. Not that these guys really need it, but you guys get the gist, right? Alright. No, get, get out of here. Fucking hell. <laughs> Alright, back to the frontier. Yeah, definitely a missed opportunity on Bethesda's part. Ship comforting. What do you think, Andresia? Are we good? Let's see here.
Hey, Lummox, welcome back in. What's going on? We got our first power, and it is one of the probably two, three that this character is going to use. Uh, anti gravity field. We'll probably use Alien Resurrection when I get it, because that was also part of the character's build. Because, you know, space necromancy is a thing. I am glad to be back. It will be good to have a moment to relax. Yes, yes, it will. Well, look who's here. Crix's bones. Look at you. Look at you. If you don't mind, I'm going to start doing some scans. Like, right now. You're going to we do scans? Right about the anomaly, weren't we? Tip our ears on the tail. Mm hmm. Been watching a battle tech stream. That sounds interesting. Uh. Yeah, it was a building, like a temple. An entire building generating a signature just like the artifact. Accurate. Um, Vladimir, look at these readings. Cardiovascular and neurological levels aren't in the normal range. <laughs> That's because I am more than just a mere man. Mind putting the paces to I'm a miner. <laughs> uh, use anti gravity in front of him? Oh, okay. Uh, are you guys sure? I'm going to F5 in case I fuck things up. Oh, they're immune. Everyone saw that, right? Like a little gift from the heavens. And also the most practical consequence of our little venture thus far. Got no old shipwise for this one. Going to just call weird weird. <laughs> Uh, yeah, it was the temple. It did this. So we have artifacts, a temple, and this power. All connected. But we do not understand the connections. We need additional information. Can we find more of them? Already picked one up from the scans. Matches another one of the artifacts we found. In theory, there might be one temple for each. But sifting through all the signs to identify a match is tricky. Impossible if we don't have the right artifact to compare. And even then, it takes time. Interesting. So you think there's only one temple for each artifact, yeah? It's a strong theory. Couldn't find that planetary anomaly without the data from the artifact. We'll need one to find the other. Okay. So I'll follow up on the other anomaly you found. Hopefully it's another temple. Don't think it's just fortune's laugh that this temple responded to you. The artifacts, the visions, this power you've gotten, all seems to be the same song somehow. Plenty to think about. Anyway, catch a smile out there. I'll work on finding planet anomalies that match the other artifacts we have. 400 XP. That's solid. And 11,800. I forgot about all that. We've always considered ourselves explorers. Alright, so. This is power from beyond, so. Don't worry about that for yet. We're gonna be doing eyewitness, however. But this really is uncharted. Territory, isn't it? We are going to be doing that tomorrow because it is 12:30 for me. It is almost 11 and a half hours. This is the perfect time to stop. And let me just pull up another Twitch screen here. Give me one second. Uh, I gotta say, you guys are freaking awesome today. I um, I'm still blown away with everything. I would just love to recant 
each and everything that happened. I will just say, I'll, I'll sum it up with what it tells me here. Uh, you got me to a 7% of a level 11 hype train. You are all fucking awesome. I can't really say much more than that, but thank you. Like, a genuine, like, heartfelt thank you. That was insane. Um, 4,300 bits and 75 gifted subs. You are very, very, very generous human beings. And I appreciate each and every one of you. Um, so for those of you who got a gifted sub today, uh, if you are here, just, you know, make sure to at least whisper to whoever it was, you know, a thank you. Um, well, I suppose some kind of speech is in Trotsky order. gifted a sub going to Thor. Trotsky, much appreciated, buddy. Thank you. Oh, it was insane. You had Ulfric going off, like, for 15 minutes. Probably more. Um, <laughs> uh, blew past my, uh, my sub goal. So it looks like I'm going to be getting that second monitor tomorrow now. Because <laughs> I, I need it, too, because I can't keep doing this on the phone. Uh, but, yeah, really appreciate it, you guys. Thank you, Wind. I, I, like I said, even if, like, everybody just, like, was here and, like, lurking, like, just chilling, but, like, relaxing and enjoying, like, not even talking, but just hanging out, I'd, I'd still be, I'd still be doing this because I'm having a great time. This particular character meant a lot to me because I really wanted this to work. The first time I tried doing it, um, I didn't really have them as put together. I was sort of, uh, I wanted to go into, like, diplomacy and things like that. And uh, I didn't realize the synergy with heavy weaponry. I knew it was a heavy weapon, but I didn't think that it was going to contribute as much as it did. And I was completely oblivious of the Mining Monthly magazines, which also, like I said, we've got half of them so far. We still need another five. We'll get there. Um, oh, the rig is good. I just, I just need, um, yeah, I need a small vertical monitor. Like something like maybe like 18 to 22 inches, no more than that. I can't fit it. Uh, but if I get it, if I get that standing desk that went, well, she's been after me to get one of these for like a year now, <laughs> probably longer, uh, then I will. Um, let's see who's on. Let's see. We're gonna go. Sh we're gonna go share the love today. Um, let me see who's on here. Uh, and who have I rated recently? We rated Simply Tora the last time, I believe. And she's playing Baldur's Gate 3. I don't, I typically don't raid the same person twice. Um, let me see, let me see, let me see. Actually, there's a good amount of people on. Uh... Oof. You guys can feel free to throw me suggestions, or um, there is the guide the raid uh, option if you feel like spending the channel points. The way that that works is, um, oh, you bought an adjustable desk from Costco for a little over 150. I can't stream for that long if I'm not standing my... Yeah, that's... that's I'm the exact same way too, Trotsky. And, like, honestly, with all these Starfield streams being, like, 10-plus hours... Because since, like, day one it came out, I've been 10-plus hours on Starfield. My, my shortest Starfield stream was, like, 9 hours and 20 minutes. And then the other day I did, like, 18 hours. So, yeah. Trust me, I'm feeling it. Um... I'm going to have to look into that. Uh, so, yeah, so here's the way the guide the, guide the right things work. It's only if, like, you guys use it. So whoever, it has to be the first person to use it, right, is where we're going to go. Uh, you spend the points, and 
that's where we go. It's it's a guaranteed. And if like two people throw it in, it's whichever one pops up first. And loving it. Thank yes, Wind. Absolutely loving it. Um I'll have to catch up on the next. Lumix, uh if you ever need to catch up on any of my stuff, my YouTube channel is under the exact same name, Magasady. It doesn't have nearly as many like subs, but I use it to archive everything. There's all my old Skyrim Let's Plays, tutorials, character, whatever, modding stuff, like going back to when I built my PC and started, because I started streaming on YouTube until I realized it wasn't a very good platform for me to stream on. Uh, but I have everything archived. So. Wind wants Trotsky to guide the raid. I forget what the po what are the points set to for that wind. What did I what did I I know I changed them. I think I lowered it. Uh, if you click on the channel point, Redemptions Trotsky, it should be in there. Uh, let me see if I can find it. I know I didn't take it out. Uh. So if you click on like the little Atherlore symbol there, the little looks like a cross thing. Um, yeah, it's 7,500 with the little pirate flag. I don't... Oh, hold on. Did I not see the redeem? Who'd you redeem? Wonderlust? Wind? Oh, I, I see it there. No, 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 I see it, I see it, I see it. Okay, give me one second here. All right, so Trotsky's got... We're going to Wonderlust. Uh, let me just pull Wonderlust's channel up real quick. He is playing Skyrim, so you guys are going to... You guys are going to be entertained. Wonderlust is fantastic. Wonderlust RPG, I think that's right. Bingo, there we go. All right, guys. Uh, everybody, I just want to say again, thank you for today. Was not expecting it, and you guys, like, I'm blown away with this. So, uh, we'll be back tomorrow. We're going to continue on. I'll do a little bit of inventory management in the meantime. He's doing his multiverse tonight. Oh, that's awesome. I'm going to lurk, because I'm going to eat, I'm going to lay down, but I'm going to be lurking in his, in his, uh, stream. His stuff's always entertaining. Cyber Jarl, enjoy. I appreciate you being here. Everybody else that was here, Lummox, uh, everybody. Um, but yeah, show, if you're not familiar with Wonderless, you will be. You're you're gonna absolutely love uh, his 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 content. The way that he's he's got his uh, his stream set up, you guys are gonna love it. Uh, way more. I'm I'm not I'm not a pro streamer. He's he's a pro streamer. Uh, he's really entertaining. And uh, I, I don't, I don't really need to build him up. You'll, you'll see once you get there. He's also eight followers away from his current goal. So guys, just go in there and follow him. Help him out. Uh, he's getting to 2,075. That's his goal. So I got nothing else, guys. I will hopefully see you tomorrow. Everybody enjoy your night, and I'll see you soon. Peace.